you can just offer it up to mm -hmm. the acetate nice. reference so you've yeah. got that Lovely. which will help and should we okay. use the yeah okay I'm just going to do um nice If you need to help yourself, mm -hmm. you could say hands sort of stamped first. Mm -hmm. When you go back to it, you'll say, well, which order did I do it? Okay. And then, um, Having a look at how delicate the hands are, and this is where we, we talk about art, and it is artwork. Uh, so being able to build up that image, and now we're using our masks. And then these are the masks, and I just place them. Perfect. They fit over. You'll notice that I've actually got the design the masks slightly smaller because of the halo effect that yeah. the material will yeah. have. Okay. So I try and think of all of it, you know. Nice. I'm just going to stamp the bottom of her face. Okay. Because we just want a reference of how yeah. it works. Mm -hmm. And you could have the face straight. Mm -hmm. Or you could tilt it because okay. you know the Slightly option. Slightly more whimsical, yeah. And um, and this is where having the mask so important because it gives us that layered detail. It does, and you don't have to worry about creating your own masks. Oh, so straight away. I mean, that's powerful as it is. I've got to tell you, almost half the stock <laughs> oh has gone gosh. with the hands, <laughs> and we are 14 minutes into the show. Okay. You just got one show today. Just two. The one, you've I got have two. one at two because I missed this morning's show. Not well, my fault, obviously. Yeah, of course. But I know there was we had problems <laughs> was a bit with the chaos, traffic. Yes. But here's the thing: we're having a very busy show this hour. That's amazing. I, I can't guarantee what's going to be here at two. Uh, I'm just saying. All right. Mm. So we can do the next pose. Okay. You can pick that, I the I hand like that either way. Nice. So let's try the other side uh -huh. of hand. And um, you just keep going this way so do and you fill a sheet. Do you find that you you pay particular attention to people's poses then, their hands and... You know what it is? Yeah. I reckon we see faces every day. Yeah, we do. We're so yeah, familiar yeah. with them. Our own face, our family's faces. It's but something, thing, you know, we know, yeah. I guess. But because we do see faces every day, we find that if you try to draw it yourself and you don't get it right, people instantly, they might not know what's wrong, oh, yes, but it jars, because yes. you're like, oh, you're oh, used yes, to seeing proportions look, of faces, yes. so if you do get it wrong, this is where the stamps really come into their own. Yes, and um, I find, I actually have my lips quite close to the chin mm -hmm. and the eyes, so it's not a realistic face, really. Yeah. It's quite um, stylized and a bit... Yeah. I love them. Whimsy, but um, so, and then when you move that, look so at that. It's Come just on. Instant, isn't it? <laughs> but that is, that is such a striking pose. And then when you consider that we got the hairstyles, yeah, so yes. looking it's at just this, one part. <laughs> if we then we can build up uh, any hairstyle onto that as well. Yes, yeah. That's phenomenal. I love yes. it. Should we do the next pose? Yeah, please do. Um, Hand, that one. You so yeah, you just keep going. You can fill a sheet mm -hmm. really quickly, and it's so worth doing mm -hmm. to just see how something would work. Yeah. And this changes with her eyes because it looks much more thoughtful Eyeshot, than compared yeah. to that one that was a bit cheeky, yeah, like you said. Okay. So. Yeah, but playful. Oh, playful, that was it. Yeah. Is it not the same? Yeah. Cheeky, Cheeky playful. playful. So it's quite easy to match the template up to the correct hand. Yeah. You can see instantly if it's not uh -huh. right. <clears throat> and then let's let's do a different face, shall we? Okay. Let's have this And this one. is the joy about really building on and i love the fact kim how you describe it it, it is building yes, on your yes. collection so uh you might just get one of the sets today but in the future you might invest another another and you start building up but everything's designed to mix and match yes. the hands will work with everything so i nice always night. you know strive to have it the same scale if it's yeah. all called dinky uh -huh. everything is everything dinky right, yeah. and then i have the mini see and that's so on. strong so already then. now right there that looks stunning but then yes. when you do sort of start adding hair 
into the mix. It just you really do bring it life to it. Yes, lovely. Mm. And this one, yeah. I'll show you that because it's the hand behind her chin. Okay. So lovely. We actually stamp the face first. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I've got a mask ready. <laughs> well, I tell you what, while we look for that, uh, it's yes. a good time because I I'll be honest with you, we're very busy at the moment and we need to speak to Kim. Oh, uh, so okay. what we're going to do is just going to show you a video explaining a bit about freedom and then I promise we're going to get straight back. So uh, stick with us. Here's a bit about freedom. Okie doke. Hello everyone. I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Hachanda Freedom. Did you know that with Hachanda Freedom, you could be saving on your deliveries every month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee, you will benefit from unlimited standard delivery, which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And you know the best bit, you can cancel any time. Becoming a member of Hachanda Freedom, you will also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom member discounts, where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hachanda price. Freedom members will also receive our exclusive members badge and Freedom newsletter, which will keep you updated with all the goings on behind the scenes. Just look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month. Over 10,000 of you are already members, and we thank you so much for being a part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm now going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hachanda Freedom. It's lovely because you have the special offers, don't you, that are, give you a nice discount off, sometimes up to 20%. I don't have to worry about the postage. I, I can spend a fiver on something that I've seen as and when I've seen it, or I can spend 20 or 30 or 50 pounds, it doesn't matter. I get special offers, I get special discounts, they tell me when everything's happening, so if there's a special show I want to watch, then it's there. Yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. <laughs> you see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no ongoing monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website quoting the item number 888888. So, don't forget, you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, members badge and a members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hachanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hachanda family. And you are part of that family. Look, apologies we had to flow in that VT. We just need to chat to Kim. Genuinely, we're having a really, really busy show. Look, here's the thing. So this is what we can get. At the moment, Kim will need to make calls after the show because our question from a producer, Katie, is, look, can we get a hold of more stock? That's how busy we are. Uh, Kim needs to make some calls after this show. If it goes on this show, that's it for now. We have got another show later on. If we are able to get some uh, hold of more stock, it's going to be, uh, which we can't guarantee, but if we do, it's going to be two weeks extended delivery. So if you want it now, everything at the moment is still in stock, but that's a big at the moment because it is going very, very quickly. Now, I want to show you something because this, to me, it really encapsulates what makes Kim so special and Paper Babe. It's enabling anybody to create artwork. So look, this is just on a larger scale, but what I'm about to show you will give you the face, it will give you the options with the hair and allow you to build on a system. And if I pop that down, this is what it's about because with the whole range, as long as it's dinky, everything mixes and matches. So I've got choices here. It's either your left or your right. 40% of the left and 50% of the right have gone. That's how busy we are. Not only are you getting the stamps, but you're also getting the masks to create the most powerful images. I'm going to pick these one up here just because I think they showcase. This is what I mean. I mean, could you imagine this on a piece? Now, that's just the raw image. So what are you going to be putting? Where is this going to be? What context are you going to be putting that image? But do you see how adding the hands to and the eyes, my goodness, those eyes, they're so penetrating. Uh, the hair as well, going through. And if I pop that one down, I'm going to show you another one. What I'm showing looks incredible, but this is genuinely achievable. I mean, my goodness, look, at that. are you kidding? 
they look incredible and for for 16 pounds and 23 pence being able to do this and this is the thing you're going to do it consistently uh, and you're going to create some truly magnificent inspiration so whether you like your paper crafting if you wanted to use this on home decor incredible uh, if you wanted to use it maybe uh, as a gift box putting an image on there if you wanted to use it on your scrapbook and on your journaling you've got so much flexibility and we always say the key to investing in anything is invest in something that's bit different to what you already have done don't have anything like this at home but also something that is versatile and this is the epitome of versatility right we've got two options left or right both are absolutely flying 1623 is your price 820155 your item number so Remember, with each side, uh, with each, whether it's left or right, you're getting three individual hairstyles that you can mix and match. Now we've got a flourish for you, a beautiful stamp set, uh, just taking a different artistic expression using the faces. So it works for the faces. You are getting the uh, the mask in here as well, and you can see how the mask is designed to work with all the different poses. So whether it's the left, the right, the mid, uh, all the poses will work with that mask okay you got the flourish there but then you're getting so much more if we have a look at the stamp you can appreciate what you are getting in that set so you've got those beautiful frames uh, in the flourish but then you've also got all those other stamps your worker stamps adding detail giving context uh, and just showing here some of the examples I mean look at that Ooh, think about Creating your color washes. Do you know what I'd be doing? What about adding your explosion powders, your brushos, your rainbow powders uh, into the mix as well? Have some fun. 1999 is your price, and you could be making something like. I'm just going to show you. How about that? Or what about this? I mean, that is a, such an elegant, refined card. Or maybe you want to inject some color in. Look at that, beautiful. Or finally, what about this? Okay, 19.99 is your price, and you're getting this fantastic stamp set. You're also getting the mask, uh, mask in there as well. One seven nine six seven seven, your item number. Got to move on. <laughs> Brand new. But I want to say brand new, literally just been released, and uh, over, are we approaching, sorry, 70, oh no, we're not approaching at all, we are over 70% of the stock. Look at what you are getting. Now, looking at the hands, you're like, oh, okay, but when you realize what you're able to achieve uh, with these, now you are getting the mask as well, and we saw Kim using this so powerfully. But here's the thing, because actually this, this one does it perfectly. Uh, if you like this inspiration right here, you can go to a tutorial video. So when this arrives, there's a link on the packaging. Uh, you'll see a link to the video, and you will see Kim recreating this exact inspiration that you're seeing on your screens right now. That is so powerful. Do you see how the hair, you've got the uh, hair sort of uh, over the hands, the way the hands are positioned and those arms. So, and, and that is the real key to this set because uh, Kim describes it as allowing you to really get so much more expression with the faces because you might have a face looking that way, but all of a sudden by framing, it looks like I'm, I'm doing Vogue, uh, but you really are able to get uh, so much more of a powerful image and expression from your character. For, uh, I mean, 11.24 your price for these, they are absolutely flying. Uh, 236 290, your item number. Okay, so uh, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're just going to show you some other popular items on your screen. Now, these uh, we've seen before, always a bestseller. So you've got your stamps, this is your male faces and your templates. You're getting your face stamps, you're also getting your head, torso, hairstyle, and your cap template. Uh, so 1773, your price there. 937 048, your item number. Uh, now, we've also got the profile face in the mix as well, just having a little look. 1698 your price, 318, uh, 319 your item number. But look at what you're getting in the mix. So you've got the face stamp, you're getting the crown, you're getting the hairstyle, you're getting the head, and the torso template for 1698. And it's that consistency of being able to create something that is stunning. Uh, again, you've got choices left or right. 318, 319 your item number. Okay. Okay. What are we going to be doing then, Kim? I thought I would show you the how I did yeah. this one. 
because it's yummy. Well, it is stunning. <laughs> I'll just pop that up and we can have a little look. What strikes me is how you're able to make the image pop. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this demonstration because you've brought that to life. That is ridiculous. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to use a three quarter view. Yeah. Right facing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have to tell myself. Okay. <laughs> so and do we do? Um, we put because it's interesting seeing which we put on first. The masks. So I have numbered them. Okay. To help with the process. Perfect. So yeah. number one is the mask. I've called it mask. Mm -hmm. And number two is the second step okay. after. Um, I do have instructions in there. I think okay. to help with those steps. Great. And so, I'll um, also look out for the tutorial videos with Kim as well. Oh, I flipped it over. See. Okay. I need my little thing to show that I've oh, flipped okay. it over. Sorry. See no, how it is? It's so. that fringe. Yes, yeah. okay. So and we can flip the mask over as well. Which is what I'm demonstrating now. Yeah, okay. Okay. Lovely. Right then. Where do you get your inspiration for your characters from? Um, originally, my daughter, okay. because that's when I first started drawing the characters. Yeah. And it's expanded from there, really. Uh. So, mask one. Yeah. You can draw all the way around or you can leave that open. Right. Um, you can use a pencil mm -hmm. or a pen. Because it's mylar, it's. Um, what's the word? Ink resistant. You okay, can, as you know, resist, you can wash it. Wash it. Yep. It's, it's the same material as, you know, stencils. So. Yeah. Okay. You can use it to ink around yeah. and stuff like that. So yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. So I've drawn that just mm -hmm. to show you, but I'm putting that back because we need it to mask the next step. And right. I just little bit of tape just to help me. Yeah. And then we're going to use one of the stamps. Right. Um, I'm going to use a grey tone, so it's um. A bit softer. closer to the pencil, yeah. so I find then it's quite uniform. Okay, good. That's a good tip. Yes, yeah. And this is where you can play a little bit, so you can give her a longer forehead mm -hmm. or a shorter forehead. And so if that was flipped, you can see that this part of the stamp is designed to fit. It would fit perfectly into that bit, yeah. Um, kind of. Kind of. Yeah. Ish. Okay. I think I concentrate on the eyes. Right being just under the fringe, yeah. if that helps. Okay. And then the edge just meets the edge of mm -hmm. the fringe. Yeah. And then um, Perfect. you sort of want to position it and you want to hold it a little bit yeah. because so it has to get through yeah, the layer. Through. Yeah. If only changing hair was this easy. <laughs> Can you imagine if you could just wake <laughs> up each morning like, yeah, I'm going to try Bob. <laughs> Uh, I've got to tell you, 60% of both the left, oh, 60% of the left has gone, and half of the right, so the right's not far so behind. Then wow. That's, if I move the fringe, you can really see that, that, that bit's done. <laughs> Kim, that is scarily good, how you were able to, I mean, when you're just drawing that outline, but adding the stamp, but how perfectly it marries up. Yes, yeah. Fantastic. So then, oh, you know what, I forgot, I forgot huh? to stamp her hand first. Okay. See, but well, that's all right. What we can do yeah. is just have it beside her yeah. because I've made the mistake now. That's all right. Easy to fix, yeah. and she'll still look amazing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and with regard to the hands, over eighty percent of the stock has gone. She's got a bit of a. At the moment, I'm, I'm getting a bit of a twiggy vibe. You know, sixties. Yes. So those lashes, I think, mm. isn't it? Okay. And there's another part in this stamp set, which is the arm. Oh, nice. So I'm not going to use the whole shape. No. Use that block. That's fine. I'm just going to ink the top bit. So, so it's all I've designed system. this so that you can actually really angle or mm. pose because we want to be able to. Yeah. Our wrists move that way. I suppose yeah. that's what it is. So I've done that quite straight compared mm -hmm. to the sample. So you just meet it up. Lovely. And then if you have a gap, you'll just Use your pencil it in. So okay. that's easy. Next step is the rest of her hair. We're flipping it over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and this line will match the fringe. Lovely. And um, we'll draw around it like the first step, and yeah. then we stop our stamped lines. Of course, you don't want to so go over. 
This bit though could have gone in front if I if I remembered. Yeah. It's okay. Oops. Don't worry if you move it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, if you do have any questions, we'd love to hear from you. Studio at hochanda.com. I really hope you're enjoying this hour as much as I am, though. And what I'm finding so striking is just how easy it is. It's, it, yes, I wanted it easy, really. Mm. You want to be able to take something home and say, well, I could do yes. that. But do you know what's nice? We talked about the fact that it is incredibly achievable. And you're yes. seeing it here. Just We've used uh, the mask twice, stamped the face, added the hand. Done. Yes. So I'm actually going to use the torso okay. from the portrait view, because I mix up right. all the different things, because what? I liked the shoulder shape. Yeah. But the stamp comes with, you know, if you offer it up, you can see how that pose yeah, yeah. would change. And do you know what's nice it's is, again, it's something we were talking about, the fact that the all the sets, they do work well together. Yes, yeah. So you can't see much. And I've free drawn a little bit of a swell there. Okay. If you're not confident doing that, use the template because there's a curl there. Oh yeah. So, you know, Perfect. the shape, if you think, oh yes, I can't do yeah. that shape, Kim, then just do that. So, Perfect. it's... 70% um, of the left has gone and, and then, it looks like, if we carry on at this pace, the left will <laughs> not survive the hour. Here's the thing, if, and it is an if, because we, we don't know until uh, Kim makes calls afterwards if we can get hold of more stock, but one thing you did say is if we are lucky enough to get hold of more stock, there is going to be a two-week uh, extended delivery on that. Yeah. So at the moment, if you want, it, everything is still in stock, but we're starting to get to that danger zone with the hands, we're over 80%. With the uh, left uh, face, uh, we're over 70%. So we're getting towards that limited stock, and I think both of those are in danger of selling out this hour. Wow. Okay. And then this is the last sort of part of her bunches. Uh -huh. So you just draw and stop oh. at the stamped lines. So you want that behind? Yeah. Yes. Lovely? Well, it, it makes it go behind for you yeah. straight away. Perfect. And then we just colour her in. Perfect. So That's what? what's your uh, well, for this choice one, for I'm going to use these watercolour yep. brush pens. Okay. I think you sell them online. Yep. Have a look on our website. Yeah, the Eco line. Yeah, yes. they're good. They're very good, yeah. Well, I'm just, I've only had them a week. Uh -huh. <laughs> so I'm giving them a go. Okay, how are you finding them? They are lovely, strong pigment, right? And they sort of really stain, I suppose, the paper. Good. But then, when you come in with your water brush, mm -hmm. it does move quite well. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. Perfect. But I think the paper helps because yeah. I'm using a watercolor paper. Yeah. And then. Um, the right paper, the right technique. Definitely. Beautiful. So then you can soften it. Mm -hmm. So uh, you probably want a darker colour, yeah. sort of around like the back of her ear, to okay. give that depth. That's and, a good um, nice. And then you can just wash that colour out. Just let you know that the hands have gone limited. Uh, so we're going to flash up the details for your hands. If you want to get hold of them, 11.24. have to say, for 11.24, considering the impact the hands make, uh, and look, would you want to be drawing the hands on? Could you? And this is the big thing. I personally, I'll, I'll be honest with you, <laughs> I would not be able to do that. Or if I did, it would take a long, long time. Here, just stamp on the images. We are green on the screen, though. The hands are about to go. Wow. Wow. Look at that, Kim. That's great. Oh, yes. Oh, it's a different blue on the screen, isn't it? I think it's our, monitor, well, our monitor is um, uh, It's our monitor in the studio. So I'm going to have a dark bit by her ear. Yeah. And... I'm going to cheat. I'm going to go over there because okay. it was. If you do it quite dark, you probably can hide that line yeah, a little bit. Right. And where the hair is thinner, you might want a darker piece because mm. you'll find the curl is a more dense section of hair, if yeah. that makes sense. Yeah. And also, I'm just working a little bit at a time. Mm. I'm not thinking about the whole picture, just little That's bits nice. of the hair. And it's watercolour, so. Mm. It can be a bit messy. <laughs> Do you know what that came It is so effective. Just, I mean, how long have we taken on this and what we're able to achieve? But the key to it, and this is, I think, 
one of the foundations of why I think you're having such a popular hour it is that full customization because you do not need to use this hairstyle you can make another hairstyle you can just have the bob if you wanted you can change yes, the pose you yeah. can change the hand and when that layer dries the pens are nice to add details oh, like hair detail. strands yeah. and uh, nice. that sort of thing lovely I mean just for a, a work of art what you could do in its simplest form Imagine this as a topper on a card and then just putting a sentiment. Definitely, yes. And there's a nice flourish yeah. sentiment that works quite yes. well. Yes. <laughs> and remember, we have got the sentiments, uh, so we've got the stamps. And the reason that Kim was so keen to bring you those is it suddenly gives context to all your inspirations, so using everything. And it, it taps Thank into the much. theme that we were discussing of that positivity, sort of positive affirmations and uh, positive vibes. Oh, I missed that bit of hair, look. Yeah, you're, you're a perfectionist. I know. Okay, lovely. Do you ever, I know you said your daughter was a big inspiration. How old is your daughter now? She is 11. <laughs> wow, I mean, this is something she's going to look back on. I think your mum designed, like, and I'm sure you're just going to go on and, and my and son build. was the other, the male Perfect. sort of, um, so That's yeah. a great a legacy, lucky. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and My do you little know, muses. Do you know what's nice? You can go very pretty, pretty. We can go gothic because anything you can do with makeup, you can obviously do oh, with your pens. Oh, sure, yes. Have fun with it and play. Mm -hmm. And you just can't really make a mistake because yeah. it's just a piece of paper in the end, isn't Lipstick. it? Lipstick. <laughs> because as something that Katie, our producer, she likes to wear, it's kind of a statement piece, is, is lipstick. She likes okay. coming with bright, bold lipstick. Oh, well, we, we should put some of that on, shall yeah. we? What's her favourite colour lipstick then? A uh, red. Oh, I think yeah. I've got a red. Let's go strong red. She said it's a power lippy. Power She's red. She's telling me. Right. Okay, sorry, I'm looking at the colours. <laughs> That's okay. You. Okay. Yeah. I'm just putting a bit of shadow yeah. in the recesses. Okay. I suppose all the bits of your face that poke out yeah. are lighter in colour. Of course. It's the best, okay. easiest yeah, way okay. to explain that one. <laughs> That's a so, good description. <laughs> yes. So the nose and the chin and yeah. the cheeks. Um, mm -hmm. And every object has a shadow yeah. and creates a shadow. Yeah. So um, the mm -hmm. hair there, it, it's creating a shadow across her yeah. face, as in the fringe as well. Yeah. It's going slightly yeah. heavier and then blending in. And then What's nice as well bit with blue on my brush. having that customization. So if you want to tailor this for a friend, let's say they're blonde, brunette, yes, yeah. um, whatever hairstyle, whatever colour, you can really customise to it. And you can add those little bit of detail. So what makeup uh, do they wear? Their yeah. eyes, you can, if they wear make certain shadows to their yes, eyes. Yes, yeah. So, nice. See, I think I made her a bit more pink. Mm. That's okay. And do you know what this would be oh really nice gosh, for? Oh my gosh, that's far too bright. Sorry, I'm <laughs> that in. Do you know what I'm like my niece, yes. so I'm getting her into crafting. Oh, lovely. And she loves it. Yes. I'm, I'm a, it's a campaign to get uh, my nephew and niece off their uh, tablets and their phones. Yeah. Th I'm nothing wrong with that, but I'm no, saying at times I want to get them crafting. Isn't yeah. It? yeah. So what I'd be inclined to do here is initially just start off by stamping and, and doing that template for her and then saying colour in now and let's yeah. try different things and yeah. then go on to letting her sort of create the faces and yes, stuff. Yes, yes. But I just know with my, my niece, by letting, giving her the stamped image, she's more likely to get straight to it. Yes, but this is a bit more personal, I suppose, mm. when you have actually a face and a yeah. hair. And, you know, you can... Um, am I taking ages? Sorry. No, yeah, yeah, okay. you enjoy it. We're enjoying it. Mm -hmm. So if you do have any questions or you just want to say hello, we'd love to hear from you, studio at hochanda.com. Don't be shy. If you Really, if you're sat at home and there is anything on your mind, the odds are someone just, else is having the same thought. So yes, get in touch. Yes, yes. I'll just find a, a red pen quickly. Okay. As we're doing that, just to give you a little reminder, hands are busy. Uh, we are uh, limited, but that doesn't do it justice. Super, super limited here. Uh, if you want to get hold of these, they're going to be going and they're going to be going soon. So I'm just giving you that warning right now. Uh, and also uh, the option with the faces, the left, uh, oh, left at 80% and right mm. over half the stock. So it seems that left at the moment. That's interesting. Yes, yeah. So I wonder who they might like the hairstyles. 
maybe. But the yeah. hairstyles can be used for both, yeah. so okay. just saying. <laughs> yeah, nice. So the top lip oh, yeah. is usually darker than the bottom lip okay. because it's in shadow. Nice. So. And Katie approves of your choice. Oh, good. And then yeah. I'm just going to blend the bottom oh, okay. out. I've so. got to tell you, the hands have just gone. I'm sorry. Oh, my so gosh. Hands are gone. How wonderful. What we are going to do is see what we can do for 2 o'clock. But if they are back, or if we can bring them back, they will be on two-week extended delivery. So well done. If you do have them in your basket right now, because it's a technical sellout, it means all our stocks either sold or in baskets. If it is in your basket, do make sure to check out so you don't miss out. Now, this is what I really wanted to pay particular attention to is how you're able to bring the eyes to life. I mean, so, you know, I was talking about shadow. Mm. The eyelashes create a line of shadow. So when you put that in, yeah. and we can't see it very well. Uh -huh. It's a pen teasing. I just think um, I might need a darker okay. colour, but um, you, you can build colors? up. I think it's okay. Yeah, okay. It just creates a line. Yeah. And then you want a little bit of pink in the tear duct. Right. Doesn't need to be too defined. Mm -hmm. It's, you know, soft. And then if you use the same colour, <laughs> I think it was that one, and follow the top there, it will give that depth just to the pupil colour. Oh uh, yeah. And okay. so that helps. And then when it's dry, yeah. you add the highlights and that's what okay. really And we will let that dry. But I just want to lift this one up and give you an example. Let, let's just see what we what how we achieved this. So initially we put our first mask on and it will yeah. be labelled uh, mask number one. That's just to give us the construct and where to put the face. Then we stamp the face. Then oh um, for what we should do first is put the hand in. If you want the hand so in front if you of want, the face, yeah. yes. So you can put the hand in first. Uh, and then we added that final layer with the hair and then start building up on the colour. But look at that. And there will be, viewers at home right now, this is the kind of thing you're going to be producing mm. because you can get such fantastic results and the hard work's already been done for you. So it's just going to town. Do you know what I'd say? The only thing is uh, that it will take a bit of practice, but it's worth learning the technique. It's colouring. It's a great opportunity to build it, up that it, it shadow. Is, yes. And that's what makes a difference. Yes, yes. Lovely. So okay. I just want to say I went over all my lines on the sample just with this yeah. black pen. Okay. And you can sort of add more hair then. Mm. And um, the actual template has a few lines, yeah. if that helps. Okay. And then that gives it that um, sketched look, I suppose. Yeah. Oh, which it, is quite nice. That's nice. Beautiful. If you are struggling yeah. to go over the lines, reposition the template and okay. just go over it too, because that will help. Nice. And then, um, sorry, I completely covered it with my That's hand. Right. No, 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 you had to. <laughs> so. Perfect. And it's okay if it's a little bit squiff or sketchy, and then you know. I love that. Add some lines. Yeah, Have fun with it. and um, I think the key to doing something like that, you've got to be confident with it. Don't hesitate. Don't go slow. Just literally go for it. Well, yes. But if you want to go slow, that's also okay. Because uh, there's no, no pressure. No right or wrong. Yeah. I just tend to find with that, if you do go slow, it seems a bit more stuttery. But if you want to oh, get I that see. fluid by yes. going a bit quicker, you don't I know have sometimes time to it's a bit scary, mm. but you just it gives you more fluid line. Yes. So. But like you say, there are no rights or wrongs. Very nice. Excuse me. Okay. Beautiful. What am I missing? It's quite dark. And then I've used um, this Gem jelly roll. glitter pen, yeah. and. Just added the into the I hair. did it on, and then I actually used a water brush okay. to right. cover the hair because I didn't feel like colouring it all in. Okay. <laughs> to be Works. honest, with a pen, Fair so enough. it it goes far actually. Yeah, yeah. And then um, I think the eyes might be dry enough to do a quick highlight. Okay. 
And this is what this it's worth paying attention to this bit right here because adding the highlight to the eyes what brings them to life. The eyes, when you see them, the reflection isn't a circle unless the person taking the photo used a circular shape or uh, a light. Um, so it might be a square or a line or a okay. few dots. So that's what you can play with. So I like to do a sort of a little bit of a shape there and a little line there. And you want the same on both eyes, not reflective, yeah, if that okay. makes sense. Nice. So repeat. So then you know that she's looking yeah. at you. And then I'll put highlight on her nose and her lips. But adding the white is so powerful. I love yes. that. And I might just add define yeah. uh, the top lash a little bit. So yeah, that's nice. You now you can uh, get more depth. Perfect. Beautiful. I really hope you're enjoying this oh, hour. Uh, Kim, thank you so much. Uh, it is stunning, absolutely <laughs> stunning. Uh, I tell you what we're going to do is just uh, jump onto the web and just show you some options. So have a little look. What are you going to be popping into your basket? Now, we have had sellouts. The hands, I'm afraid, have gone. Uh, we will see, because Kim will be back at 2 o'clock if we can bring it back. But if, if we can, and that is a big if, uh, we are hoping, but we just don't know until we make the calls after the show, uh, it will be on two weeks' extended delivery. And that's the same with everything. So right now, if you are watching, you couldn't have picked a better time. I'm sorry, I know the, the schedule got changed around. And just to let you know why, it's uh, where we're based, there was an accident on a major road and it's kind of put gridlock, everything's closed and it's affected. I know Kim was delayed and get, bless her, Kim drove seven hours <laughs> to get to the studio. She thought, right, I'll come in the day before, seven hours. She was 10 minutes away from the studio. How long do you think it took her to get here? 10 minutes away. Three hours. Three hours? Are you kidding? Oh. Kim. Uh, okay, so look, let's take a look here. Uh, got options. Left, we are approaching. No, limited. Whew. Okay, left option, approaching limited. Uh, if you want to go, and right at the moment is at 60%. But what you are getting, what makes this so special, you've just seen it in front of your own eyes in the previous demonstration. It's having, it's a play between the hair and the stamps. So the hair being the masks, and then you've got the stamps. And you see how uh, you've got the different faces positioned, and you've also got the torso in the mix as well. So you're able to build up that detail. So you decide which face, which torso you're going to use, and then coupled with the hair. Now, with the hair, and actually it's worth seeing the different styles. So you've got different hairstyles with different options. So this is the right option that I'm showing you right here. Now, I've got to pick up. Where this one here. This is using the right. I love this hair. Look at that. Do you know what I like about this as well? Because I think this hairstyle, you could go very sort of uh, 1920s. It could also be quite kitsch as well. So really nice there, popping that down. Uh, and then down here, we've got our left, but left is limited stock. So if you want to get hold of left, now we have officially gone green on the screen uh, with our left. And once that's gone, if we get it back, and we will be making calls at uh, the end of the show, it will be on extended delivery, okay? So we're just trying to be uh, honest. So please don't think I'm using this as a sales technique. I know it sounds very silly to tell you all we've gone, but um, we genuinely, Kim has to make the calls after the show. That's why we're conscious to say we don't want to promise we can get more stock uh, if we haven't had that confirmation. So we're just trying to be honest with you. Okay, so we got more for you. Just having a look, we got the flourishes. Uh, a third of the stock has gone here for our paper pay stamps flourishing hair. Uh, you're getting your stamp and you're getting your uh, template bundle in there. 38 stamps in total. You're getting your template, you're getting your masks for 19 99 And I think that's what we're going to have a little play we're with. We're going to have a little, yeah, yeah. play with five, that one. Five minutes. Five minutes. Let's see what we can do. Quick explanation yeah. is that each fl the three main flourishes are all numbered, okay. and they correspond with the flourishes on the template. Oh, that's that's very useful. Well, yeah, yeah you need I that. need it myself. Yeah, okay. That's what it is, yeah, really. Perfect. <laughs> so, um, nice. And you could just use one. these as flourishes. I know they're designed they're flourishes for flourishes in their own right, yeah, definitely. definitely. So, um, a block. Okay. Yeah, I'll go. Mm. I'll go with that color. Lovely. Are you having fun, Kim? Oh, of course. Good, I get to craft. Right. Hey, there we go. <laughs> okay. You can actually have quite fun with this because yeah. the hair could blow this way yeah. or that way. 
Um, if you knew this, I've done as the parting of the hair, if you uh, thought of it that way. Yeah. So you might want it left. But you might also want it central, mm -hmm. so you can think about where that's, nice. that's going, I suppose, is how the finished look of hair. Mm -hmm. It frames the face. I think that's what I was thinking. Lovely. And okay. then so I was intrigued by we'd this. use number one, okay. because we use number one stamp. Yeah. This basically goes over the oh yeah the line Lines up perfectly. so yeah. it won't match this perfectly mm -hmm. because um but just concentrate on the shape that you're creating can we say that it looks like it's matched up spot on well i'm really fussy by millimeters oh so. well, okay <laughs> i mean i'll be happy with that I think okay i'll be at home thinking nailed it <laughs> okay. and then just ink nice. the face. Great faces. If you want to secure this, you can just yeah. tape the edges here. I think I, if I was at home, I would. I know for TV we're, we're rushing you, but yeah, I would so be tempted to do that. Her face can go quite over mm -hmm. or quite in. It's while well, you play with it. You should okay. probably do a cheat sheet for this too. Okay. And then, uh, well, it's good. I think cheat sheet's a good opportunity just to get comfortable with stamps. Oh, definitely. And you know, when you get oh, at home, come so on. look at that. That's Looks like she's done. just peeking through. Yes, and then you also get the mask, so mm -hmm. if you wanted to place that there and, and ink around it. To do you know what I would do? Oh, yes. We had um, Clarity brought us a, uh, a spray, it was called Mirror Mist. Oh, lovely. And when you spray it, it creates a mirrored effect. Oh, yes. Oh, so yes. if we masked that, yes. used our Mirror Mist, that would just uh, be lovely. then it would create like a, uh, you know, the face in a mirror, sort of a, oh, a fairy yes. tale type oh, feel. Oh, yes. Very nice. It is. Oh, yeah. There totally. You go. Mirror, mirror on the wall. <laughs> so okay. there are lots of single flourishes in the set yeah. so you can add to them so it's not just that flourish it's See, that's lots, really nice and not only flourishes we've got hearts in there got hearts and we've also got cherry flowers. blossoms beautiful so you have the outline as well as the solid so, so you can we can start in. on these sort of tendrils we can start building yeah. up flowers coming yes, through so exactly. trestles and the full stamps nice block okay so yes, it's you just can build it, um, you know, and add the hand into. That's quite nice yeah. in the hair, as if it's holding the hair. That's nice. Yes. Um, oh, look at that! And this is where we get full customization. Yes, and then um, and I, the I love I, mean, I love this profound. flower. So I've got another little block. Okay, got about a minute. Have I a minute? Yes. Oh, that's loads of time. I could oh. do a whole card in that time. <laughs> <laughs> and then. Um, I've done the blossoms oh, in all nice different flower, directions, yeah. like so um, you can also mask them, but yeah. um, there's enough room oh, yeah. to make it quite and um, Before we finish, I've got to tell you that I, I did Good Morning Hi Chanda with Leonie this morning, yes. and the first thing she said to me in our change room, she said, oh, she had serious show envy. She said oh. she would love to have done this oh, show with wow. you. Yeah. <laughs> She said exactly w what we're doing today. This is kind of epitomizes what Leonie's all about with her crafting. Yes, and you can just yeah have fun and yeah. play and build and Love enjoy that. many hours. Just and yeah. you will. That's the thing. I guarantee you will enjoy it. Look, if you want to go for this stamp set, time's beaten us unfortunately. But 19.99 is your price. 38 stamps in total, but you've seen the way uh, the stamps, I mean, this set in particular works with all your faces. Have some fun with it. 19.99, you cannot go wrong. Uh, now, we will be back with Kim and Pope Babe at two o'clock. Yes. Can't wait for that. I'm here. So uh, can we follow you on social media? Yes. How do we do it? Just, uh, you can just put Paper Babe. Baby. Instagram, stamps, Facebook. Instagram and Facebook. Perfect. And Pinterest. Okay, great. And so YouTube. Look, look and out for the YouTube now. On the packaging as well, especially the, what, the image with the hands, you get to see Kim showing you how, to do, how she did that on YouTube. Thank you thank so you. much. Thank, thank you. you for thank you, everybody. Oh, I enjoyed that. Now you've got a great hour coming up. We're getting groovy with Clarity in a one-day special. After that, Paper Babe Mixed Media will return. And then we've got an hour with Avid Crafts. Lots to enjoy at Ho Chanda. Hi, I'm Hayley. Join me for some amazing Fabric Freedom shows. 
Fabric Freedom design all their fabrics here in the UK and they design them with quilters in mind so they're really good at picking out those unidirectional prints. Really nice and small prints so you can work on smaller patchwork projects and paste prints as well which is one of their signature fabrics. They do lots more fabrics besides quilting cottons so tune in to the Fabric Freedom shows here on Hachanda. Hi everyone, I'm Phil Martin. I've been paper crafting for over 20 years now. You could say it's a passion of mine. Uh, Sentimentally Yours is my award-winning brand of craft products. I design stamps, paper pads, uh, tools, embellishments, all the things that we need to help us enjoy our crafting. My aim with Sentimentally Yours is to bring unique, top quality, innovative designs for every level of crafter. So whether you are a beginner or whether you are more experienced, there will be something for you. On my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda, I will be doing my best to teach and educate you on how to get the most from the product, but always with a laugh and a giggle. Make sure you join me and tune in for my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda. I'm Ali Reeve, I'm from the company Stamps Away. Stamps Away is a family run company with my husband and I. We create all things crafty, especially with a passion for mixed media. At Stamps Away we create a lot of MDF products because we have laser cutters and router cutters. We also create our own stencils and masks. We try and make everything we can in-house so that you've got all the materials you need to create your projects. If you're watching a show with me on Hochanda, you'll expect to see lots of different techniques, lots of ways of using the products that we produce, and it's all very much mixed media, so pretty much anything goes. So I hope you won't miss the shows on Hochanda with Stamps Away. Well, hello. It's marvellous to have your company. Um, our Paul is back in the building, grooving. Do you know, the whole system is fabulous, including the name. It is. And, it's such a good name. Um, it is, because basically with the groovy system, it's all about the grooves in mm. the plates. Mm. Um, they're laser etched to a specific width and depth. Yeah. Um, so it means you're always going to get that beautiful, crisp, clean image every single time. Yeah. And, but it's, I love it because it sounds fun. It and is, then, you know, fun. you've got your groovy gang and everything, it, it's just fabulous. Yeah, I mean, on social the media, concept. on um, Facebook, we've got Groovy Worldwide, we've got Clarity Worldwide. And it's fantastic that when people get the plates mm. home and then they start playing with them and you see it on there, the design team go on there, share all their artwork on yeah. there so you can have a look, you can ask questions, yeah. all about the community. Yeah, it really, I really, really like that. Yeah. And it is so good to get all the inspiration as yeah, well. Absolutely. Um, which is fab. Now, it is our one day special, of course. We're approaching two thirds of the stock now gone. The offer will, of course, be expiring at 6 pm this evening. Now, the offer is essentially you're getting all all four plates and then you get in your beautiful vellum and it's a lovely color palette that you've put here and um, the parchments and um, so what you've got in this you've got the lighter pur purple and um, sort of a lilac if you will and then the dark purple and this goes gorgeously with the plates. I think it does I mean we've got various different colorways and mm. we've also got a pack of A4 on the yeah. um, show as well where you can sort of top up where you've got the teals and the blues and the pinks um, but I thought this color palette just worked perfectly with the designs. Yeah. So these have been designed by the lovely Lucy in the office, one of our art workers. Um, and it, I just love, so yes. the first one we're looking at here, this is the folk art flowers. And you've got all those frames, you've got all those elements. Um, stunning, isn't it? And when you look at the artwork... That is so beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So that's one. I love every single plate 
you're not just getting one image. I mean, no. there's so many images crammed on every single That's plate. Right. So the Look one we're at looking that. at now, this is the folk art heart. Yes. Um, so you can get that with the folk art flowers as a pair. Yeah. But obviously the one day special is where the savings yes, are. Absolutely. Um, and then you've got this beautiful piece wow. here by Carol, sort of soft tones, stunning. really nice and pastel. Absolutely stunning. Then moving along, the third in the collection is the folk art octagon. Beautiful. So you've got those beautiful layers, you've got the beautiful focal flower in the middle and that lovely frame around the yeah. outside. Which is exquisite and look at that. Gorgeous. This one's done by the lovely Sheila. Wow, that's amazing. Last but not least. Last but not least though, is the beautiful um, folk art garlands. So these are great because you can use them as infills, you mm. can use them to extend the flowers, um, you can create some beautiful frames. So yes, this one look here at that. by Josie. Josie's used it to infill the lovely Jane Nesterenko frame. Amazing. Yeah, these are stunning. They're stunning. Um, and they're such a good price. I mean, every single plate, it's not giving it, as we said, you're not paying for one piece of art, you're paying for multiple layers of art. Yeah. But with that, of course, comes the multiple uses. You know, every single card, every single time you use these, you will be able to get a different look because you can pull out the tiniest element. I mean, that there, you could just take that and extend that so that's a border. Yeah. You literally, every single tiny little element, you can change it. And it's interesting when you look into it, isn't it? You know, when you look at the different shapes that make up all the beautiful plates. Yeah. I love this one. Gorgeous colour. That is so isn't it? clever. I know, so using one of the borders to create like a landscape. Yeah, that was um, really good. So who did that one? Let's have a quick peek at that one. That was done by Linda Page. But it's amazing what I find also is the colours. Yes. How by either using the purple parchment, the clear parchment. Yeah. So this one's done by Chris Walker. And, and look she's at done that. like a little sampler. So you've, she's sectioned off the areas and then just sort of infilled it with the various different designs. That's fabulous, that's so bright. Gorgeous, really it nice. It really is stunning. Uh, we'll show different samples every single time. I'm gonna show this one again. I know we have shown it before, probably ever show, but it I is one of them. I think it's definitely worth showing. It's one of them, because look at that, that's the same pattern. It, that is just breathtaking. Mm. It does, that does look like kind of embroidery. Yeah, you're is it, right. Is it brocade, oh, brocade, is yeah, that what that word? Yeah, brocade, yeah. Because it's because of the texture, isn't it? Because yeah. parchment isn't flat, it's giving you that, that sort of 3D element there. And mm. it makes you, you do want to touch it. So tactile, stunning, Beautiful. absolutely stunning work. Um, okay, this is your one day special. Remember that price is gonna go up. At the moment, you are getting all your plates and you're basically getting your parchment for nothing. That's your freebie, essentially, if you're going for um, your one day special today, 519-852 is your item number. Beautiful collection. Now, that's our one day special, but we have got another bundle. Now, we haven't got much left of this. Um, you can get them in pairs, but there's no point even talking about that. Because at the end of the day, if you're going for your bundle, which is limited stock, you're basically buy, paying for four, but you're getting six delivered to your door. And these are so handy, aren't they? They are. Frames are always key to any piece of artwork you're doing because one, it can contain the area in which you work so you don't get carried away with it. Yeah. And it gives you then that guide reference on the size of card you want to make as well. Yes. Um, and what I love about this um, the collection of six plates, so this is Linda's fancy frame collection, is that you can mix and match them as well. Um, and again, this one that. here combines with Barbara's beautiful floral alphabet. Yeah. And it just adds that finishing touch to yeah. that focal point. I love it because that is so interesting. The way that's been used, it literally does look like a ribbon. When you look at it on the frame, yeah. I didn't see that. I didn't no. see the ribbon. And it's all about the white work. Now, whether you do that traditionally, by embossing or whether you use a white pencil yeah, to yeah. colour it in. That is just magnificent. And then your last ones, of course, and the last two, every single one, again, you can use in multiple mm. ways. I mean, look at that. So That's that magnificent. There, that one's done by Josie Davidson. Sheesh, um, the work. Yeah, beautiful it's grid work stunning. on there. And again, the frames are 
they they give you the the framework to work in to yes. uh, either keep yeah. the work in or obviously to work out of you yeah. know because I love things that fall out of the frame yeah. so you've come use them in so many different ways creating apertures creating mats and layers um, there's so many options I mean I showed this before but that is that and it is seriously clever yeah and Isn't it's all it? about sort of just twisting it yeah, and building yeah. up the layers. Really, really clever. Cutting into it. Now, obviously, the price of these, it's now really, really limited stock. The variations are extreme that you can create this with this gorgeous. one. Isn't that stunning? Even that white work that sort of where um, Ronk has sort of cut around the outside, oh, yeah. it just reminds me. They look like butterflies yeah. themselves, don't they? Yes, they do. Um, which really sort of ties in And it literally looks like they've been tied in the centre. Yeah. So clever. Okay, if you do want to get hold of this, it is a really good collection. You're getting two of those plates for nothing. Uh, you've got freedom, so it's not only getting two plates for nothing, but you're saving extra as well if you're a freedom member. 712-925 is your item number. Now, that's the deal. We've got another deal for you. And another one we haven't got much stock of. A so it is another one, yeah. <laughs> another one. If you want this, you need to be checking out your baskets on this one. In fact, 40% of the stock has gone. Now, the deal on this one, eight pounds you're so saving. It's three for the price of two on this. Wow. And we had these on, on Saturday um, and they completely sold out. So when I went back to the office on Monday, I checked to see what we had and we had a handful left. And I thought that these would just work beautifully um, with the uh, one day special. Yeah, the, these will go with anything. Yeah, they will. Literally and anything and everything. And when you're working with parchment, because you're working on the back, you have to spell backwards. Yes. And you have to get the positioning right. So we've got a set of three beautiful plates. You've got occasions, you've got relatives, and then the one at the bottom uh, is the calendar. Beautiful. So you can personalise for wedding invites, party invites, yeah. uh, save the day when people are born, yeah. when people, when babies are born. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. They are people. Well, you could do it for if a dog was born. <laughs> Absolutely, you exactly. could. Exactly. Yeah, um, it's not just people. No. Um, this is <laughs> this is a lovely collection. That is so handy, and yet it takes the. That isn't easy to do. It you isn't. are I've thinking. Done it so many you have times, to think about backwards. it. Backwards. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. it's a gorgeous font. It is gorgeous. I think Jim in the office designed that one. Oh, that beautiful. is really beautiful. Um, now, so basically, you're buying two of those, but you're getting three delivered to your door. Um, it is a crazy saving, another £8 saving, limited stock, though. Now, it's 992-396. That's your item number. You need to be checking your baskets out. Now, we've got a really fabulous show, but we've also got a craft along to look forward to. Um, oh, no, sorry. Finished sample, isn't it? Yeah, I started talking then the, what you said registered in my head. <laughs> uh, we've got a lovely show and we've got some beautiful finished samples to inspire you. Beautiful samples there from the team. Thank you, team. You are amazing. Um, all right, then, Wolf, what's it right, what for this hour? Well, on this one, okay. So this it's is um, a lovely one that Karen's put together for me. Um, Valentine's isn't that far around the corner. No, it um, is but not. But just this beautiful sort of anniversary card. Um, so you can see that it's using the, um, the nested heart there that's on the plate and just taking those flourishes. But That's this is beautiful. also using um, the parchment from our deal of the day. Ah, fantastic. Um, because you've got your really gorgeous strong colours. Yeah, so that's the cranberry crush behind there. 
Um, and when we look, this has all been sort of Pico cut oh, individually. Wow. Amazing. So that will that have been a hand Pico cut, yes. that one? Yep, and we're going to wow. do that in this hour. Ba, ba, ba. Yes. Um, if you want, <laughs> if you want, sorry, if you want your deal of the day, this was really busy in the first hour. Um, I love this because you've got a really, well, obviously, it's a full collection of all those colours. Those colours, I mean, look at that Gorgeous, blue. Gorgeous, absolutely cool. So you've got, this is like a sampler pack. So you've got 26 sheets in here. And normally it's a pound a sheet, so wow. 25 99 And you've got a £10 saving on this. But you've got some beautiful colours in here. You've got the periwinkle blues. This is the cranberry crush beautiful. that we're going to be using um, to make this card. Um, you've got the that beautiful green. fossil green. So it's for all year throughout. And what's nice about it, because it's a sampler, you can think, right, well, I really like that one. Yeah. And then on the website, you can then buy them in larger packs yes. as well. Yeah, and that's really good. Yeah. Because you don't, if you just, you just want a little taster, you do not want to buy a full pack. So no, that is exactly. fantastic. And it's great that you're getting a tenner off as well. Uh, if you do want the deal of the day, it is only available for 24 hours. Uh, it's or until stock last, to be fair. Uh, 706302, that's your item number. If you want to get hold of that one. Okay, so okay. a cheeky. So, where we're gonna start. so what we're going to do, um, I've, I'm not going to cut it out because people saw me earlier, if you want to see how, this is the mm. Pico dies. Beautiful. Um, and this gives us a beautiful sort of serrated edge along the outside. Um, so we've already die cut that out Wonderful. from the second largest one in and this is going to be our main focus. Yeah, okay, okay cool, the okay. outer part. Um, if you do want those dies, we have got those and they are really wonderful dies. Uh, they're on your screen. We have got circles available as well. You do get not just the actual die, but you do get the plate as well, which matches perfectly. Uh, saving £5 there, £34.98. 406851. Okay. So what the the reason we put a groovy plate with it as well was so that when it's die cut you can line up the parchment with those serrated edges. Beautiful. Okay. Because if you doing if you if you're doing if you are doing um, pico cutting traditionally, um, you'd have to have a solid line to work against right. for you to be able to perforate. So we're just gonna line that up Perfect. and get that in the right place. And then I'm just going to grab my groovy guard. Because the this groovy part. guard, essential. And this is it, your groovy guard, your tabs. I mean, you literally use them every single hour. That's right. And because one, it holds it in place. Um, but what it also does, it helps hurt, because we all have natural mm. oils in our hands. Yeah. Um, and so it just stops you getting sort of like finger marks on the parchment. Yeah, it keeps it real nice and clean and crisp. If you do happen to get um, your finger marks on the parchment, then all you need, to, as long as it's not, you haven't been eating a bag of crisps or something <laughs> yeah. and you've got that sort of one, um, then all you need to do um, is just take um, some token powder and just dust over it and that removes it. Really? Yeah, it's, I it's didn't magical know that. how it works. Yeah. Okay, that is a good tip. But not if you've been eating a bag of crisps or no. a packet of chips. Not why crafting, surely. You don't eat anything while you're crafting, do you? <laughs> Chocolate. Yes. Chocolate. Chocolate. Yeah. I mean, if I had a bag of chips now. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm hungry now. Mm, I'm hungry. Okay. So now we can see we've got Perfect. that beautiful sort of crisp white line yep. around the outside. See, there's a fingerprint there. So, Oof. But I haven't been eating anything. <laughs> <laughs> I, I promise. Um, <laughs> it wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> I, right. I did eat packets of crisps. So now what we're going to do, we're going to put the sort of the flourish frame in to create right. the background. Beautiful. So I'm going to bring my plate mate in, which is in the starter kit. Super. Okay. And then I'm going to take the heart. So this is the floral, this is the folk art heart. And we're just going to concentrate on this flourish here and the flourish at the top and the bottom. Beautiful. So this is where you become the designer and you can yeah. pick out those elements. This is why I love this system. It's so it's so fun because I like pattern building. Yeah, it's I so do. cool being able to do whatever you want. See, so we can position that into place. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to use my groovy tabs just to hold it. Wonderful. To stop it moving around. And this is one of the great things about the the plate mate is that when yeah. I've done it, I can lift it up 
Yeah, lift it up. I can check what I've done, yeah. and then I can position it back into place, Spot and it's going to line it up exactly. Yeah. So I'm just going to yeah. turn this upside down because we're just going to concentrate on this area. So obviously, spin it so it's it's actually so more, it's more comfortable. comfortable to, rather than sort of be off the edge of the table, mm. it's easier because I don't need to think about what I'm tracing out because the line art is already there. Yeah. It doesn't matter whether I go back to front, I go upside down. Yeah, it's um, literally wherever you're most comfortable. Yeah. Which is brilliant. You've got that option. Um, if you do want your starter kit, that is where you're going to get your plate, mate. Um, it's such a good starter kit. I mean, literally, you've got everything you need to get you going. It's brilliant if you're brand new to um, your groovy. If you do want to make sure that you are getting everything you need including some beautiful projects now this is the deluxe one as well yeah so, so it's kind of new and improved it isn't is, it yeah we revamped it a couple of years back um, and then we decided for the new year because there's a lot of um, new crafters out there and um, it's great after a show when we get told what's been sold yeah uh, and we hear that we sell a starter kit it's really yeah. you know, well you know someone's sort of taken that step yeah. Um, so in addition to what you got previously, you're now going to get the um, groovy tag insert plate as well. So it means that the little A6 square baby plates yeah. just fit in there straight away. Perfect. That is such a yeah good addition to the play, uh, to the actual starter kit. Starter kit is brilliant. Mm -hmm. Fifty four ninety nine. You have got your flexi as well, so you can spread the payments. Two months, uh, twenty seven pound and fifty pence. That's all it costs to uh, no new hobby. Yeah. And it's it's interesting because a lot of the things that you've got in there you're using. Yeah. You know, it's exactly. not like the the tools the inferior. are key. No, and the plate mate is mm. you mate for life really Perfect. when you're working with these designs. Now I'm just going to lift that up slightly and you can see here where I haven't completed that area there. Yeah. But I'm not worried about that because I've got my parchment attached to the plate mate. When I position that back in place, it's lined up perfectly for me to go back in and complete that. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. So we're going to turn that plate round. We'll just move our parchment from there and now we're going to go with the, the little flourishes just at the top. Ah, okay. okay. So we're going to start off by positioning that. And what I'm doing, I'm looking at um, the space either side of the parchment yeah. so that I know I'm sort of going central. OK, and I can see that's come down a little bit more. So if I line that up with the top of the heart, yeah. then what that does, it gives me a guide to show that I'm actually, I've gone on straight and it's oh, not yes. gone on wonky. And you can line it up sort of central with that as well, can't yeah. you? Because you've got a central point. So we're going to trace out the heart here, okay? Beautiful. And what I want to do, I want to move this and bring it over. So okay. now I'm going to lift that up again, and now I can decide if I stick to that line across ah. the top of the heart, and I could come over and line it up with the edge of the heart there. Perfect, yeah. Because then when I move over to the other side, then I'll know exactly where to position it. Ah, okay. okay. So again, if you jump out of the groove, like I've just done there, not it's bigger. not going to mark the parchment. Yeah, it just keeps it so controlled. And the tool that you're using, that's in the starter kit as it well, is, isn't it? It is, yeah. And what we've done now, we've numbered them. Um, so I'm using the number one ball tool. Um, and this will give you a crisp, clean um, image. Because there's no ball on the end, it goes further into the groove. Right, cool. Okay. So I'm going to repeat the same process over here. I'm lining up the top of the heart there. And then I'm lining up with that line just across there. So it's perfect. So I know then it's not going to, that one's not going to be higher than the other, yep. that one's not going to be further away. That's such a good tip. Um, if you do want to get hold of this one day, especially, it is so busy. Um, almost 70% of the stock has gone. I'm so pleased. Um, it's beautiful and there's so many options with it. Uh, £31.96 pence is your price if you want to go for your one day special stay. All those beautiful four plates together with uh, the, the wonderful parchment, uh, which works out basically the parchment is your freebie. It is indeed. 519-852 is your item okay. number. So when we turn this over now and you can see how we've now started to create yeah. just the background. Yeah. So this works perfect. I mean, if you've got the floral alphabet, you could use it with those yeah. to put someone's initials.
But the little hearts, it's just so sort of romantic, isn't it? Yeah, uh, the little hearts. I mean, if you had, say, you had a little uh, vase, you could literally fill it with little hearts. Yeah. Do you know, it's, it's one of those that straight away you start breaking it up and seeing other alternatives That's to right. it. That's I mean, you talking about a vase there, Leone. Yeah. When you look at that, yeah. you've got a little vase there. Yeah, you have. So you could yeah, you just have. trace that out and then have those flourishes yeah. coming out. Yeah, you could. Easy. You yeah, that's really as cool. As you start to play with the designs, you'll see more and more and more. Yeah. So it's a good idea that when you get them home, just trace them out. Yes. And use it as an indexing system, yeah. maybe. Yeah. Um, but when you look, for example, on this one here, you've got that beautiful frame around the outside. Yeah. You've got another frame here here. Yes, of course. You've then got that one, and that one there is the same as um, Linda's frame. Oh, right, so, that's so it'll nest perfect. So you can create the, the nesting ability on yeah. that one. Um, and again, just because the lines are there doesn't mean you have yeah. to use them. Yeah, and that's, yeah, again, because you can change that just alone can be yeah. a, a, so many different yeah. looks. I mean, if you turn it upside down, yeah. It could be like a headdress. Yes. You put some little eyes on there. Oh, yeah, that's a hair. Yeah. Or that could be the beginning of a little ladybird. Yeah. See, there's so many things. The possibilities are indeed endless. Absolutely yes, endless. Yeah, because there is little antenna. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Really, really good. Yeah. Cool. It is. It's amazing how different people see different yeah. things. Yeah, yeah. Um, so should we have a look at the um, craft along that's Let's coming up? Let's do that, oh, Paul. Uh, the craft along is amazing because with the craft along, um, you are getting two hours worth of our Barbara, um, who's going to be teaching you some wonderful, wonderful um, tricks and skills, and obviously inspiring you. If you don't know what I'm talking about, here's a little clip to tell you more. Would you like to improve your crafting techniques by watching and crafting along with your favourite Hachanda guest demonstrators or from the comfort of your own home? If the answer is yes, then we are excited to invite you to Craft Along, where you, our presenters and guests, will create an amazing array of projects throughout the year. Each month we will be bringing you a brand new kit that you can purchase on the day of each show. Or, if you pre-order your kit, you'll receive £5 off a purchase of £20 or more of any additional products featured within our Craft Along brand shop that month. So tune in, be inspired and create with Craft Along, your monthly crafting workshop. with our Miss Barbara. That's where you're going to be able to find it. Now, have a look on the website. So it's coming up on the 16th of February. You'll be able to find it under Craft Along. Add it to your basket. When you add it to your basket, that means uh, you're guaranteed to get it in time. You've got your £5 off, which you can spend again on the uh, Craft Along site. And with the kit, you are going to get the, the full shopping list of all the extra goodies that you're going to need. Uh, we don't put them in the actual kit because, let's face it, a lot of those goodies you'll already have. But at least least you'll know what to either um, get hold of or, you know, get alternatives to so you actually can craft along with our Barb. Now, it is important as well to point out, that's the kit, so you get in the stamp, you get the die, and then you get the beautiful stencil. But as part of the forget-me-nots, um, you have got one of the plates as well. There is a plate um, that actually mixes and matches perfectly, so you can buy that separately. But there's loads of goodies on there. That's some of the additional items that our Barbara will be using. In. So do have a little look and that's where you can spend that £5 voucher. Um, that is your craft along. How exciting. Um, but, but today's excitingness is our one day special. And this is indeed beautiful. The elements on this are incredible. You know, when you break it down again, you've got individual flowers. You've got individual flower heads. You've got beautiful frames. You've got, of course, that wonderful central flower. So many options there. So many use, ways of using it with um, the, the other plates that we've got on the show or, of course, with the plates that you've got at home. Um, mix and match them with each other. You know, how many possibilities can you get? You've got the corners, as we know. Corners, you can create so many different um, designs just with corners. You've got the heart, you've got that wonderful set little flower in the centre. You've then got the wonderful octagons. Now, that one, you've got corners, you've got borders, 
you've got the octagons, you've got that massive flower in the centre. I really love it. Again, breaking it down. That's, I think that's my favourite bit about this. It's breaking it down and seeing just how many elements are crammed on there. It is so clever. Last but by no means least, look at the borders. And of course, you might be doing continuous borders. You might be using these as separate elements. You might be using these for something completely different. You know, it doesn't have to be used with the plates that we've got. I mean, that beautiful border there, for me, that looks quite Christmassy could easily be Christmas. I really like that one. I just think it's extra pretty. Um, the beautiful. Shall I show you some gorgeous finished samples? Obviously, you're getting all four plates and then you're getting the parchment. The parchment is worth £10. That's what you're saving. So effectively, you're not paying for that. See, I love that. That's been extended. And then the flowers actually used as corner pieces. That beautiful frame that we've seen, of course, Linda's frame there. Another gorgeous frame. And that is so clever because you look at that and think, which plate has that come from? And that's a lovely thing because it's not obvious. It's not strikingly obvious at all. In fact, I'm going through them now. It isn't strikingly obvious. You actually have to work it out. And I actually, that one, it's that one. There you go. So it's that flower there. That's the one. I love that. Because you have to literally work it out and go, OK, where's that come from? It's just so clever. Using it with beautiful, bright papers, which do look so effective. I must admit, that's even better in real life because you can really see the white in real life. Um, I love the background papers because the background papers, they give it such a gorgeous, soft uh, tone underneath, which complements the designs and the colouring in as well. Um, so many different ways of using it, whatever skill level you're at. It might be the first time you've ever picked up the wonderful groovy system. You will be able to create something beautiful. Now, £31.96, that's your price. If you'd love to go for this today, you are saving £10. It is an incredible collection, but it is flying out the door. So if you want it, 519-852 is your item number. Now, those frames, we've been talking about the frames, they have gone. They have sold out. Well done if you got those. I mean, they do work so well with uh, your one day special. But they work with everything. But they have sold out. That is 712925. That's your item number. We have got some in pairs, though. So if you have got a favourite or if there's something you gutted you were missing out on, you have got that option. Uh, so you have got your beautiful doily frames. That's your large and your small. Fifteen pounds and ninety-eight pence. Seven three seven eight five zero. The next ones you've got, um, that one that is when it's done, it looks like a ribbon, which is amazing. Um, this is your tangled kaleidoscope and tangled twists. Uh, Fifteen pounds and ninety-eight pence. There, uh, yeah, you need to say that properly. You're teething. And then the next one. <laughs> You've got your beautiful uh, peaked corner frames and your tucked corner frames. Another one you have to be careful what you're saying. Uh, £15.98 is your price. Uh, 103142 is your item number. They are lovely. Absolutely wonderful. Um, obviously, we've got those other plates, remember, with the, um, the months, the family and the other bits. Mm, what were the other ones? Occasions. Occasions, relatives. that's the one. Uh, we've got those. You're buying two, but you're actually getting three delivered to your door. So don't forget those either. Um, right then. Okay. Next. So this is where we, we finished off. Um, yeah. Just before we went down the counter. So we're going to pop that to one side now and Beautiful. concentrate on the heart. Okay. Because what I want to do is do the tracing out first, then go and do a bit of white work, mm -hmm. and then do some pico cutting. Right, okay. okay. So we're going to pop that over to one side now. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring in the folk art heart mm -hmm. plate. I'm going to pop that in the plate, mate, from the starter kit. And I'll just use a tab just to sort of hold it in place to stop it moving around. Okay. Okay. Then what I'm going to do, where have I put that? Where have you put it? I've put it here somewhere. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Everything's so tidy and sorted. <laughs> so this is the beautiful cranberry crush. Ah, uh, yeah, that's um, That comes in the deal of the day. Wonderful. Okay. And what I love about this is that you've got that beautiful, really sort of nice sheen to it. And that's yeah. where...
the colour has been applied and then when we turn it over you can see you've got that matte finish. Yeah. Okay. So this can work in two ways. If you wanted to do, say, a beautiful frame, yeah. but you didn't want it to overpower the actual design, then what you would do is you would have the softer side facing you. Right, okay. okay. So that when you trace it out, you uh, get a, a tone on tone beautiful. raised line art. So let me just explain just what I mean on that. If I just wipe and do this corner here. Okay. Uh. So I've got the dull side facing me. Okay. Yeah, and it's then, nice to see the dull side. And then if I just take my number one two tool. Okay. And then, so you see, I'm getting the white line this side. Yeah. That is so crisp. Okay. And then when we go in, see, this is where the light panel would really help because yes. I'm using a darker colour. You can still see it pretty well, but yeah, the light panel will just make yeah, it pop, Yeah, I mean, it's it? really bright in the shido as well, so that obviously helps. Um, but you can see there, we're just following the design. Okay. Beautiful. We'll so we'll just do those little bits there. So now when I turn this over, because we're working on the dollar side, yeah. we turn it over ah. and you can see how you get so a different so. tone. I like that. So if you didn't want it to be as prominent yeah. and you just wanted it to sort of go more into the background, yeah. then you can use your parchment in that way. That looks really effective. Well. It's like that um, really sort of um, elegant embossed Ed card. Sort of, yeah. Yeah, 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 because it just looks really posh. And again, it, I'm terrible. I always, it's just so tactile. Mm, I know, it, it it's is. It's so it's tactile. Really, and it, it just shows that to get that embossed line so perfectly clear, is a skill yes. traditionally. Oh yes, um, definitely. So all the groovy play is just taking that one element of parchment mm. craft away. Yeah, yeah. Um, so it yeah. just makes it so much and more easier. And it is easier. making it easier, and it's making it more um, well accessible to so many yeah. people. I mean, we've got to say, children of five years old using the system yeah. Yeah. Um, for tracing out. Oh yeah. Then, I mean, I'm, literally any age mm. can do it. Yeah. So I'm now working on the bright side. Um, and what I'm going to do, I'm just going to um, trace out the heart okay. because this is going to be the layer underneath. Ah, uh, of course. Okay. So, so yeah, the the actual so it's a deeper, darker side. That yeah. You're so at. this is the more bright. This is the side where the colour has been applied to. Right. Where's my glue guard? That rather than use my finger. Yeah, okay. the the guard is definitely recommended if you haven't got that. Um, it's in the accessories. You've got the guard. You've got the tabs that you're seeing used a lot. Um, you're also getting twenty sheets, sheets of your parchment in that as well. I just said, wow. <laughs> so there's it. You've Pop. got that beautiful crystal. But do you know about the magic of our parchment? What's the magic? The magic that you can take the colour away. Well, we were discussing that this morning yeah. because that is so clever. Um, sorry, I didn't give you details. Did I? 211682, that's your item number for your accessory kit at the bottom right, there. Okay. See, this is magic. It is for magic. me. Because, for example, say I wanted, I've traced out that heart, yeah. okay, and maybe I want a, a purple heart or a, a yellow heart, yeah. but I want the rest of my work to have that beautiful um, cranberry crush colour. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So if I take a yellow pencil and I colour on top of the, because you apply the colour on the back, yeah. okay, so if I just put a little bit of yellow there, when I then turn that over, let's put a bit of white underneath, it hasn't really done anything, because no, we definitely can't see that on the camera. No, but no. It's, so it's got a hue, but yeah. nothing to write on about. So then what we're going to do is I'm going to grab my eraser pencil. Okay. And... Now what I can do is rub out the yellow where we've gone, because obviously oh, it's yeah. not doing anything. But then I'm also rubbing out the colour oh my of gosh. the parchment. So it literally just lifts it away. Yeah. And what kind of rubber is this? This is sort of like it's an ink eraser. And right. this is a Faber-Castell one. Um, so remember when you was at school and you was learning to type? Yes. And um, back in the old days it was a clink clunk yeah, yeah, and yeah. you made a mistake and you had the, uh, an eraser. Yeah. Clink clunk clunk. Clink clunk clunk, that, clunk, that, that were the ones yeah, before that were my typing. Well electric. Yeah. Um, or it had correction fluid. Oh wow, well, that was a dream when that first came yeah. out. See, so now when I turn that over, Boom. you can now see where we've taken that colour out. Yeah. So this would be great if you wanted to do some shading. Yeah, um, I love the way it drifts out. Yeah. 
but if I now put that yellow on top in that area because that's what we wanted to do okay when we turn it over it's now yeah. yellow yeah that is so clever okay mm. and, and it doesn't you, take long to actually rub it, it off no, either and then you can use the dorsal oil then to blend that and you'll get a yeah. more vibrant color as that well that is such a good technique isn't it, it is, yeah we like it that it just shows the real versatility of the colored parchment yeah. and you can do that on the designer parchment as well perfect so um, if you do want that parchment remember this is all part of your deal of the day all those glorious colors there saving 10 pounds this is an absolute must have especially if you haven't had uh, the parchment or if you haven't had every color in it because this will give you a lovely selection of the colors and they are all really beautiful and then obviously when you've got a favorite favorite you can buy that again yeah. if you would like to get hold of that with that 10 pound saving 706302 is your right. item number okay so that's going to be one layer on our finished card okay um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to use the same plate with a piece of clear parchment okay, okay. So I'm just using a piece of the A5 parchment that either comes with the accessories or it comes in the starter kit. Okay. And of course, with the um, with the starter kit, that's where you get your plate mate as well. So if you do want that starter kit, it, I mean, it, this is where you're getting the, the stylus that Paul's using, the mat that Paul's working on. You know, the, it is quite incredible, the starter kit, because you've got so many bits in there, elements in there, that will, you will definitely use over and over again. Um, and your first payment is £27.50. Second payment, exactly the same after. Um, 946594, that's your item number. Right then, our Paul. Okay, so what we're doing, we're putting the flower in the middle, but I've got options. Again, I could have used the other flower. Just because yeah. this flower's in this heart doesn't necessarily mean that I've got to go with that flower. Yeah. Um, and again, I can decide whether I want to put these stripes in um, or whether I want to infill with a different design. Yeah. See, I may want to infill it with all those little dots. Yeah. Or in the 9 o'clock show, I showed you how you could use the basic piercing grids to infill as well. Yeah. Okay. And that's you've got so many so many choices and i love it because as soon as you start plating you know when you look at your your plates and you think oh i wonder what that look like in there yeah. you know because you have got loads of different dots you've got flowers and you could put exactly. flowers in flowers and so at the end of the day it's a piece of parchment absolutely so if you do something and you if you embossed it out and you think mm, i don't, don't really like, like that mm. just pop it to one side because you may find a use for it yeah so if i just take the basic grids just to show you what you could do with this so we'll lift that off even though I've put those lines in okay and we've got those on the show I think they're uh, I can't remember what the price is off the top of my head the um, prices are just there so you're getting two of your basic grids for 23 pounds and 98 pence so you're getting the straight one and you're getting the diagonal one that's right isn't it it is yay yeah. See, um, so yeah, Sorry, go on. For, um, 895930. So, the, a technique that Barb came up with if I press there, I can turn the parchment and then you sort of turn it until you find the next one, and you can create sort of a curved line just by turning the parchment so That's that it so fills clever. in. You and see. you're sussing out because you can see where your next light, the hole yeah. is. So, you're so sussing when we turn out. That over, you can then add a little bit more That's detail. That's so effective, okay. isn't it? And for that, you use the number two tool right. that comes in the starter kit, or if Perfect. you've got the Pergamano tool, it'll be the 1.5. Right, because smashing. Because if you go any smaller than that, what can happen is that you can puncture it, and you don't right. want to do that. Yeah. For this. yeah, that's brilliant. Again, the number two tool, that is in the starter kit. You know, the tools that, that Paul's using are in the starter kit, along with the plate, mate, along with the plate. The black mat, the black mat. and you get four plates in there as well. Um, so, yeah, so the, the new plate is the one at the bottom left on the screen, underneath yep. the black mat and the plate, mate. So that's the groovy inset with the tags and the ovals on. So they're great because you can put the alphabet that's on the plate mate in yeah. there. So yeah. it's all about the personalization. And the alphabet itself, I mean, we don't even talk about that, but that's no. such a good alphabet. It is. It's all about the sort of right, the personalization. You've yeah. got the uppercase and the lowercase. You've got the letterboxes down the right hand side of it. 
Um, you've got the ordinals on there, you've got the ambassands on there, you've got the apps so you can personalise for yeah. emails and stuff like that. Yeah, no, um, it's real handy. And then you've got the two tools there, you've got the tumble dry sheet, um, and then you've got the nested squares, the trees, and the um, landscape plates as That's well. beautiful, absolutely beautiful. That is such a good starter kit. Um, honestly, it's one of those that's so comprehensive. You know, value for money, and so and it's value for money because you're still using the product yeah. and years and years great after. Great about it is that when Barbara was putting the start kit together, she knows as a crafter, you'll see something in a shop or on the TV, mm. and you get it home, and then it says, right, you now need this, you now yeah, need that. Yeah, it's so annoying. And then, and then you go, oh, I want to start it. So yeah. you've literally got everything in there. The only Brilliant. thing you need to add. It's colouring pencils or pens. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. And if that's only to, if you want to do that. If you that. want to, you don't have yeah. to. Yeah. And that's it. Initially, you don't mm. need to. Um, you can add that to your Flexi if you are going um, for your one day special. No, you start. <laughs> Did I say add it in? It's Flexi. It's got its own Flexi. Um, 946 594 is your item number. Two payments, £27.50. and fifty pence. That's all you need to pay for that. And we've had an email in. Have we? Oh, lovely Maria. Hello, Hi, Maria. my love. She said, thank you, Paul, for covering my shows. Oh, it's a pleasure. Oh, Maria. She said she's a bit jealous. I was oh. not surprised. Maria did two lovely demos for me to help, because obviously... Um, she's had an operation on her arm. Ah, right, um, so okay. it's the travelling and the driving. Yep, yep. Um, so I asked Maria and Karen to help out. Um, and um, so Maria did two and Karen did some um, just to help me yes. out, really. Yep. Because it does take time. Yeah, oh, yeah, it yep. really and does. And Maria will be back on the screens in February. Oh, fabulous. So. Maria, get well soon. I hope you're, I hope you're not getting too bored. <laughs> I, it sounds like it's like, oh, I want to go back. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we miss you, Maria, and get well soon. Just take care. Okay, our lovely Paul. Okay. Next. So, what I'm going to do on this one, because I've got one that I've already pre coloured in. Okay, I just want to put a little bit of colour on here just to show how you can sort of build up that colour. Beautiful. So say for example, um, I want to put sort of, turn this one sort of a yellow or an orange. So I'm using the um, Pergoliner pencils. Beautiful. And you're working from the back again, I'm working you? on the back. And the reason I'm working on the back is because I've got more protection. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because if I was working on the front, because we've pushed through, uh, the fibres are porous yeah, yeah. on the parchment. So if you touch it, that white line will no longer be white. Of course. Um, yeah, yeah. Whereas on the back, the magic of the parchment, um, is sort of, it protects it and it will always give you that white line at the front. Beautiful. So it will stay really nice and yeah. crisp. And that's what you want, isn't it? You want that, that, that pop that again. That crispiness of it. Now, um, this is the nice I bit. Love it this. smells I love so it. good, does the door so oil? It smells oranges. Oh, it's lush. And you only put, I mean, the door so oil must last years. It can do, yeah, as long as you put the lid back on. I'm just trying to find a clean lid. Oh, yeah. Put Otherwise. the lid back on so it doesn't evaporate. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And because we're using the blending pens, and they were really busy in the last hour, um, so you've got a really top quality nib on there. What yeah. you don't want to do is push into that oil. Right. Because if you push in, the quality of the nibs draws up all that right. oil. Right. And when I go on there, it's going to take it all off. Okay. So all you're going to do, I'll get the camera ready, there we go. One, two, three. That's <laughs> it. Okay. So you wouldn't think that had done no. anything no. every time. But now... Wow. Look how much is coming off. Yeah, it's ridiculous. And you'll get to learn how much to take off. So, so you will want, you do want to take some off then. You don't want you to do. go straight in with that. No, because what will happen is it will, all it will do is it will just move it around yeah. and take the colour off. Right, okay. Um, if it does that, can you let it dry and just do another yeah, layer? Yeah, you can go back on, yeah. So, right. so, so you'll, it took me a while to work out how, what was happening and then yeah. realised if I took some off, um, and then I'm just using the nibs just to gently blend that colour in. Beautiful. Those nibs are fab. You're getting loads of nibs you do, as well. You get 23 See, nibs. Wow. So it means you can literally have like one nib for every colour. Yeah, and what you could do, you could have, um, you can get refills um, and you could have some just for your ink pads. Yes. So keep some for your oil pencils. Some for your watercolour pencils, some yeah. for your ink pads. Yeah, it's such a good idea. Um, they're always really popular at blending pens because there is so much you can do with them. And it's such a good price. 
12 pound and 43 pence so you get your pen you get all those nibs and you get the tweezers to get the nib out of um, and of course you've got to be able to reuse those nibs I mean that's the thing isn't it you're gonna be able to use them again and again, again and, and again. again yeah uh, 12 pounds and 43 pence 781285 okay so then all I've done I've just put a tiny little bit of red just at the bottom of that flower beautiful not much and I'm not putting pressure on when I'm putting the, the pencil on and then I'm just going to pick up a little bit of oil, just test over here. Okay, okay. And you can see that how much is just yeah. by doing that. And then I'm just going to draw that colour up. And you get a really nice sort of... Maria, um, on one of the demos, I think I did it in the 9 o'clock last night. Yeah. Um, and Maria had done red and then a little bit of black. Oh, wow. And it added real depth to it. Yeah, we'll that's a good idea. find it when samples, because it's in the pile of samples. Okay, I won't trust um, it. Yeah, that is such now a good idea. how that just goes around. So Look at that. that. Some white underneath. There we go. Boom. You can see. Yeah. I, I could put the red at the top to bring it yes. in to add light and shade. Yep. And that gives it even more like dimension, doesn't it? It does, yeah. That like you can really play with your colours. You want those blending tools. 781 285, that's your item number. Um, it is your blending tool, it is your um, nib, your 23 nibs, and your tweezers. 1243, it is so affordable. 781 285. Uh, shall we have another look at some of those gorgeous finished samples that we were chatting on about? Why not? Shall we? Let's have a little look, see. I will be quick. I'm going to remind you what you're going to get. You're going to get these plates for starters. Um, each and every plate is just crammed with magnificent artwork. Um, and it is beautifully drawn. I mean, the detail, the precision, the quality of that artwork. And of course, what, what you're going to get are so many different elements for you to build up your own patterns, your own designs, and basically just have a lovely time putting them together. Um, it is, isn't it? It's just having a lovely time. Uh, you are getting your parchment as well. So you are going to get um, the, the beautiful deep purple, and then you get the lighter purple, 10 pounds worth of parchment. And as you know, this is quality parchment, hence why you're going to get beautiful beautiful finishes. Um, only £31.96. That's the one from Maria. So you can see she's put that black in there. That really adds depth to that colour. Really, really interesting. The colouring does really change the look of them. You know, it adds such a different quality to them. And of course, it is up to you whether you're colouring. You might be doing the white work. Doesn't that look amazing? Look at that white work. And that is actually on black parchment. Doesn't that look good? So that's on the black parchment and then that has been overlaid. So that's using the purple and overlaid on there just with a couple of brads. Absolutely stunning. Look at this one for the cut work. And that is just magnificent, isn't it? And then just that beautiful central panel. Again, that gorgeous purple that we've got in there. That is amazing. The work in that is ridiculous. Um, £31.96, I love seeing the samples. And it's when you see them close up and you can really appreciate the work that goes into them. They're absolutely um, gobsmacking. That's not a good word, is it? My, yeah, they are though. It's like, wow, jaw dropping is better. <laughs> jaw dropping. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Got to play an awful word, really. Anyway, 519852. That's your item number. 31967, £10 there. Okay, now then frames. Now, remember, the big bundle has sold out. That has gone, but we have got the individuals. So you've got your first ones. You've got your doily. That's large and small. And, of course, there's loads of things you can do with your doily. That is beautiful. And I love it because you'll mix and match them with the plates that we've got easy. Um, £15.98, 737850. The next one that we've got, and this is such a clever one. Um, yeah, I have got, again, look at those open spaces. You've got that kaleidoscope, the tangled kaleidoscope, tangled twists, um, which is fabulous. That, that, I mean, I'm looking at that one again. But it is because that is so clever, isn't it? That, um, well, they're all so clever. Beautiful, beautiful frames. Um, so that's your next two. That is 067329. And then you have got the peaked corner and the tucked corner. <laughs> uh, 15 pounds and 98 pence. Let's have a little look at the peaked, which is fabulous. And then the tucked. Love that. Just love it. Fifteen ninety eight. That is one zero three one four two. That's your item number there. Uh, for that one again. Sorry, the bundle's sold out, but at least you've still got options. Now another absolute deal. We've got those borders. Now with the borders, you've got your happy birthday, best wishes, anniversary. You've got mum. You've got dad. To you both. Oh, this is limited. Uh, less than ten percent remaining. You're buying. Th well, you're going to get three delivered, but you're only paying for two. It's a deal. At the bottom, you've got January, February, March. You've got the numbers there. So brilliant for personalising. And I think this is the thing, isn't it, with parchment? You make them for special occasions. So if you are making a beautiful wedding card or a special birthday, this is perfect. I love that you've got step and great and in-law as well. I think that's really good. Um, 992-396 is your item number. This is limited stock, saving £8 there. Now, please check your baskets out. We have got all the fabulous options but that starter kit the starter kit is genius quite frankly um you are getting that for 54 pounds and 99 pence you've got with that everything you need i mean this is such a good quality starter kit you've got the tools that will last and you won't have to upgrade it you know like obviously eventually you'll be getting other stuff you'll be adding to it but the lovely thing is this will last and you will still produce incredible works of art just with the starter kit alone. I really like that. I really like that you get it and you don't have to get all the posh tools straight away. Do you know what I mean? They are really good, substantial tools. You can tell. I mean, you've seen them in action. Uh, 992396 is that start kit. Two payments. Um, oh, sorry, I'm giving it wrong one, sir. Anyway. You'll find it. £27.50, pence your two payments. Um, OK, back to you. Right, OK. I know, Ty, I didn't realise how short time we had. I know. Um, so what I've done, I've used the um, the occasions border in the border plate, mate. And you can see here, we're looking on the reverse, but this is with love because when right. you're working with parchment, yep. you're working on the reverse. And you know that you've put it in the right way because you can always see the That's clarity. That's right. As long as you can read the words, it's up this end, on all the plates, uh, it will always yeah, have yeah, the yeah. word groovy on it. Amazing. So as long as you can read that the right way, then you know the plate is the right That's way That's good. Up. Yep, okay. yep, yep. That's so what I've remember. done is I've positioned my with just there. And then I've just moved it along and put love on the other side. Perfect. But I didn't need to think about it. I just did it. Yeah. Because I, I actually start. I actually went left to right when I was yes. tracing it out. Yes. Okay. So again, you don't need to think about that. Yeah, I think that is genius. So what we want to do now is perforate this one. Okay. Okay. Now it's a nice simple shape that you could, if you're not at the pico cutting, say you could just cut that out very carefully with a yeah. pair of scissors. Yeah. If you're going to do that then I would suggest tracing your heart out first yeah. and then cut it out. Yes, okay. just in Before case. Before you do all your work first, mm -hmm. okay? In case you botch up and then 
if yeah. your scissors slip yeah. or anything like that. Oh, sure. okay. Sorry, my so, worst. <laughs> gobsmacked and botched. <laughs> okay. Could so what worse. we're going to do now? I've got the super foam. At least I said tucked. And I'm going to use <laughs> the um, pico foam underneath. Okay. So that's a special form. It your is. Pico so the, foam. the super foam um, is a, a translucent foam. It works on the light panel. It's 10 mils deep. Right. But it allows the tools to perforate more deeply. Right. Okay. okay. And because I'm working on the black mat, uh, on um, clear parchment, I've put black, the Pico foam underneath. Okay. okay. So you can see. So I, can I love see. these. They feel absolutely gorgeous. You can find all the extra tools on the website. So then what I'm going to do is I'm using the two needle bowl tool. Okay. And I'm going back out of the hole that I've come started. Whoops, it helps if I... Let me put my glasses on. That would help. Because <laughs> <laughs> normally at home I do it a little bit closer. Okay. No that's, time that's to that's be it. able to do okay. that, do you? So, there we go. So the idea is that you go closer to the white line. <laughs> okay. okay. And you're going back out the hole. 30 seconds I'm going to have to do the pico cutting in at last call. Yes, I? you are, I'm afraid. So, We'll continue this at five o'clock. To be continued. Just to finish this one off, rather than rush it and ruin yeah, it. Yeah, you don't um, want to do we'll that. We'll start off the five o'clock show See, even with that this. looks so relaxing. All the tools, again, are available on the website. You can get everything on there. Um, now, we've only got seconds. Paul, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Lee. Last chance, five o'clock. Do not miss it. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. See you later. Coming up next, you've got your paper, babe, and mix media. You've then got uh, the wonderful Avi Craft, and then Mr. Matthew Palmer is in the building. Well, don't miss that one. Did you know you can watch Hochanda 24 hours a day, seven days a week for free using our app on Roku? Just like your smartphone accesses an app store to add new applications, your Roku streaming player or Roku TV accesses the Roku channel store to add new channels. By downloading the Hochanda channel, you'll be able to access your favorite craft channel on your TV anytime you want to watch. Here's how to do it. Turn on your TV and connect your Roku device. Next, turn the power on and press the home button on your Roku remote. Scroll up or down to select settings. Select your network and select setup connection. Roku uses a wireless connection, so select your router name and add your password. This should be on the side or the bottom of your router. If this is the first time using Roku, then you'll need to set up an account on the device or by going to the Roku website. That's it. Now it's time to add the Hochanda app. Simply press the home button on the Roku remote. Scroll up or down using the arrows on your remote to select streaming channels. Then open the channel store. At the top of the channel store, you'll find a list of featured, new and popular categories to explore. Enter Hochanda into the search bar and this will take you to the Hochanda app. Now simply select Add Channel. When you see the Added Channel screen, press OK and return to the home page. Now scroll down to the Hochanda app and press the star button on your remote. You can then use the arrow buttons to move Hochanda to the top of the screen for quick and easy access. And that's it. You can now watch, purchase and catch up with your favourite shows 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. Would you like to improve your crafting techniques by watching and crafting along with your favourite Hachanda guest demonstrators or from the comfort of your own home? If the answer is yes, then we are excited to invite you to Craft Along, where you, our presenters and guests, will create an amazing array of projects throughout the year. Each month we will be bringing you a brand new kit that you can purchase on the day of each show. Or, if you pre-order your kit, you'll receive £5 off a purchase of £20 or more of any additional products featured within our Craft Along brand shop that month. So tune in, be inspired and create with Craft Along, your monthly crafting workshop. afternoon and I'm joined by Kim. Kim, you smashed it earlier. Oh yes, it was a great show. Really <laughs> busy show. Um, now obviously these shows are a bit close together today. We've had to change things. There was a 
stuff Incident, going on on the rose yeah. basically <laughs> but i'm really glad you can join us but it was a really busy show so we've got uh we, we have managed to get more stock on the things that have sold out um, but let's talk about what we've got here because these have proved so popular oh, good yes they really have kim so we've got the right at the top and the left at the bottom but the left is now limited stock so please be quick on this so do you want to talk us through um, the top row, the right, what we get. Well, I've done lots of face stamps that were portrait or yes. profile, and um, I wanted to expand on that and mm -hmm. do like the three quarter view because actually that's a really popular pose in portraits. It is, especially for so, selfies. <laughs> yes, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> so then um, you get two faces and the torso in that one as right. whole stamps, not like little elements that you'd have to build the face. So it's all complete on this. Then you get the head and torso. Mm -hmm which is great for masking and um, yeah, masking <laughs> <laughs> or drawing around if yeah. you needed to. But And then you have three hairstyles that match the face stamps that uh, you can also flip to use with the other face direction. So you can flip it to use with the left? Yes, yeah. Good. So if obviously if you go for both, you've got so Six much more versatility. Yes, yes. Absolutely. Now, um, what you do for us is you take the fear out of faces. Definitely, yeah. yes, yeah, it's done for mm. you. Really. So many people say, I, no, sorry, <laughs> can't draw a face, it's done for you. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. And you're going to show us lots of uh, hints and tips and techniques and, I mean, some of the artwork, well, all of the artwork is amazing. Oh, artwork? Okay, you want me to do this, let's take this then. There we go. Um, we are already getting really busy. So, which profile this is this Terry. one? That is a three-quarter view, and it's right-facing. Right. Sorry, I have to use my hands. No, I'm the same. <laughs> and it's um, a micro fringe. I quite like that style. Yeah, isn't that um, cool? Well, it's my style, to be yeah, honest. Yeah. I'm liking yeah, that. Okay. And then what techniques have we got going on here? This looks like it's been drawn and coloured, and she's used a stencil to create a texture on the hair, mm. and she's used a different stencil on the back. And she's just popped the hand in there, just suggesting it's part of her body. That's fantastic. So you don't have to do the whole torso with that. Yeah. And then the sentiment stamp there. Wonderful. So I'll show you lots more samples. It's because the next sample, I believe, is from the left profile. So if we could also then have a look at the left profile down there. Um, so the left is limited stock. But this is the one where you say you've got the 20s hairstyle. I think that is called the finger wave. Mm -hmm. Oh, possibly, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was a little bit inspired by that. Mm. And it's nice to have a short style yeah. in the, the range. So again, we've got our lovely stamps. Yes, with the two heads mm -hmm. and a torso. And the, Down there? the head and torso templates yep. that can be used as a mask. And then three hairstyles. So that one's your short one, which yes. I'm going to show you a sample. And then you've got the waves. But like I said, if you go for both, then you've got six hairstyles, which is or super cool. it could cool. be 12. Oh, of course, if you think about it. Yeah. So oh. you've just doubled it straight away. Absolutely. <laughs> now, the left has just sold out. We can get more stock, but you do have to wait for it. It, it is a three-week wait, but it is so worth it. So do check out as much as possible. Look at this sample. <laughs> She's amazing! Wow! And look at the light and shade. Her hair, did that take a long time to do? I'm going to say no, because I'm experienced <laughs> with the, the, the alcohol markers. But yeah. I just, you lose yourself in it really and Absolutely. just enjoy the process. She's amazing. You know, the hands are there too, just to show. Oh. It's when you combine it, you can really take it any art form then. Do you know what? This is one of my most favourite samples I think I've ever seen. <laughs> wow. I think she's a, no, I'm being That's serious because, <laughs> no, well, because I absolutely love anything quirky, anything a bit gothic. She's amazing. So what have you done? Is she on brads or how have you I, made her I've mechanics? I've designed uh, a paper brad. Right. Oh, I'm going to release the doll next month so because oh. lots of people have asked. So yeah. I have to say yes, okay. <laughs> I would totally be purchasing this. That's beautiful. Yes. And then we're going back to Oh no, so this is still this the is left. The micro fringe. Yeah, with the micro fringe. So that's the. But that's version. using the face left. Mm -hmm. But the hair can be any direction, Absolutely. really. Absolutely. Yeah. And then we can go to a really nice set of wavy hair. Oh, she looks a little bit pixie like, she actually. She does. I've used the pixie ear on the stump. Very nice. And then we've got one more to show you. 
I mean, they are just absolutely stunning, stunning examples. <laughs> Wonderful. So each option is sixteen pounds and twenty-three pence, and you're getting all the, you're getting the stamps, you're getting the templates. But if you can, I would thoroughly recommend you go for both. Eight two zero one five five is your item number. Right, so next up then, we have got the um, Flourishing Hair Stamp Set and the Template Bundle. And um, half the stock has already oh, wow. gone. Lovely. I know. Thank you. <laughs> so, gosh, you've got a lot of elements in this stamp set, haven't you? Yes, it's quite a large stamp set. There's um, three main waves, I, or flourishes, sorry. Because mm -hmm. I draw wavy hair quite a bit. Yeah. And I was playing with the idea of waves. I thought it looks a bit like a flourish, right. so maybe use a flourish. Amazing. So it's a flourish in its own right, yeah. but it's to frame the face. Mm -hmm. Again, we're super busy for these, aren't they fabulous? Uh, let's have a look at some samples. So um, here then, you're sort of, it's like, I don't know, you're taking elements, aren't you? Yes, it's really stylized, mm. or you can build up and add more flourishes and cover yeah. the whole page. I'd like to do that somehow. It's so new. Yeah. They only came out Saturday. Did so. they? Yes. Gosh, you've not had a long time to <laughs> no. play with them. How awesome is that? See, that's so cool, and it's so fresh, isn't it? Look at that, and then, oh my word, look at these samples. She is super chic, don't you think? And I love that, so it's like she's wearing yes, a polo I, neck. I want to expand mm. on that and have another play, because you could cut patterned paper even, or, Ooh. you know, or, yeah. Good really idea. Have fun. Let's have a look at this beauty. So that one, um, uh, so has it been coloured with pencils, would you say? I think it looks like watercolour. Ah. This is, um, Terry's made this one. Yep. That's beautiful. So, yes, and it's using the flowers that are in the set because mm -hmm. they're nice to frame the face too if you don't want to use the flourish. Good idea. And then look at this one. Like, they're so beautiful. All of mm. these samples are just divine. So giving you lots of inspiration. Do you also have a Facebook page? I do. Do you pop your inspiration on there? Occasionally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have a blog and a Facebook page. Mm -hmm. We do challenges on the blog. Oh, right. So just to encourage you to play. And, That's really good. You know, the prizes and stuff. Marvellous. Yeah. So if you'd like to go for this, you're getting all of those fantastic stamps and you're getting the templates for 19.99, Now the hands sold out earlier, but we have got some more. Again, it's on uh, extended delivery, 13th of February, thank you. Well, already 10% of the restock stock oh, has okay. gone. Wow. Lovely stuff. See, I'm really glad you've brought this out because then you can expand on your designs. Yes, you know? yes. I mean, I love that sample. Look at it oh. there. She's just cutting Well, that's ahead. a YouTube video. Is it? So every step from right. stamping to colouring. Mm -hmm. So is there. It's, um, it's beautiful. So you've got all different ways of sort of placing the hand, open yes, palm, hand yes. down. Yeah, that is incredible. And it's, it's hard to explain unless you know how to draw hands, mm -hmm. but it's the pinky side okay, of yeah, yeah. hands because I was using it to go with the face. Right. So if it was the thumb side, it wouldn't work. That makes sense. Yes. You've really thought about yes, it. Absolutely, so, so it works. They coordinate perfectly with the, the face stamps that are on. Um, and what's the template that we get? It's a hand template right. to cover the hands ah. as a mask. I demonstrated it as a cheat sheet in the first show, so right. it's definitely worth doing. Catch that on uh, <clears throat> 12 o'clock on Rewind, but they all look absolutely stunning, don't they? Yeah. Yes. Let's do one more. Perfect. Now that is £11.24. These are super busy. 236290 is your item number. And then we've got the Flourish and Grow Sentiment Builder stamp set. So again, what made you decide to come out with these stamps? It was keeping with the flourishing theme, really, mm -hmm. that I thought, you know, all the mm -hmm. sort of mindfulness and yep. you might want to send something quite special, say something special to someone on a card or right. inside a card. So I wanted to create a sentiments that Great do that for stuff. you. Yeah, it look has at this. sort of main words and then mm -hmm. you can add them. Uh, so Could we've got like flourish, dreams, beauty, dream, uh, what else have we got? Magic, uh, and sparkle. sparkle. So it's like own your magic or mm. you know believe in yourself right. and love yourself and grow and flourish and follow your dreams it's mm, that really absolutely and then again the positive vibes yeah <laughs> we like positive vibes and then again we've got some uh, fabulous samples uh, so here we've got the flourish um, and then we've got 
magic. Magic in you. Yes. Aww. Aww. That's lovely. And we've got Believe in Yourself just coming in there. So they're really, be uh, literally beautiful. Beauty. There you go. Beauty's everywhere. everywhere. Yeah. Very nice. This set is £10.49 and, pence and your item number is 064694. Uh, Lots more on the website. Do check out at uh, www.hachanda.com. Uh, or, of course, you can give us a call. 01733602000 is the number. Um, now, we've also got some repeat items. So the female face, the male <coughs> face and the profile. Uh, you can also become a Freedom member if you want to. Um, all you need to do is uh, give the details of 888888 and that is the item number to become a Freedom member and then you'll get unlimited standard delivery for £6.97 per month. Uh, also got some seven day savers on there too, lots on the website and of course the deal of the day. Um, right then, so what do you yeah. fancy playing with this hour? I thought it'd be nice to heat and blast the, the mm -hmm. flourish. Yeah. And then um, it's a great resist for watercolour and different right. sort of techniques. So. Okay, shall I show where we're oh, going? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> all, no, all good, all good. So uh, this is where we're going. You can see, isn't she beautiful? Look at all of that um, inky detail. It's gorgeous. And the way that she's been um, coloured in is so beautiful. And then you've got the magic as well. There you are. There you go. That's where we're going. That's where okay. we're going. Okay. So first thing is the flourish. <laughs> Number two. Mm -hmm. So the flourishes are numbered to coordinate with the ah the template. Really good. Okay. Yes. It's because I forget. I've said this already. No, no, it's all good. So it's okay. I have to remember to say it again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. <clears throat> What's your background? Have you always been arty? I have always been arty, and I did go to college mm -hmm. and and um, did a degree mm -hmm. in design. But I actually chose to work with my mum. Okay. So we did soft furnishings right. and interior design and all that. Lovely. So it's all hand sewn oh, curtains. Gosh, were, does that take a long time? It was. It was a long time mm -hmm. and uh, hefty, heavy fabrics and yeah. The like so now we've had a really nice email come in from Ooh, Pauline lovely. hello Pauline hi Pauline now she said she doesn't really do drawing but oh, she yes. uh, but she recently bought the previous stamps and templates and she said they're so easy to use and oh, she's now good. addicted oh lovely thank I like you the Pauline sound of that. lovely <laughs> stuff so I've just stamped the flourish number two okay um, with Versafine I'm just gonna bit of gold a bit of gold, that is a big pot. I don't, oh yes, well, of course, I mean, <laughs> after. I know. <laughs> Would you love to, to pop that in the Oh yes, of course thing? I can. Oh yes. There you go. Let's <clears throat> have a little gun here. There you go. Mm. So I've used watercolour paper. Okay. Because I want to do watercolour after the embossing. Right. So, okay. I love the magic of this, as we were saying yes. earlier. It never gets old, does Never it? gets old. Over half the stock gone of the flourishing hair, proving really busy. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah. So nice. It's very pleasing to the eye, this. Yes. I have a different heat gun at home. Oh, it yeah. Glass, it really Oh, quick, really? So this is slow for me. Oh, no, it's all good. <laughs> I like to watch it change. Oh, there we go. Looks good. You don't have to wait for it to dry, that's quite nice, really. Yeah. Do you have the lid? Just send this just, just here. here. There you go. Oh, the heat gun's going to fall off. Okay, so we use number two. Mm -hmm. So then we'll use the corresponding template. Ah, oh, see, so, so clever. And then we cover the flourish that we've just done. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to use an ink on the face. Is that a bit hard to see? Um, now, is this... No, let me think. Left or right? Left or right. This is right facing. Thank you. <laughs> if, you, if you do that, you're pointing the way it's going. Right. That's how good, I remember. Good point. <laughs> so um, you just line this up and then place her face in there. See, that's so clever. It's lovely. So you're not having to faff and fiddle. You've just got the template with and it. You don't have to draw the hair. Yeah, good. Way either. So good. that was a 
Another idea. <clears throat> we are 80% of the stock gone of the right facing. So then that's that's that bit done, really. Nice, yeah. And um, I've used first fine because that's waterproof. Mm -hmm. And then I'll just watercolour ooh, around her. Mm -hmm. Oh, ooh, these look nice palettes. Mm. This is my own creation. Is well, it? not the idea. It's a makeup palette. Yeah. And you just get the little magnetic discs mm -hmm. and you fill it with the oh, watercolours. Very Because nice. you can use them dry. Yeah. So they're my favourite colours. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's really what it is. Favourite colour so. palette. So what's that, a bit of a grey? It's a grey with a slight iridescent in there. Mm. It has a, a slight shimmer. So I'll go dark around her face to make that bit of hair go back behind yes. her. If that makes sense. It does. <clears throat> Going to create lots of light and shade. And then, I don't have enough water on there. I just want to flood it so it moves. Mm -hmm. And the embossing keeps it. Yeah, resists. Resists, yeah. yeah. So, a bit more colour to that water. Mm -hmm. Now, while you're watching this technique, you know, if you've got any of Oops. Kim's previous wonderful stamps and templates, uh, please send in your pictures to studio at hitchander.com or via Facebook, because it's our favourite thing to see. Definitely. Yes, I love seeing people's creations. Yeah. I like watching it pool. Yes, I want to get more pool. Yeah. <laughs> so you're just releasing it. more water? Yes, yeah. I really sit on the outside and then yep. it goes in. And then you can sort of soften that edge. Because mm. it sort of makes her look quite dreamy, I think. Yes, yeah, or a bit like magic. Oh, yes, <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> so I start quite dark around her face just to frame it. Can you see that? Yeah. The way. And then sort of bleed it out. Mm -hmm. So that's the sort of shadowing bit, it would be a bit darker under yes, the chin. Yes, it would be it? a bit dark under the sh chin and the back of the hair there. Yeah. And then um, just to clean my brush, I'm just releasing more water. Then I can add a bit of another colour mm, over here. That's effective. And then um, Quite it, it should bleed into mm. that one. So It's really very simple, isn't it? Oh no, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> it's just these... But these techniques, you know, somebody at home might not have done this before and think, oh, no. I could try something new. Just play. This was like a five-minute card idea. Yeah. I don't get them very often. <laughs> <laughs> so I quite like it quite, you know, intense near the flourish mm -hmm. and then bring it out. Pull it out. Lovely. Yeah. But like you said, though, sometimes we haven't got time to spend on a long project. Definitely. And, yeah, you might just want a quick message to somebody just to say you're thinking of them. Mm. What's your angel policy? Can we make cards to sell? Definitely. I think they're also really good for mixed media projects too. Yes, stamps. yes. Journaling and uh, mm -hmm. layering. It'd be quite nice stamped on tissue paper Ooh. and then doing the tissue paper layering with Ooh, glue nice. so that it disappears. So I think that's enough watercolour. You sure. could keep going. Mm -hmm. um, so while that's drying, I actually drew the crown. That was from a previous release, okay. if people have it. Ah, uh, yes. And I drew it on a piece of paper. OK. <laughs> Let's borrow this piece. Um, so just to show you what Kim's going to be using, this also sold out earlier, and it's back on extended delivery. And it's the um, female face and template for 16.98. Item number is 477-794, so it'll be dispatched from the 13th, is it? Of February. Okay. Okay, I'm going to be brave and just go in straight into the stencil or template with the gold pen. Mm -hmm. And then, um, the alcohol's bled a bit in the okay. pen. So is this and just copy paper? It is. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> Just wondered. <laughs> That's okay, isn't it? <laughs> yes. It's just that 
added a bit of uh, gold. Mm. You could stamp uh, some of the flourishes, actually. Yeah. Uh, make a crown yourself. It'd be quite nice with the uh, cherry blossom, actually. That'd be quite nice. Oh, yeah. Gold embossed mm. around her. So, yeah. And then I just cut that out. It's still wet. I could probably uh, dry it, couldn't I? Oh, it's up to you. See my head's not there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I often let watercolour dry naturally because then it, it does its own flow I yeah. suppose but yes yeah, so you could definitely uh, finish it off quicker yeah the just for the purposes of live for the TV. purpose of live tv and that I wasn't thinking straight no it's all good Um, we do have queues on the phone lines, so your fastest way to order is online at tachanda.com. They're so beautiful, all of their faces. They've got little button noses. Ah, yeah. Yes. It's lovely. You alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm just <laughs> looking for my other stamp set. It's ah, just here. Right. There we go. Okay. So then we can choose a nice word. Mm -hmm. What should we use? Oh, well, you use magic on there. That's right. nice, yeah. So on this again, you've got um, hello, you, on, in you. So you, again, you can mix and match. So it could be, you know, believe in you. Uh, dare to create, create your own sunshine is everywhere. But then in the larger words, you've got flourish, dreams, beauty, dream, sparkle, love. And then you've got little extra stars. 33 stamps in total. Yes, mm. I like to cram my stamps yeah, in. Yeah, absolutely. Much to the manufacturer's annoyance. Yeah. <laughs> They'll say, can't you join those together? Like, no. no. <laughs> you need want a bigger it how gap. I'm like, no. <laughs> I, I always have to say, I accept the closeness of the floor. <laughs> so that I can cram. Is that the legal thing, is it? <laughs> there you go. Wow. <laughs> so that. If Oops, they sorry. touch a little bit, yeah. I'm sure customers don't mind trimming it if it meant no. additional stamp in there. It's fine. So, yes. Thank you. I'll pop that on for you. So, watch the magic magic. I know. There we go. Gold is one of the best embossing powders, mm. in my opinion. So you need a big jar then? Yeah, I do. <laughs> mm, I do. <laughs> Just need more time for crafting, really. Oh, don't we all? Yeah. <laughs> So there we go. Mm. Fabulous. You probably don't want to watch me cut the crown out, do you? Oh, it's all good, don't worry. I'll, um, again, I'll show you the finish off. And it's lovely, just that finish off of the matte and layer as well. It's really pretty. Yes, yeah, so I chose a grey because mm. it was in her. Yeah, because it's in, in her the hair. Paint. Yes, yeah, yeah. And that works really well. Isn't that stunning? So, yes, mm. I can imagine a card. With all the flourishes, gold yeah. embossed, Ooh, but yes. just her face. Oh, I forgot to paint her face. <laughs> oh, honestly. <laughs> okay, rough is cut, crown ever. Now, yeah, a lot of people don't know where to start with sort of skin tone. So what, how, what are you going okay, to do for her? Okay, so I like to start with the sort of dark shadow area mm -hmm. around. So I'm just going to mix a bit of that yellow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think it's yellow ochre, but okay. it's yellow in my palette. And I'll put just a hint of the red, so it's more pinky. Mm -hmm. And then um, you're better watering it down a bit and layering mm. so that you haven't got such an intense colour okay. if you want a nice sort of soft skin. And then um, I'll just go round the edge and the bottom of her nose has a shadow mm -hmm. and then top lip has a shadow and around the eye bits there and I'm just rinsing it out to bring some of the colour so it's less intense. Mm -hmm. So you're just pulling it out? Just pulling it out, Lovely. so it's nice and soft. Yeah. And look at photos, you know there's lots of um, picture websites you know that you can look at for poses mm -hmm. and more dramatic looks if you want to see how to shade somewhere because mm -hmm. you never think there's a bit of shadow under the eye but it makes it mm -hmm. more dimensional and 
Oh, don't talk about shadows under the eyes. <laughs> I, I have to plaster mine with concealer. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, she can... Oh, I use the lid as a palette. Oh, yeah, so that's yes, all good. You know, it's all good. It dries and you can keep doing it. And then I like to make her nose a bit pink at the end. Mm -hmm. But you just have to play, really. Mm. I understand you've got a YouTube tutorial video I have of the hand stamp ah. step by st all the way through from stamping okay. to coloring and then I have sort of some sort of tutorials on my blog mm -hmm. too um, sometimes I don't have the use or the space I should say yeah. <laughs> to do a video but <laughs> I can take photos as I go That's good. sometimes it's just a bit easier I'm putting shadow just under her lashes because that's where most shadow is on mm -hmm. the eyeball and then a bit of blue we're approaching limited stock on the right set and then I like to put just a little hint of pink in the tear duct there oh mm. not that much I'll just take some off there we go nobody will know mm -hmm. And you want to add a dark bit to the top, like the yep. eyeball is in shadow. Mm. Very nice. And when it dries, it does dry a little bit lighter. And then this is a Payne's grey. I know that one because mm -hmm. it's my favourite grey. <laughs> and that's good for if you just go above into the lashes. Yeah. It really helps. What well, makes those them, yeah, stand out. Yeah. I'm not doing individual lashes, you just don't need to really. Mm -hmm. And then I just take a bit off. Make it lighter, just to do a bit under her nose and a little bit on the filtrum. So you can really keep adding yeah. shadow um, if you want to. A bit more under the hair. So the grey We'll keep the colour there, it'll just make it darker. Mm -hmm. And then maybe a bit round there. So there. So you have a play. Yeah. Add a bit more colour to the her top lip. Yep. Give her some nice rosy red lips. Oh, that was so good. Oh, there we go. Cool. Done. <laughs> let's let's pick her up. Let's uh, show this version. So nice. Obviously the crown will get yeah, on there. yeah that's, <laughs> she's beautiful isn't she so hopefully while you're watching Kim you know this is now taking if you if you are a bit nervous about exploring faces and profiles hopefully with the stamps with the templates this is going to take away any of the worry so you can have a real play and you'll get professional results really nice and easily lovely right we're going to have a quick recap uh, but before that let's tell you a bit about freedom We will. I promise. <laughs> Hello everyone. I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Hochanda Freedom. Did you know that with Hochanda Freedom you could be saving on your deliveries every single month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee, you'll benefit from unlimited standard delivery, which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And do you know the best bit? You can cancel at any time. Becoming a member of Hochanda Freedom, you'll also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom Members discounts, where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hochanda price. Freedom Members will also receive our exclusive Members Badge and Freedom Newsletter, which will keep you updated with all the goings-on behind the scenes. Look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month. Over 12,000 of you are already members and we thank you so much for being part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hochanda Freedom. I'm a Freedom member which means I can shop a lot. It's the discounts and all the special offers you get. I get special offers, I get special discounts, they tell me when everything's happening, so if there's a special show I want to watch then it's there. I'm able to just shop when I'd like. It's just good to have. Yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. 
You see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website, quoting the item number 888888. So, don't forget you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, members badge and members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hochanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hochanda family. Right then, so we're having uh, a little bit of a recap. Everything on the show is super, super busy. Uh, Katie, are you all right in my ear? <laughs> so, so, so she's like, oh, I've broken the talk back. No, it's a talk back is fine. It's a talk back is fine. <laughs> it's so funny. Right, let's have a look. Right, you've got your um, right profile. That's at the top and it is limited stock. Now what you're getting are your fabulous faces. Aren't they gorgeous? So she's obviously going to be looking to the right. Um, you do have the torso as well. Um, you've got your template so that you can mask. And then you've also got all the different types of hair. So you've got this one, lovely flowing mane. And then she's got a nice little um, sharp fringe. Um, and then the next one that we've got is like slightly shorter do. And then we've got another flowing one here, lovely flowing curly locks. Um, then we have got the left facing which is down here now this one is on extended dispatch from the 13th of February again you have got the wonderful profile stamps in the torso you've got the masks and then you've got the three hairstyles this one's got the really short sort of 1920s one again another flowing set of locks and this one's kind of in a little bit of a ponytail which is gorgeous so if you were to buy both which I would recommend if you can stretch to it I know it's not in everybody's budget but if you can stretch to it because then you've got way more to play with because they will all interchange which is lovely uh, so we've got some samples have a look at these aren't they? I mean they're just beautiful she's amazing she looks so sort of dramatic and I love that she's got the crown I love the way that she's been colored in and uh, she's even got her little wings on there so she's very very mystical and then We've got this beautiful sample. I love that on the craft card. Looks really effective. I love a button nose. Can you see that nice little bit of highlight on the nose and on the lips? That is extremely effective. Then we've got this lovely lady with her uh, shorter fringe. And because they're all so different, aren't they? I love the way that she's been shaded. Then we've got. Uh, same same one uh, facing the other way though so you can see how well they interchange which is beautiful and then I love this sample I just absolutely adore this sample I love her hair look at all the color and it's front and back it's front and back and she's got a little wings that are moving um, on the brads look how she's she's fallen like that literally I didn't place her like that she's like it's like she's going to sit down um, but it's her face look at her beautiful face and her pixie ears and that hairdo is glorious each option then is £16.23 820155 is your item number uh, then next up we have got the flourishing hair there's oodles of stamps on here 60% of the stock has gone and you've got templates as well but again check out how many stamps there are in fact if I may I just want to turn it have a look myself because you've got loads of little flowers you've got loads of workers on there um, as well as the actual flourishes so you've got hearts you've got flowers you've got little dots there's oodles there you go ah marvelous so you can have a little look nice and close up that's glorious so they'll work with the face and then you can embellish all the way around and then we have got um, more samples so this one is, is quite like funky and modern so we've got our beautiful faces on there but it's a really nice stylized look with this with the flourishes and they just frame but it's just more of a sort of cleaner simple look and then we've got this beautiful one, awesome, loving those colours that are used on there. And then moving on, look, this one, she's almost got cat's eyes actually because of the colours. All of those lovely worker stamps surrounding her. This one's another of an absolute favourite because it's just so clean, so simple. It's very, very chic because she's wearing that wonderful polo neck. Uh, there we have it, uh, 1999, 38 stamps in total, and you have got the um, 
the template masks as well. 179677 is your item number. Uh, then moving along, we've got the dinky hands. They're gorgeous, so you can place them like this or like this. Um, this is on extended delivery because it's sold out earlier. Again, this is going to be dispatched from the 13th of uh, February. But again, a quarter of the stock has gone, of the restock stock. Um, so you've got the arms. Again, you've got the hands placed in all different directions. Look at that. There's the palm up hand down it's really good i mean these absolute must have if you can get these as well because you'll be able to then create bigger pictures fill them out more um 11 pounds and 24 pence is the price 16 stamps and your template mask 236290 is your item number and then last but not least we have got the uh, flourish and grow sentiment builder and you'll see the lovely flourishes because um, i love the 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 writing i love the font of it it's so pretty so you've got your nice larger stamps there and then down the bottom you've got like all your linking stamps you know there's and etc you know that sort of thing uh, so here we've got flourish dreams you can see all the extra stars that you're getting beauty dream sparkle and love and then the smaller one so you've got believe in yourself uh, repeat it's really good so you can interchange each one and then i've got some samples here uh, we've got is everywhere beauty is everywhere on this particular sample and also we've got believe in yourself magic in you and last but not least there's your flourish ten pounds and forty nine pence zero six four six nine four is your item number small things you might want to add to your baskets here they come now this one is on extended delivery um, but already half the stock of this has gone this is your female face stamp and templates uh, you get the face stamp hairstyle uh, daisy head and torso templates 16 pounds and 98 pence 477794 and then we've also got the male face now this one is limited stock 17 pounds and 73 pence 937048 and then last but not least we've got the profile face now this one comes in left and right and this is where you're going to get that crown from if you want it 1698 318 319 is your item number still queues on the phone lines wow Kim has just handed me a fantastic sample. Oh, are you ready? I kind of want to do a reveal, can I? Can I swizzle it round in a minute? Here we go. We're just zooming in for it. I'm building, because this is, I just saw this and went, oh my word. Are you ready? Okay. Ta-da! That is amazing, isn't it? So this is to demonstrate how the profile, the three-quarter view and the portrait all work together. They're all the same scale and the hands fit every mm, face they do look at that she looks a bit like <gasps> australian actress really famous nicole kidman oh, other actresses available bit, <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> there we are uh, okay thank you for showing us that that's, that's okay. amazing <coughs> excuse me oh, oh yes me, where are you going to start let's, let's yes. <laughs> <laughs> so i thought um i'd show how you can build up the flourish quite quickly with just one ink mm. and incorporate all the the stamps there the block for this um, two thirds of the stock of the flourish has gone super so I'm busy using flourish three yep and um, I explained before how the point is like the parting of the hair ah that makes sense and then you know if you want it central on the face It'd be the middle mm -hmm. but you can you know there's yeah. so much room so we're going to have it <clears throat> flowing to the right yeah there we go okay nice and, and crisp we know it's number three yeah so we just we'll have to turn the template to fit i just got a bit of tape there mm -hmm. and then you could put any face in mm, there. Great stuff. It'll all fit. It'll all fit. I'm not sure about the male faces, but I'm sure there's plenty of males with long flowing oh, hair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, you know, 
you might want to use. You've got plenty of room to have her face along that space, mm. I guess. So you can have it quite close and it would cover some of her eyes, which right. is quite dramatic. It look. is. So. Uh, the right facing is now which limited is quite amusing. stock. Oh, yes. Mm. So uh, uh, there's, what's the word? Different styles of faces in the set. So yeah. the four of them, this one has lashes, but there's one in the set without. Okay. So that you can add your own lash mm -hmm. or freckles or, yeah. you know, make it more personal. Mm -hmm. So while the template's in place, you can add other things like the flowers. <laughs> I like your stamp, the, your, <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah the stamp block, yeah. anything works. Yeah, of course. <laughs> and this actually has a little, little finger. L Lou Withers <laughs> uses the back of a like, versifying lid. Oh, yes, yeah. yes. <laughs> yeah. So, because the stencil's there, you know it's mm -hmm. going to stay. Um, Yes, I did cherry blossoms because it was all about that growing mm. and flourishing and yeah, yeah, that stuff. And then I've added more flourishes from the set yep. to this, so let's have a look. Um, I've sort of repeated and reflected lots of flourishes so mm -hmm. you can um, enjoy building, <coughs> excuse me, Okay, so the right facing has sold out, but again, just to give Kim a bit more time to get more stock together, uh, we can bring it to you on extended delivery from the 13th of February. Wow. That's amazing. Yeah, no, Thank it's you. good. Great. Everybody's been waiting for you to come back. Well, yeah, it has been a, a little while. How long hasn't do you think it? it's been? I know, if you are, I should have looked <laughs> before I came. Because I know you've moved house and obviously it's yes. been busy. But I, did, I have had a show since I moved house last January. Yeah. But I've still not quite unpacked. I think that's well, what it is. The thing is, it's stressful, isn't it? Moving so house. Is. Yeah. And then um, there's just been other things to yeah. cope with. So I'm extending this with another flourish. Mm -hmm. So you can just keep growing and building. <clears throat> Do that nice bit in there. Use mm. all my blocks. Yeah, use every single one. Use every Get them block all out. and even little boxes. Yeah, and that's fine. Um, We're popping the flourishes on screen if you want them. Nineteen pounds and ninety-nine pence, and you've got thirty-eight stamps and a template. One seven nine six seven seven. So I always offer the stamp up to mm -hmm. find the hands that oh, I like. Good idea. So I'm, I'm going for the same because. You can hold a flower in her hand, mm -hmm. which I quite liked. Does it take a long time to sort of do the designs? It, I think when you have a really good idea, yeah. you just get do stuck it. in. Yeah. You get stuck in. So it came together quite quickly for me, but the longest time is, is the actual a bit of researching mm -hmm. and um, I draw by hand first yeah and then I have to scan it in mm -hmm. and then I go over all the lines right with um, in pr uh, program mm -hmm. so it's a vector image so that the manufacturer has yeah that. so oh, okay it it takes 30 hours to do that sort of size right. stamp mm. With the whole process, yeah, I suppose. That's interesting. So there's a little gap in her fingers, that's which so is cute. just perfect for a little flower or a little sentiment. Or oh, that's gorgeous. And um, yes, yeah, so you can just keep going. Yeah. Beautiful. You could <laughs> spend hours just mm -hmm. sitting. And think, I could do that there. Yeah. Keep going. Well, we've still got about 12 minutes if you're happy to. 12 minutes. I've got another sample idea I'd like to try and show you. So. Oops. So you got sparkle. Nice. And then Is that your handwriting? No. Oh. I do write a little bit that way, mm -hmm. but my 
lowercase is a bit bigger. Yeah. Sparkle, what can we say? Um, I'll just do the same one, Crate Green Sunshine. You've got a choice to play. A choice, yes. Um, be worth doing a little idea and. Um, Lovely. Oh my gosh, it was straight. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes uh, oh, the no. stamping platform would have I to come out for always that. on the wonk, <laughs> always. <laughs> yes, especially when you have a curly yeah. one. So that's that really. Yeah, beautiful. It's a bit longer and you could really extend some of the okay. flourishes. Shall we? So. Thank you. There we go. There's, um, there's the finish. It's nice. Simple to do, wonderful to batch make, uh, but it looks really, really effective, doesn't it? And then you've got your sparkle and create your own sunshine. She looks gorgeous. Gorgeous. Um, just while Kim is getting set um, for the next demonstration, let's just show you the website so you can see all the lovely items that we've got on the show. Do make sure you're checking out your baskets. It's super busy out there. Um, so we've got lots of different templates and masks. Um, it's going to help you to uh, take the fear factor out of faces and profiles. That's what Kim's done for you. And I love that she puts in most of the sets stamps and masks so that then you can create sort of, you know, foreground and background, etc. Uh, so there's lots on the website. If you've got any questions or any more pictures to show us, then send them into studio at hachanda.com. Right, ooh, that looks nice. <laughs> that looks really effective. Right, so... I had the idea that you could create, I don't know where I am. That's all right, I can take oh, it. Oh, yes. Let me go. And then we'll get the that you, by using the masks and the templates, you mm -hmm. can overlap and create a whole series of the right. faces. So Lovely. That was good. That's, yes. What's the first one? It's the middle one. Okay. I think that's um, this one, mm -hmm. number two. I like that you've numbered them. Well, I think I needed it myself, mm -hmm. if I'm honest. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. So, what colour is this? The grey again? This, this is grey. Yeah, yeah. I like the grey. I think because it's a bit more pencil line. Yeah. It must be like an arty thing. Yeah. But black's quite nice too. Very dramatic. But yes, I probably don't use much. And then um, I'm going to have her central. Mm -hmm. 70% of these flourishes have gone. They're on screen, 1999, uh, 179677. So we use number two, so we know it's number two flourish and face. I'll just use that same face amongst my pile of blocks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Spreading out now. I know, I am. So that's going to be comfortable it's, now. It's standard for having <laughs> all crafters. So if you feel it's wobbling, I'd put tape on the holes yeah. there to, to help that. And then, um, so you might need to press a bit because of the thickness of mm -hmm. the material. Yeah, so it's mylar that isn't it bit. I think? Yes, yeah. mylar. And then the next one we're going to do number one. Mm -hmm. So i get that ready on my block. <laughs> Bring 10,000 blocks. Yes, yes, I could see you have. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, because I want the flourish behind, mm -hmm. I'm actually going to use the aperture ah, piece. Ah, that's great. It's so, so useful. So that, you know, it all works mm. in place. I'll just put that there. A bit of, bit of reusable tape. Yeah. Or low-tack tape, that's the word, isn't it? Yeah. Is that the right flourish? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the other one's under there. Oh, right, and that's the where block. it is. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> okay. So we know that's masked. Mm -hmm. And then we can just lay that over there. Yep. Very effective, because then you've got foreground and background. Yes. And you haven't had to cut a single post-it note to uh, mask it <laughs> or masking sheet. Mm -hmm. So that was number one flourish. Yep. So we can pop that there. But keeping the other mask in place. Right. Otherwise, you'll lose the whole depth effect or the layered effect. Mm. And then we'll choose a different face. 
That's my favourite face. Which one's that from, left or right? It's the left. Right. <laughs> No, the no, left. Yeah, <laughs> I realised as soon as I said that. <clears throat> yes, because I wanted it so that y you know when you have more than one person in like a photo or portrait, mm -hmm. they never look all the same direction. Right. So I wanted to do both directions because you'd find they'd face each other a lot yeah. in a. A picture, so that was the thought there. What what makes her your favourite? I think I like her eyes. Mm -hmm. They're a bit smaller, mm -hmm. um, and her nose. My cousin has that nose. <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't know. I think it's a pretty face. I tell you what. This is, so this is the finished article where we're going. Do you know what I see here? album cover. <laughs> Love Island. Oh, I've not watched it. So <laughs> no, I don't I'm watch rubbish. it. Well, just like... Oh, is it? <laughs> oh. Okay, and then the next, see we've used all of our flourishes in this example. So which flourish is this, sorry? Number three. Number three Number flourish. Three. Okay. So... So you're still leaving that middle mask on? Yes, because yep. that's the bit that you'll want to protect through the whole mm -hmm. thing. And then, that's quite central. Oops, oh, Mr. The finger bit. went on there. Oh, okay. Okay. So, maybe about there. Mm -hmm. Just own it. Do, have you got a date for when you're next back in? No. Not yet? No. <laughs> Definitely have to bring some more because it's to. been so busy. It's lovely. Well, I'm thinking it'd have to be dolls next time, wouldn't I think it? So. Mm. No, what, what, but what about those movable ones that you're That's talking about? That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Face. Right. So number three it was. Mm -hmm. And I use the portrait face for that one. Okay. So that's a different set, isn't it? It is. Yes. I think that might be sold out again, did they say? Uh, I will find out for you from our producer. Uh, whether the profile is sold out or is it It's the right? portrait. We've still got some, we've still oh, got some. Okay. Uh, we'll put the details on because that's where this one's from. Well this is the idea is that you've got the faces and it's nice actually to have something new mm. to go with it. Yeah. That, you know you can have, um, keep using them, you mm. don't have to put them aside for your next yeah. new item. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Lovely. So then, to add the colour on the back. Oh, sorry. That's okay. <laughs> we use these. No, three. That's that side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you're going to mask them all. And off then now. you can mask them. Yeah. And then you can apply ink or paint or. Let's see. I didn't bring those colours. I just have to use this one. That's all right. Ah, I see you've got some of those brushes. Oh, yes. Yeah. That one's too big. Oh, that's a little one. Okay. Let's get some myself. Well, I just got a, a cheaper version, I suppose, oh, okay. just to try it out. Yeah. And what I love is that it doesn't hold the ink, mm -hmm. so you can move to the next colour. That's good. So actually, you only need one brush, oh, if you think okay. of it that way. Yeah. <laughs> so. This is nice. So they're going to have like a lovely cloud of colour around oh, them. Yeah. Uh, that one. Yes, you can, um, it's, it's masked for you, mm. and it's reusable, the mask, it's, you know, ink and paint resistant, mm -hmm. and you can even do down here. Yeah. Lovely little cloud. That's beautiful. The tape. Yeah. And then we'll, like, see a really nice reveal in a minute. And then you can really bring the colour out then mm. if you wanted to soften it. Do you like suggestions from people of what they of might course, want? Of course, yes. Oh, okay, just thinking. Yes, customers are, you know, definitely yeah. important. And um, I'm just thinking if you want, if there's something that you, you know, sort of face-wise that you'd like to see, maybe pop a little note on our Facebook page. Yes, or, yes. Or your Facebook page, of course. Yes, any, any, it's mm. all good. Mm -hmm. So, there we go. Hey, beautiful. And then you can colour them in. Yeah. And um, there we go. Isn't it? Um, did you want to colour them in or...? 
You yeah, have we've got city. time. Get, go, a couple of minutes. A couple of minutes. Yes. yes. If you want to start, I think because I think people really like to see that the sort of the colour. Yeah. I'm going to colour a sort of realistic face, a bit like, and then you okay. have a smoky background. All right. Ish. I say that. We pink. might not be able to see it all because oh, right, it's been two minutes, but still. So it's I still nice. work the same and do the hairline. Mm -hmm. Quite dark, excuse me. That's all right. And then, um. Okay. Are around these, the eyes. Are these watercolour pens or they are they are those alcohol markers? Echo line. Oh, all right. Okay. They, they sell them on a tender. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I thought, you know, I'd be good and use something that they sell to me. <laughs> Put shadow under her nose. Yeah. Mm. If you're stuck on the shading of a face, mm. just look at photos and pictures. There's plenty of uh, <laughs> pictures online now. Do you know that yeah. way to reference? Yeah. So, um, so a bit of shadow, as you said, under the eyes, around the nose. Yeah. Under the lip, mm -hmm. yes, on the nose and under the nose, yep. yes. A bit in the filtrum. And under the eyes again and under the mouth. Yeah, so. Yeah. And then, what's that one? Beige. So is this a slightly it's lighter? Gray. This is a bit greyer, I think. Okay. <laughs> Still new to the pens, actually. Yeah. And sometimes I like to add shadow to mm. that hair. That creates that depth that you, okay. as if the hair is actually falling across her face. Yeah. And then I think I might just. Ah, um, oh, lovely Kim. Thank a, you. Oh, oh no, <laughs> it went so quick. We just thought we'd see a few techniques just yes. to the end. I've really enjoyed that. Um, thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. Uh, thank you. And um, please do check out your baskets because you'll have lots and lots of fun with these. It take the fear out of any profiles. Right, we've got more coming up after this break. Coming up next, we've got Avid Craft, and then Matthew Palmer is in the building, and we'll be doing a spot of painting. And then after that, we have got the Get Groovy with Clarity One Day Special. Calling all crafters, this is a Hachanda announcement. We would like to inform you that our Hachanda buying crew have been busy flying around the world in search of incredible brand new products and show ideas to inspire and stimulate all of your crafty senses. So watch out for My Favourite Things, Huggable Lovable Boots, CBK, Cross Stitch Design, Fletcher's Patch, Project Bin, Hero Arts, Yes How Much I Love You Quilting, Colorific, New Moon FM, Folia Flowers, Slice Tools, Crafty So and So, Patty McCourt, The Crafty Pig, Dare to Be Artsy, Craft O'Clock, Just Bliss Fabric, and many more. We will be checking in our latest new product arrivals from 6pm on Thursday the 23rd of January. Gates close at 6pm on Thursday the 30th of January. So join us on board flight Hachanda Air for our new arrivals event. Wakey wakey, rise and shine. Welcome to Good Morning Hachanda. Your daily breakfast fix of your favourite crafts at 7am. Whilst you're getting ready to start the day, join us every morning for the deal of the day. A product available at a special price but only for the 24 hours or while stocks last. Also, part of your morning routine should be the sunrise specials. Your favourite crafting items available at a special low price but only for the hour. Tune in to Good Morning Achanda and start your day with a deal. Hi, my name is Maggie and I'm from Impressions Crafts. Um, I've been running my business now for 15 years. It's a small family-run business in the south of Cheshire. We have a large craft shop. And we sell all sorts of beading and jewellery supplies. Um, I have a passion for making jewellery. I love working with um, the Lucite style flower beads. And we make thousands and thousands of angels and have been doing so for the last few years. We've been bringing uh, to Hachanda lots of lovely beading kits, jewellery, uh, for necklaces and bracelets and earrings and we also bring a wide range of angels and accessories, beading accessories like bookmarks and we also have our range of laser cut uh, 
some catches and mobiles all good lovely crafty beads hope you can tune into my shows and looking forward to seeing you on her channel Hello there and welcome back. Well, welcome back to what is a very colourful hour, as you can see, to start <laughs> off. And we've got the fabulous Abigail. How are you doing? I'm good, are you? I'm oh, very well, thank good, you. Very good, good. Well. And I have to say, I was excited when I checked out the schedule. And saw that well, was I me was. And I know, yeah, I like it. Um, and I love it because you've, uh, you always bring fabulous things, but you've brought a wonderful bundle of patterns. But they're not just like a pattern there are books of patterns uh, yes we've gone for new year new us okay new format a5 pattern spiral bound very nice each pattern pack you get three patterns apart from the quilt one where you get the bargello and the lap quilt but other nice. than that you get three in each pack Wonderful. and they're great because we haven't been um skimpy okay. what we've done is we've printed on one side nice and then on the other side you've still got a blank so you can I make like your that. notes, yeah. you can exactly. um, jot little, do little things down. Exactly, mm. write your shopping list, you can write what sizes <laughs> exactly you want, you all that sort of thing. So you've got all the instructions in there. So for example, you've, this one's got the reading cushion inside Lovely. and um, you've got all everything you need, what you need to cut, all your instructions. And also, with regards to these, the, it's good size script with that good size font. Exactly. So you can kind of be working, and that me, I've got my readers, but I've got I don't need them for distance. So if yes. I'm working on something, I don't necessarily want to have to keep picking up my glasses to read the next bit. Yeah. I've got to do. I just need to be able to see it. There. Yeah, and you can Perfect. again, you can fold these open, and they're just an easier thing to handle. I think. Exactly. Makes life easier. It certainly does. Now we've got a set up for you. So if you wanted to go for these individually, they are available. But we have got a set details of which are at the, the bottom of your screen, where you will get everything so you'll get all those fabulous projects in there so whether it's a quilt that you're going to be making potentially your first ever quilt by the way do check out we've got the most amazing pinwheels and we've only got a handful of those left so those would be perfect or maybe you're going to be making your gifts with these and there's so much scope with it oh there's loads in the main in the complete bundle you've got 11 patterns so you've got like a book here all the instructions that you okay. would get um Per in here, so you've got everything, all full colour instructions, um, everything walks you through. All in you, one place. I mean, this is absolutely wonderful. It's such a versatile pattern. Nice. Your roll-up bag, you can change that into makeup brushes. Good point. You yeah. can make it longer for um, mm -hmm. artists. Oh, We've got oh, Matthew Palmer. Exactly. Later. He you would like that. Brushes, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So you've got everything in there. It's huge. It's thick. You've got you've got it easy for you to use. As I said, step-by-step -step colour instruction, so you're not going to go wrong. And there's a video tutorials for a lot of these as well. So that's one thing I love about your patterns. You've got the support of the tutorials there, but good photographs, because I'm a bit yes. of a photographs girl. Me too. I'm not a words person. I'm, I'm more of a picture. Same. I'm definitely a visual learner. Mm. And I find that if I can do things step-by-step -step with somebody else, like sometimes things flummox me. Okay. Because I'm reading it and it flummoxes me. Yeah. But if I can see it, I go, right, let me got make it. mine the same great easy that's so that's what you've got with this it's a really nice little thing that you can have on your desk again you've got still got those blank pages for your notes mm -hmm. um you know we didn't want to print on both yeah. sides because we want you to have the room available to make it yours mm -hmm. write bits down like if you go wrong here mm -hmm. write that you keep going wrong there so you remind yourself every time those little pointers just to refresh exactly memory. love it now this is the way the majority you've been getting hold of those fabulous patterns you can see you've got a 75 pound saving on this that's if you were going to go for those individual patterns as well bear in mind you've got a lot of patterns in here 11 patterns in total we tend to say about a tenner of pa patterns exactly don't we? So, yeah, yeah that, that's quite a feasible price that you can see there but you are saving 75 pounds on this more importantly you can get hold of all of them for just 22 pounds and 44 pence especially if you're a freedom member because that's delivered to your door as your first freedom and uh, first um, payment should i say because of course you won't have your post and packing second payment in a month's time but you will have all 11 of these yeah. projects you'll have made a good couple already oh, yeah. by the time the second payment comes through and you're saving more than you're spending as well aren't you That's so really like uh, it's just fantastic and also it's one that you can keep in your drawer mm -hmm. and you can keep referring to and it's just a it's a you know it's a lifelong thing really because of how it's presented it's going to just be i love the fact that i can open it out Yes. and have it flat on my desk like yeah. this and I don't need to lose my page I can put my bookmark in close it up it's a book and it's also a book that's going to fit in your sewing bag yes so if you're going off to your classes or maybe you go around to your friends and do a little bit of a sewing afternoon then you can take that with you and yes. know that you've got everything that you need you're not leaving anything behind it's all in that completely book. and for example if you were to go to your um 
local quilt shop and get you wanted to get the um, correct amount of fabric mm -hmm. on the front here so for example the roll-up bag again you've got you need one flat quarter for the outer fabric one flat quarter for the inner fabric wadding and ribbon how easy so that. you can open it up it tells you exactly how much of each fabric you need so mm -hmm. you can just go right uh, oh let me see which one do I want to make this one what do I need great yeah you're gonna cut into those yeah. but the basis is you need those and it's just so handy yeah. you know, I love about these as well you've got projects where you're going to be using up some of your scraps as well. I think completely. I can plead, Kay, where you're only using a little bit of yes. fabric. Yes, oh, completely. Um, and this year might be the year that you think, right, I'm going to make a quilt. I've been talking about it, I've been thinking about yes. it. Yes. And you give us the ability to do that. Now, obviously, we've got the Bargello um, quilt on the back, which is absolutely, I love Bargello. Which Me is too. Amazing. But this is a fabulous one, perhaps to cut your teeth on when you come into quilting. Absolutely. And also, I've quilted it in a way that's so easy and straightforward. You don't need any fancy equipment. You don't need any quilting rulers. You don't need anything. So you could do this as a complete novice. Complete novice. Love it. Because this is a four-patch, a disappearing four-patch, really easy, really simple how it's laid out. But the effect that it gives you fabulous. is absolutely fabulous. Just two different styles of fabric. Two fabrics. Couldn't be simpler. And, and, and it goes together just really Perfect. well. You're going to have a great... And also, I go through the binding as well. Yes. So if you... Um, you, can, you don't have to bind your quilts mm -hmm. if you don't want to. Uh, but I go through the binding step-by-step -step instructions again so Wonderful. that I'm holding your hand. And also, if you've got questions, if you do get stuck, I have a Facebook page. You can contact yes, yeah. me directly and I will reply to you Definitely. and give you my advice. There you go. And sometimes it's so related. <laughs> no, <it's> 737 <laughs> Fabi doesn't give an advice on cooking brownies as well, I must admit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to give the recipe away, though. OK, fair enough, then. <laughs> um, £44.88, pence. you are going to get all four of those booklets um, in that combined bundle if you are going to go for that. But, of course, you can get hold of them individually at 11 99 at the bottom of your screen if you so wish. But, of course, Abigail's bought us a lot more than just those patterns. She's bought us some pieces to inspire you. We're looking at the planner here. Now, I've heard lots about planners. People are getting very much into planners, <coughs> jotting things down. Like the patterns you were just saying, there's areas there where you can jot things down. Yeah. So this, a sewing planner, what's this all about? Though? So, basically, um, this is a sewing planner. So, I'll just open it up so you can see a little bit inside. Okay. Lick my finger, sorry about that. So you've got information pages in here. So, for instance, um, fabric sizes. You've got your colour wheel in there. Oh, so if you're out and about, you can refer to that. But you've also got your project plans. So oh, okay. you've got what your idea is. Yeah. What do I need? So your equipment Clever. list. You've got your budget. Okay. So it can get out of hand, as mm -hmm. you know, Hayley. Oh, you yes. start something and you oh, get yeah. carried away. Um, work in progress completed, notes and design sketches. And again, you've got a blank page on the other side, so you can do any larger sketches that you want. You've got 20 pages of this. You've got 20 lined pages. Okay, useful. So for your shopping lists, for, mm -hmm. you know, all that sort of carry on ideas you might see when you're out and about exactly and then you've got your graph paper oh that's useful so really good for your mm -hmm. patchwork really good for um coloring in and, and designing yeah. and taking your ideas to that next level um 20 sheets of that as well so something that's going to be really handy it comes nice. with oh, okay. this okay, plastic right. envelope which will also fit in your patterns nice. so if you want to keep everything together like it comes idea. in this and you get eight plastic my, sorry mylar eight mylar templates these so for instance brilliant. these are for your english paper piecing or your patchwork if you wanted to make a patchwork quilt you've got the square there for you perfectly cut um yes. really useful to get you on your journey and again will sit nicely in your little folder very very useful tools have. and you are getting all of that for less than 13 pounds i know <gasps> That oh, no. is amazing. That is brilliant, Valley. Perfect. If you're just getting started with your sewing, maybe you've had a hand-me-down sewing machine. Maybe you've thought, right, I'm getting it out of the loft. I'm getting it out of yeah. the garage. I'm getting it from behind the sofa. And you're wanting to start creating, then this is the way to do it. That planner Sorry, is a brilliant it. way. You can't keep it. <laughs> Um, a brilliant way for you to actually make those notes as you're out and back. Instead of back of envelopes, instead yes. of those sticky notelets that aren't always sticky. Yeah, and you you know, you we leave things mm. here, there and everywhere. And it's great to keep an eye on where your projects are, how far yeah. along you are. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, OK, we're never going to finish everything we start because we don't really, yes, do we? Yeah. But it's good. You've, exactly. You've got it there for you. You have indeed. There you go. If you fancy getting hold of your planner, beautiful design as you can see there. 
full of lots of useful elements in there. And I have to say, if you're like me and you've got notes everywhere, I sometimes can't even understand what the note is Same. when you come across <laughs> it. Then this is the definitely the way to do it. Eight four six five two three, just twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Instant. If you add in that and alongside those patterns, you're looking at extra six pounds and fifty pence. So not much to add in to get yourself organised for twenty twenty. Now. Gave you a little tease earlier on those pinwheels. Oh, Ooh. my goodness. These are beautiful. <coughs> They've been incredibly popular, but we are now down to the last handful or so of these. Yes. Abigail, these are beautiful. I keep calling you Abigail, don't That's okay. you? you've been told off. It's, a, it's very nice. <laughs> <laughs> very formal. I've been called worse, Hayley. Um, <laughs> these are, they are my goodness. They are beautiful. <gasps> They're all Tilda. Okay. So there's no added in. There's no planes or anything like that added in. They're all yes. Tilda. Oh. So they're all your two and a half inch strips. There's 20 strips. So there's four colors five of each color so if you wanted to make yourself a small bar Delicious. jello you nice. can you totally yeah. can do if you wanted to get all three and make a larger bar mm -hmm. jello then again you can that each strip is 44 inches wide so it's Beautiful. from selvage to selvage okay so think about your binding as well you've got share. enough there definitely to do binding on a quilt um, two and a half inch strips as you know are incredibly popular oh, very useful. and if you go on to a search engine and you type mm -hmm. in projects for with two and a half inch strips there's loads out there that beautiful. you can do but these colors aren't they just something they're else absolutely amazing and they're tonally correct that's yes. the key thing because they've kind of got that antique look across all of them yes or that tone across all of them so you know if you take one of those greens alongside one of those peachy tones not a problem exactly and incidentally when you do check out some of these some of them have got very similar prints as you can see there so definitely do consider going for all of them and of course add them into your flexi order if you want to pink is the one that's proven to be the most popular that's the one at the moment that we've got least stock of so if that is the one that you want to get hold of please get hold of it quickly we're about 15 minutes into the hour that will not last the hour i know my fabrics and i know you as customers you will be buying that one <laughs> that's and my favorite too 17.99 so afford yeah yeah definitely go get for those now, ribbons and ribbons galore. Ribbons galore. Oh, these. <laughs> My goodness. You've got an array in here. Well, yeah, so you're getting 145 grams in each bag. Wow. Um, there is a, a huge variety. You'll Gorgeous. probably get two or three um, strips. They're just under a metre, really, each. Okay. Uh, you'll probably get a couple that are duplicates. But um, really, I mean, you, as crafters, we use ribbon in so many oh, different projects. It time. really, you know, think of your Christmas, saving yeah. these for Christmas or. Easter or whatever it is. Bunting and things like bunting. that. Having the, these kind of ribbons for your buntings, amazing. You've got woven ribbons, you've got satin ribbons, you've got Gorgeous. Queen of Hearts, you've got Best of British. Beautiful. You've got stacks in there, 145 grams, which actually Gorgeous. is a huge amount of ribbon. It's you like well, stuff. <laughs> well, I was just wondering with this, is, is that you've actually got a ribbon stitched on top of a ribbon there? I thought yeah. it was just kind of glitter that had been stuck in place, but it's Yeah, not. it's lovely, isn't it? Wow. Fabulous. Brilliant value Andy. for me. $9.99. Again, very affordable way for you to get hold of your bag of ribbons. One four five and um, one four five. 145 grams. That's just put a number in front of me and I just read it out. Uh, uh, like a performing seal. Nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Zero zero eight eight three one two. Excuse me, it's a carnival ribbon. Nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Zero zero eight eight three one two. Except I can't catch a ball on my nose. Well, can you not? We could have tried that. Oh, I'll have a go. <laughs> Keep working at it. Now, if you fancy getting hold of any of the goodies, you might want to check these out before you check out your basket. These are beautiful. Now, you're going to get two half meters. Yes. Both of these. Yes, both <gasps> of those in a wow. nice little bundle. Um, so, I've made the, um, I'm going to just get it. I've made the tote bag. That is a beautiful bag. Out of the Oriental. Oh, nice. And I love this. Um, if you follow my Facebook page, you'll know that I've also made my stair tidy out of this. Yes. And my stair tidy lives on my stairs. Yeah. And it's beautiful to open my door and see those colours. Yeah. Really nice is. happy fabric. Yeah, it is. And it's a lovely lightweight denim as well. I'm just going to put it back now. No problem at all. Um, and it's perfect if you do want to work against a lining fabric. You've got so much choice in here. Obviously, you've got that cool kind of chambray denim backdrop, but then you've got greens and pinks and reds in there as yeah, well. Yeah, dark grey. If, yeah. if you love your grey like I know Purple is really popular in there as well beautiful but think of your summer hats yes. little girls dresses yeah. um oh there's you know um, clutch bags hair, hair yes. oh yes oh, those lovely ones with the 
and knots on yes. now. That would look Everywhere amazing. I like those, yeah. yeah. Um, and brilliant value for money. £12.99. It's a good size piece with regards to those. And you're getting two of them. Um, a half meter of each of those. So if you fancy getting hold of them, then please do so. Three nine 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 four six. Very popular item as well. Abby's fabrics always are, because she knows quality. She's, she's a sewer just like you and I. So she's not going to bring anything she wouldn't use herself. That's true. So if you're wanting those, do make sure you get hold of them quickly. And you'll find them on the website. Obviously, on the website, you've got not only these fabrics, but you've got everything that we've been chatting about now if there's anything on there that you you want to have a little uh, kind of inquire about something you want to ask questions you know how you can get in touch studio at achanda.com there are some elements on there that we've not touched on during this hour those boutiques as well they're improving very popular um, oh they're gone oh i liked them as well wasn't quick enough obviously <laughs> but yes if you're wanting those pinwheels those are going to be the next thing that disappear particularly the pink option with regards to those so yeah if you like those do get hold of them and of course that printed denim as well absolutely beautiful i do like a hibiscus flower i must admit always makes me feel of holidays and warmer warmer climes oh yes yeah. um pop anything into your basket check your baskets out and don't forget if you are going for that pattern bundle you have got the ability to spread the whole of your order over two payments because you can't, of course you've got a flexi order on that one as well what are we up to then my dear so what i did want to say which i forgot to say was when you get your complete pattern pack your spiral binding will be slightly larger because when i've gone to um maneuver this around and use it and all that i noticed that it kept popping oh, off I see. you've got a lot of pages so you'll in just there, yeah. get yeah it'll just be slightly wider okay that's and actually fair it works better because you there's no tension mm -hmm. against it makes sense um, so just so you know there's going to be a slight a difference there. you're still going to get everything you know doesn't it matters not oh now something i need to tell you before we get into the throws it's sobby no. sorry it's sobby <laughs> sorry sorry abby jumping in there as i usually do all right those pinwheels got a little bit of news with regards to those the pink ones fastest finger first with regards to that one so oh, if you've got, got your eye on that one <laughs> don't leave it to the end of the hour um and it will go i am pretty sure of that i mean we're only what 20 minutes past the hour so yeah it's not gonna be there at the end of it so yeah get it now right so reading cushion yes tell me about this what's this i love reading cushions they're really popular but what i'm doing different in the pattern is i'm giving you the um the letters and characters oh, I see. so let me bring out the pattern pack and let me find it so you can see <coughs> excuse me oh there we go, straight to. so what you're getting is the instructions you're getting your characters lovely now these characters are for personal use only okay okay what i would recommend is that you get because <gasps> lovely stay away from superheroes and oh gosh, yes, things. yeah get animals yes. and, and ones that you can duplicate especially mm -hmm. if you draw your own think yeah. of the craft fair you can just flood your stall with all of those okay and but the the thing that you're getting is your alphabet now this comes to you back to front brilliant so of course then you We've can all done it. yes <laughs> isn't it frustrating as well you think oh i'm doing really well here no but it's coming to you back to front you've got Lovely. the whole alphabet you can then do all the names that you want to do Perfect. no bother at all so we're going to do a little bit of um, reading cushion okay so I'm just going to close that up. I've ruined that, Hayley. I've been oh, yanking on worry. it. Don't just, worry. Well, I was telling through earlier on. There's a lot in there. <laughs> there's have stacks. to say, loads of patterns in there. There's stacks in there. In there. Uh, it's, a really good, it's a really good pack, actually. Okay. So I'm just going to pop that. Um, Joe from the Mill Shop Online, I've got his um, double-sided. Oh, it's brilliant stuff. Yes, it is. Yes, yeah, the, um, the fusible um, backing. It's just get, so you, useful. It's like heat and fuse, isn't it? Yes, exactly. So you'll get all your dimensions in the pack, and I'm just going to stitch this pocket together because... Okay. I do the pocket first because when I then lay it on the front that denotes then where I put my letters and my character okay you don't want to put your character on the main first without putting your pocket on because you might be covering it yeah so good just point. I always say do the pocket first mm -hmm. I'll just give that a quick stitch lovely and then you've got um, scope as to where you're actually going to lay everything out especially if you've got a big character mm -hmm. or a long name you'll yeah. want to you know I love this fabric it's almost like, like ocean fabric it is, isn't, isn't it, it? Yeah, it is. it's like the, the break of the Excuse waves on there i just got to oh, okay though i've just praised his product and now it's getting in my way are you tripping over it <laughs> There, my fault, not Joe's fault. Yeah. Um, right, so, <coughs> excuse me. I do like to do a contrasting lining on this pocket. Okay. Uh, with this one, I've got a black lining. Very nice. And I think that works really nicely. 
Um, I made all these um, for Christmas, not Christmas just gone, Christmas before for my nieces and nephews. Oh, I bet they were thrilled. They were. And I put in, so Finley, he got um, a shark book. Um, Olivia got unicorn books. Um, my nephew William, he got dinosaur books. So Lovely. it works really nicely as a gift. Doesn't it just? Love to see things. Well, everybody likes to see something with their name on, especially if it's an unusual name. Yes, because you can't always find those in the sh in the shops if you're buying different bits and pieces. Can you books and things like that? Don't always have kids' names. I failed uh, there. Unusual. Oh, do, what happened? Well, because I thought this was boutique, so I just did it either any side I liked. Oh. It's not boutique. We're doing a bit of unsewing. Yes, it's a bit of. I, I was telling Reverse everyone. Sewing. Yeah, <laughs> I was telling everyone in the last hour. Hayley. Mm -hmm. These are wallpaper scissors. Oh, I see. Okay. And they're fair great. Enough. They're really great. But if you need some decent scissors yes. for not much money, wallpaper scissors. Oh, okay. They're really brilliant. And they've got a long, because they're long. They've got a long stretch, haven't And they're there? sharp, too. Yeah. So we'll pretend that I did that right. Okay. <laughs> right, so I'm just going to place that down there. Now, what I always do is I'll just pin this into place okay and then I know what area I've got to work with fabulous so just like so as you can oh, as you can see that's what good point I would yeah end see up with that for your placement now that would be right though yeah that's <laughs> so that's what you'd end up with but for the letters now it's important because they're the wrong way round right uh, okay where's my pen gone oh I don't know I'm not sure it's gone. In the pocket, it's gone it? somewhere. Uh, no. Any, whatever. Doesn't matter. Um, so, for your letters, what you would be doing would you be getting a heat and bond or your fuses? Fusey there's loads boxes. of different names out there, isn't it? Yeah. There's all sorts <laughs> yeah, of different names. Yeah, there's so names. many. Uh, but I do find this one particularly good. Um, I actually, when Joe was here, it was one of his first shows, and he was using it, and I. I very cheekily went over and I said, do you mind if I tried that? Mm -hmm. He said, yeah, of course. And he gave me a full bit. And that, that's it then for me. It's brilliant because I've, I've used quite a variety of different companies and some of them, they kind of start melting before you actually... Well, you get the iron close and the resi resi residual heat, is that the right yes. phrase? Kind of starts melting it before you need it yes. to melt so as well. Oh, we have got a pen for you. Oh, you need a pen Molly. Thank you. Thank you, Molly. So... Um, we'll choose a letter that's actually around the wrong way. A wouldn't be very useful. Um, so when you've got this, obviously you place it down. You want the tacky side or the, the rough side facing down okay. so that you can draw on this side. That's why it's designed like that, so you can draw on this okay. side. So you would be drawing your letter, which I obviously won't do, but you, you, know, you get the idea. It, yeah. um, and what you want to do is when you come to cut this out, give yourself a decent margin. So cut so don't here. Be too frugal. Don't cut against those lines because when you then go to adhere that onto your fabric, you're going to have to cut along that line again. Okay. What's the point in that? It just makes your life difficult. So you might as well give yourself a nice border, mm -hmm. then you're going to adhere it onto your fabric, Okay. then cut along that line. Makes then sense. you've got a perfect line. Yes. You, there's no messing around, you've got perfect line. And also as well, it's going to support your fabric as you cut in those finer details. Because some of those letters, lots of letters, have kind of got a hole in the middle, which I believe has actually got a name to it. I was talking to Lou Sims about that, but we oh, did decide it? what the little hole is. You know, in like a letter A or in a letter B, you've got the little hole. Apparently it's got a name. I would never have known that. I'm, I'm standing here like, oh, it will come to me, but no, I wouldn't. <laughs> no, it's just a hole. It's just a hole. <laughs> so, um, what I've done is I've just pre-prepared my Lily's... Um, because uh, it's yeah. a short name. Okay. But what's good is if you use a pin, um, mm -hmm. if it's really a lot of... That just fell off. Uh, I haven't used enough heat. Um, a lot of these really do grab. Okay. Um, so I'm just going to get that back on. Okay. And I tend to rip a, rip a hole in the, the paper lining. Right. And then it's a lot easier to peel off. Lovely. Um, of course, this is where your mat comes in very, very useful. I don't know if we've got these in stock at the moment, though, have we? I don't think no, we've we got the 12 by 12, but we got, I think we've got the 6 by 8. Which would be good if you were doing a smaller oh, yeah, piece completely. like these. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Is that one? No, I need to do that one a bit more, too. It's the L's. Attack of the L's. <laughs> So yeah, so everyone got one of these ma uh, one of these cushions. Good idea. And Seb, I made him one for this Christmas because he didn't get one last Christmas. He was very cross about it. Oh dear. Um, and I did do a superhero character because 
It was just for Seb for home. And also, what you can do is if you, sometimes you get fabrics, don't you, that have actually got superheroes on there. So you can actually using the um, yes. the, the heat and fuse that Tim Joe brings to us. You can actually use that, and it won't fray the edges. It's very clever. It, yes, stuff. it's brilliant, isn't mm -hmm. it? Really good stuff. So you'll peel off your backing. Um, now, I like to do um, a running stitch round or, or free okay. motion. Now, with these, because they're very blocky letters, mm -hmm. you can just use your normal foot and just go nice start and, and stop, start and stop, easy. You Gorgeous. can free motion on them if you want to. Nice. You can do a lovely satin stitch on there. Could you hand stitch them you if you want to? You could completely hand stitch them. You could completely hand stitch this whole thing. Yeah. Um, they're just... Easy, straightforward. Take it as far as you want to take it. For instance, I personally think if I um, had a, a grandparent or an elder relative in like a residential home mm -hmm. or something like that, having one of these but with florals on, lots of images, yeah. really beautiful. And not just for reading. My, I mean, my mum, bless her, um, she turns 90 in the summer and she's in a, a, a kind of a little retirement flat. And literally, her, her life is on the sofa. Yes. Everything is there. The remote control, a cough suite, a hearing, all those bits that she needs are literally within arm's reach. But the trouble is that they tend to go down the side of the sofa. Yes. So until somebody actually pops around, they can't get those bits out. Yeah. With these, it doesn't have to be a reading book, does it? TV you could controls. have your TV remote in yeah. there. You could have all those TV bits and guide. pieces, pen close to hand, all the things that you need in those pockets there. Um, and then it's comfy as well. Just it's coming out with all the ideas there. I was like, what, what, what else? What else? <laughs> but it's it's true it's it's yes it, you can have them for children yeah yes absolutely but they're also good for other things you don't need to put the name on you might want to take that name and put it on a placemat or well, you might want to put a, a different phrase on there or something completely like that. oh yeah you could yeah. you could home sweet home, home. exactly yeah, whatever, whatever you, you want like. but you've got that um alphabet backwards for the applique it's so useful mm. and i refer to mine so often because i like to put lots of names on things <laughs> so i go to it every time and a lot of the times i forget and i just draw them and i go oh no it's easy it's easy backwards. if you're doing it yourself you need that um, letter also felt's a nice fabric to work with Ooh, with a yes. as well, and fleece as well because they don't necessarily fray as yeah well, completely nice completely things. so you'll be peeling off your backing and then you're ironing that on and then okay. and then it's just a case of doing the same for the character so um the unicorn for example Let's see if I can. No, not too far in. Not as lucky this time, right? No, you opened see. it. Oh. Bang on the right page. There you go. You just got a lucky dinosaur. It's like it, meant, it was meant <laughs> to be. So, again, this is backwards because I like to have the unicorn going that way. Okay. Um, if you wanted it to go the other way, mm -hmm. um, you could probably see through it and put it up against the window. Good idea. No problem. Um, on the picture... Could be a horse as well. Yeah, uh, yeah, definitely. On the picture for the front of this pattern, you've actually got a Diplodocus. Awesome. But I've given you a Tyrannosaurus instead. Oh, okay. Uh, because apparently that's better. Oh. According to the young folk in my I life. I wouldn't know. Diplodocus, no. Oh, not trendy. T Rex, yes. Oh, I see. So, oh, uh, Molly's yeah, Molly getting in agreement there. <laughs> Who'd have thought? It's the little arms, I think. Oh, is they it? Like okay. the little, I don't know. Um, I was going to do an impression. I've re re I didn't. Um, that, yes. Not tall enough. No, no that's true. <laughs> Neither am I frightening enough. Um, <laughs> But yeah, so those are for personal use, and it does say that in the pattern as That's well. Fair so enough, is that one they yeah, exactly. But the actual making of the cushion, the concept of the cushion, we're able to make that and sell Completely. that. That's not a problem. And the letters it's as well, you, the, you're that font, there. you can do that. You okay. can go, you can go to town with that. And I think um, for a Christmas, oh, Christmas, that's not the word. For a school fete, things like that, mm -hmm. these would be great ones because you can actually personalise these while the. While the family's going off, good point. It yeah, takes seconds nice to do that. Um, but of course, if you go for that bumper bundle, the details are on your screen there. It's not just about that reading cushion. You can get fabulous little projects like this. But yeah. again, you could personalise that if you wanted oh, to. Oh, completely. With the That's a quilt as you go um, hot water bottle cover as well. So you also get instructions of how to make a larger one. Nice. And you can take that onto. Have you seen those long water bo hot water bottles now? No. Oh, they're crazy. They're just a long long hot water bottle oh i don't uh, know the, the no, bo I've body bottles or something oh, okay. yeah oh, right. we'd never get me out of bed if there's one of those yeah i would be totally <laughs> honestly i need now, one this is nice and this is teaching people um how to work with the hexagon perhaps from the planner to exactly. start with yes and then build up maybe using those pinwheel rolls that we were looking at to Completely. build up that depth plan yeah it. again another quilt as you go project i love this i'm really into my hexagons i think this is stunning i beautiful. think also you could do this in just one color and it would look beautiful nice. christmas spring summer mm. 
a wedding perhaps if you wanted it in whites and laces yeah. and scrap buster mm -hmm. it's totally it's totally scrap buster because mm -hmm. that's two and a half inch strips it's just that center one and again for the instructions it tells you like i'll, I'll get it because it's a it's a good one to show you oh there we are look i nearly went right to it <laughs> oh, that's me it's me um, it tells you on the front, so you need a fat quarter for the backing and the hexagon centre. Okay. You need a fat quarter for the binding. You need five times two and a half inch strips in various colours, and then the wadding of your choice. And I'm guessing that once you've learnt that concept, if you wanted to go larger and larger and larger, you could do. Yes, uh, or, and you could also, because these are quilt as you go, um, you could then attach another one on. Nice So you idea. could do a satin stitch, join them together, and mm. go go big and love it you're getting all of these patterns and then when you've got into the kind of the grips of your quilting how about the bargella i mean this is beautiful again this is one of those patterns that's included in that bumper bundle that we've just been chatting about most people are going for the bumper bundle why do you think that is i think that it's great value yes yeah, and it's a great point, thing to yeah. have on your on your desk and to refer to because a lot of us when we go into our um, craft shops and things like that they've got all the fabric we could possibly want yes. But there really isn't any inspiration there for what you could do with it, mm -hmm. apart from maybe a bit of patchwork. Yes. So this is a great thing to have. And even if you if you think to yourself, oh, I really like um, four projects, it's a great one to keep because yes. one day you'll come across it. You go, ah, oh, today's the day I'm going to make that one. That's it. Going to use those. Yeah. Elements and you've got up. this exact quilt that you can make. Gorgeous. And yeah, I haven't finished it because. I don't. It's <laughs> always a work in progress with me. That's fine. But I love it. Gorgeous. I love it. It makes me so happy. You can use all different colours. You can blend. I've gone for a step in the colour. Mm -hmm. But you can go for tones all the way mm -hmm. through. You can go down and then up again. Is it as complicated as it looks? Oh, it's so easy. Really? Oh, Bargello is easy peasy. Okay. Because all you're doing is sewing your strips together. Okay. You then take. So, so for example, you've got your strips of your um, pinwheel. Okay. You're stitching them all together into a long rectangle. Right. You're then stitching the bottom to the top so you've got a tunnel. Like a tube, yeah. yeah. You're needling off one end and then you're cutting it in increments of size. Oh, going I up see. in size and then down in size. Right. Then you're opening the seam up in okay. different points. Right. So that when you lay them out you've got this Lovely, effect. Lovely, yes. It's one day this took me. No. One day <gasps> My goodness. And honestly, I think I could have backed and bound it in the same day also. Getting that impact look. Yeah, and, and actually I was a bit annoyed with myself because I was enjoying it. Yeah. So I carried on and then I thought, oh, I could have actually... Yeah, like wait, I could have dragged this out a bit and longer. And it's one of those ones, when you look on the screen, you see that natural wave that you've got in there. That's oh, all lovely. down to those increments that Abby was yeah. telling us about. So and and, yeah. and this, this exact one, the increments for this are in the plan. Mm -hmm. In the plan, You can also um, take it for yourself and, and maybe you like the smaller um, smaller um, cuts mm -hmm. and you're not so keen on the bigger ones yeah. you can go bigger you can go to say this point and then go smaller again yes good point you don't have to go all the way up to this is probably three and a half inches um or three inches you don't have to go that far yeah, that's fine, it's right? up to you and not, also if you were to if you wanted to take then this up yeah it's then you would undo the you go back up undoing okay if that makes sense. It all makes it's sense when you get the it's instructions. In and that's what it's all about. The details <laughs> are on your screen there. Um, 737861. If you want to take advantage of these, now is a perfect opportunity while we share something with you. Check this out. Flexi Order has arrived at her chanda. What is Flexi Order? When you place an item on FlexiBuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi Order which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments, so you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping basket, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for a Flexi order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly FlexiBuy payments, offering you the extra flexibility when you shop with us. FlexiOrder, making your shopping experience with Achanda easier. 
certainly does. And especially when you're going for a bumper bundle, um, I like the patterns that we've been chatting about. And the details are at the bottom for that bumper bundle. But we also appreciate, or Abby appreciates, you might not want to go for everything. You might want to go for individual patterns. And that's why we've got the details on your screen. 11 99 very affordable way for you to get hold of any one of these. So are you going to want to create that fabulous reading cushion that we just looked at? Quilt as you go, um, a, a bottle cover as well, as well as that hexagon placement. Maybe Bargello is going to be your thing. Maybe it's the tote bag that you're going to be creating. Or maybe you are into your knitting. Totally fabulous. I like that. But this is the project that I want to have a look at. You've got your table runner and your placemat. Now, of course, what you're going to be doing is actually creating those blocks. But then once you've got a block, you can go anywhere with it. It could be a single block where you can just be creating a placemat, as you can see there. Very easy, very simple. That might be the way that you try that out. But then you might think, hang on a minute, I'm going to make a set of six of those. I'm going to do a table runner. I'm actually going to make a quilt using that block. You could be making a king size quilt from that initial block that you have created using that pattern. That is the beauty of having a pattern and the tuition of someone as fabulous as our Abby. She takes it back, strips it right the way back, makes it as simple as simple can be. So you can take that information on board, understand why you are doing things and the reason why you're putting them together in a certain way way and then you're building those stepping stones to take you from that single block potentially to a large king size quilt and you can do that for just 11 pounds and 99 pence one of those patterns to start with to be fair the majority of you are going for the bumper bundle the details of which are at the bottom of the screen and of course as our lovely leone explained to you that opens up your flexi order which means you can add any of those other goodies into your basket as well so for the time being if you want the individuals 317713 that's your item number 11.99 for each one of those that you choose to go for or at the bottom of the screen where you get that bumper bo um, book with everything in there, £44.88. Just to reiterate, if you're going for the bumper bundle, they all come in one book together rather than your four individuals, just so you're aware of that. Now, what else can we tempt you with? Well, how about getting yourself organised? If you are like me and you jot down notes, and I do it all the time, I jot down a note, and it could be just the next day or two days later, I come back to it and I'm like, first of all, I've got to read my own handwriting because I've scribbled it down. And then also understand and decipher what I meant by that note in the first place. By having your planner, it gives you the ability to lay everything out clean and simple and makes it nice and easy. Now, you can see here, You've got your references with regards to your fabrics. That's something that's very useful to have close at hand, especially if you are out shopping for your fabrics and you're not entirely sure. You know it's a fat quarter, but then a fat quarter could be different sizes. It might be the equivalent of a fat quarter that you're wanting to use because you were going to cut the fat quarter up. Just gives you an idea and a guideline. So when you see that fabric that you like the look of and it's not necessarily in that particular format, you can figure it out or get the person to help you figure that out. Within here, you've got the ability to make your project plan. Now this is something, sometimes when you're working on a larger project you need to take time to jot down everything you need. Might be that rather than you taking your uh, patterns with you, um, you might just jot down, I need such and such in whatever colour, fat quarter in pink, a fat quarter in um, red, I need um, three strip rolls to do my binding, different things like that. And also it gives you your budget and that's something that if you are working within a budget for a particular project, maybe it's a bespoke project that you're doing for somebody, then you need to make sure you're staying within that budget little sketches you might have ideas as you're going out and about things that you wanted to add to your project but then you have got the scope to add at the end here you've got notes where you can be creating with those and also your grid there for laying out and creating your patterns maybe then you've got your pieces. Your mylar pieces are fabulous because you've got different sizes and different geometric shapes. You've got things like your squares there, so if you are wanting to square off a patch to make sure that they are all uniform, then you can do. You've also got your smaller ones there if you are looking at doing a smaller piece. And also, if you are wanting to lay one within the, the other, maybe you're going to do a little bit of quilt as you go, then you can do quite easily with those. Your triangles, you've got your three different sizes of triangles there. It could be mini bunting that you're doing with these. It could be that you're putting them together to create different shapes obviously these two different sizes but when you cut your fabrics you know what I mean then you've got your hexagons if you're doing your tiny English paper piecing then you can do that quite easily or take those larger ones and create as you go with these really is a fabulous bundle and you are getting everything mylar pieces and your planner as well as your storage wallets all for just $12.99 really is a fabulous little way and I love the way that it's clear so you can see exactly what's in there as you go um, um, 846-523 now 
pinwheels. Need to tell you about the pinwheels as well. I've stepped away from Abby, so um, we should get herself ready for her next demo. We'll be popping back there in the next few moments. But this is the time for you to get hold of your Tilda strip pinwheels. You've got three choices with regards to these. $17.99 being your prize, and they're all very, very popular, very popular. Limited quantities of stock available for you now. Gorgeous greens, as you can see. There's so many colours that you can pick out from here. Peach tones in there, minty greens in there, deeper teals within that design. Again, gorgeous colours, gorgeous prints. But some of these prints work across the fabric. Can you see how those two are the same there? So, of course, you could use those alongside each other if you want to. Really is a fabulous quality pinwheel um, collection, as you can see there. So you've got your greens. Ever popular pink, if you're wanting to get hold of your pink, then you can do bright cerises in there, vintage star tones in there as well. Absolutely beautiful. And the final one that you've got, more of your kind of peachy orangey tones. Um, again, they all work so well together. Um, you've got elements of your orange within your green one there, so those are naturally going to work together. And, of course, the pink featuring as well. So, to be honest, they will go all the way across. Of course, the beauty is it's tilt fabric. So, if you do need to go for larger pieces, then you know you can actually go and find that fabric to work alongside your strip rolls. Traditional width, so you've got your two and a half inches with those, and there's a whole host of different projects you can create with those, including some of those projects that we were looking at just a few moments ago. Treat yourself to those. Tilda fabric, absolutely incredible, and a beautiful set, as you can see there. $17.99, whichever of those three you choose to go for. Not really disappointed with those at all. Same with the ribbons. This is a bumper bundle. With these, you've got all sorts of different ribbons that are going to be coming to you. Might be that you're getting your wider ribbons, as you can see. Might be some of those skinnier ribbons, some designer ribbons within here. Some might that you've got some um, different phrases, as you can see, they're um, interwoven or printed onto these. Really is a vast array, but a brilliant value bundle at £9.99. You've got 145 grams worth in there. You've got burlap style ribbons in there with a stitch glitter ribbon on top. That's not stuck in place. That's not like, like a um, going to come off on your hands or anything. It's actually a ribbon that has been put together through stitching. And again, a really nice array of ribbons. There are loads to be playing with like that. 008312. Now, before we head back and see Abby, let me tell you about these fabrics. Oh, these are gorgeous. Now, I'm going to open one of these pieces up because we didn't have a look at this. Really good size pieces. So, if you were thinking of making cushion covers with these, quite easily, you can take that triangle, square that off, and there you go. You're looking at probably at least three cushion fronts. I probably would use a plane with these to maximise that print. So, bear that in mind. Across the two pieces of fabric, you could be making six cushion fronts with this for $12.99. Quite easily incorporating a green or maybe some denim, maybe, with these as well. Really nice pieces. So, of course, you've got your two half metres coming to you for just £12.99. Beautiful quality. And, of course, you've got your hibiscus flowers on the one that we were just looking at. And kind of like your cherry blossom on your other there, as you can see, your oriental. £12 and 99 pence 399 at 946 you are going to get both of those so if you fancy those you need those item numbers 399 at 946 website's place to go you'll find them on there lots of other goodies on there some of which have sold out unfortunately so just to warn you if you see something that you like the look of especially those pinwheels you need to be quick do not miss out on anything there I had to say goodbye to those fat eights there as you can see I got my eye on those. Did like the look of those gorgeous blues, but they've gone. We can't talk about those. But of course, your pattern packs as your individuals or your bumper complete collection are still available there, as are the planner kit as well. Nice little bundle to go for. Um, so yeah, whichever you fancy popping into your basket, make sure you check your basket out in a timely fashion. I love this idea, so it's just one of yeah. those projects again. It is, and it's something that you could do as a quick gift mm. for somebody. Um, I made one for my auntie for Christmas. I, I got her a secret Santa. Um, so she got one of these and uh, think of the, the colours that people like. You, again, you could do your makeup brushes, you could do your paint brushes. Nice if you're idea. going on a course mm. for the day and you wanted to take them in there, wow. I, I cut my ribbon wrong. That's okay. Just you just get an idea. But um, other than that, it's a great project nice. that you've got the scope to have it as it is because it fits your knitting needles nice. in it beautifully. Yeah. But you've also got the ability to change it up. You can make it shorter for your makeup brushes. Exactly. Mm. And, and longer. So if you've got a huge selection mm. you could do that you could That's add in your cloth wider and wider, and, yeah. yeah completely so again you, and you could add in your wipeable fabric so if you were going to use the inks and, and all yeah. that stuff you can pop them in there no bother beautiful there you go that's just one of those projects within that. that bundle that we've got there really nice pretty fabrics i like that 
yes. good choice of fabrics as well. Really cute. Anyway, it's not about that because that's not what we're making. What are we up to? Well, I just wanted to show you um, quite an in-depth look at the pictures that you get as a step-by-step. -step. Okay. Because I think it's important to you, for you to see the quality of the photograph and how you, it, you follow it. Um, okay. This is an example. This is the Quilt As You Go Hot Water Bottle cover. Um, and I just wanted you to see how many pictures you get. So you... That's, My I've goodness, it's literally so every it's, step. It's every step. It's all for you there. It, it keeps going. And, and this can be adapted for any size hot water bottle. Yes, well, it can. It? Yeah. You've got... I've taken pictures of the steps that I would personally struggle with. Okay. The things like, for instance, where it says top stitch... I've not put a picture in because yeah. top stitch. You don't want a picture top of a top stitch. stitch. Mm -hmm. Or um, now stitch with a quarter of an inch seam allowance. Again, you don't want to see that. But you might want to see that when I've laid the two pieces at the back together, I've laid the front bit first. Right. So, for example, here, I've laid the front bit over the... <coughs> sorry, I've laid the top bit over the front bit first, and okay. then I've laid the bottom bit over. Makes so sense. things like that you will want to see and you want if you want to do it exactly how I've done it then that's, that's important because when you come to turn things inside out and that's when you see the exactly what I would recommend for the hot water bottle cover is use a wadding rather than a foam okay. I've used a foam with that and I found it too rigid yeah they can be a little bit fighty yes exactly and uh, I instantly thought to myself oh that's not right but Think about, um, so for example, my son Jaden, he would like a thin wadding mm -hmm. because he loves the heat. He yeah. loves the heat. Mm -hmm. Whereas I made one of these for my nanny Jean at Christmas, cat fabric, and I did a thicker wadding yeah. because she's going to have it on her knees for longer, yes. but she might not necessarily feel that, that heat's coming through. Yeah. So it's up to you what wadding you choose. Right. Just don't use a foam wadding. Okay. Use a flexible, yeah. malleable one. That's you're a good gonna, word. You've got a small area there that you're turning. Turning things through, it can be tricky, can't they? Yes. Got some it's fine too, yeah, so there's no point. Don't make it difficult for yourself, that's what I say. Um, what are we up to then? Hexagon placement. Oh, okay, right. Quilt as you go. Nice. I've taken the um, template from the sewing planner. Okay. You do get a template in the back of the pattern book, so you can draw that out, cut it out, whatever you like. But I find this one... You know. Well, I think it's, you can use it over and over again, aren't you? Well, so, exactly. Yeah. And also, if you're going for um, accuracy, mm -hmm. and if you wanted to make a lot of these and join them all together, your Mylar template really is um, very useful. Okay. So I'm just going to draw around this. So that's my template. I'm going to cut this out with my wallpaper scissors. I love this because it's literally, as you look at this, you, you could never have stitched... A project before and Abigail's showing you exactly how to do it, how you create your template, um, how you create your, your hexagon um, and then what all the different stages of, of what you need to do. Yes. Um, and, really easy. And um, it, it is straightforward and it's one of those ones where you can take it as far as you want to take it. Mm -hmm. If you want to do it as I've done it um, and follow this in follow the step step by step then yes absolutely. If you wanted to add more together, if you wanted to do it smaller more and tiny mm -hmm. you can do it if you wanted to do it huge go for it um, so you what you've got is you've got the basis and then it's up to you it's, it's just that first initial step isn't it? it is um, so you're when you're doing quilt as you go your first piece is the only piece unless you've got a different pattern happening elsewhere it starts face up Oh, okay. All your other pieces start face down because you're flipping them over. Does it have to be a plain fabric? No. Oh, okay. No, no. Any fabric you like. Mm -hmm. I just like the plain because I like that pop. Yes. That's just personal preference. Okay. Uh, but what you need to do, I nearly didn't, but you need to adhere your large hexagon okay. onto your backing fabric because this is quilt as you go. Okay. So you need that um, on there already. I love quilt as you go. It's just so easy, so, it's so it? easy, and it's so satisfying. Mm -hmm. um, it, together so quickly. Yes, it uh, really is, and you think to yourself, wow, I, that's quick, that was good, I, I enjoyed that. So placing your hexagon on, you would need to pin it. Okay. Or you can... Um, give it a spray. Give it a spray if you want to, but I'll just pin it, like so. Then you've got all your measurements for this this one mm -hmm. exactly what size strips you need to go out so okay. we start with the smaller strip and I always start at the top and you need to line up your corner so hopefully you can see that corner there oh yeah. look, at, look at that shot oh that's oh. Andy he's good hello 
look at that. So um, your top corner, you need to line up with this corner here. Okay. And you want this excess here. And you're going to stitch quarter of an inch to the end. Oh, so you don't trim it off. Nope. Do you explain that end. in the instructions? Though? Yes. That's good because I'll have forgotten by the time Absolutely. I get this. Absolutely. So just pin this in. Oops. Pin. Go on, pin. You can do it. <laughs> there we are. So, yes, so quarter inch all the way to the end. Okay. And your pieces will all be the same length so that when you go to each end, on the reverse, your quilt, your stitch is the same. Okay. Like right there. So we'll stitch that one. <laughs> You don't need the sound effects, though, of the... <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to do that. That's not as optional. OK, optional extra. You can make yeah, the noise of your machine as you That's not in the go. pattern. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, a quarter of an inch all the way to the end. I'm just going to move that because I'm going to knock it off. And I would like to apologise for my sniffing. I know it's annoying. So, all the way to the end. Um, you can do a tiny weenie back stitch. OK. Take this off here. And don't forget, if you are going for the individuals, this particular one for um, the Quiltish Go project, the placemat, you can see there at the bottom there, um, you've got your reading cushion also in here. You've also got your hot water bottle as well, all coming within that one. 11 99 Each one of these books, you've got all the information that you need. Um, and this are lots of you going for the individuals. So you can see you've got your table runner and your placemat. And of course, you've got your fabulous little uh, box bag there. Again, using up some of those scraps, maybe. This is the one where you've got your um, tablet co um, cover or purse. Then, of course, you've got your roll-up bag, which could be knitting needles, could be paintbrushes. And of course, you've got the fabulous tote bag that we saw earlier. And the final one being your barge yellow and your lap quilt if you're wanting to go for all of them then we have got the details at the bottom for your book with them all in there but if you want your individuals details are on your screen there perfect so we've stitched that one now you have to trim your threads as you go okay. because when I flip this over I could potentially get those threads caught in my next quilting okay. and this is the back we want it to be nice and neat um, normally I wouldn't bother because it's going to be sandwiched between layers yes. but because we're quilting as we go you want to trim off your threads lovely now, placing this back, taking out finger press, don't okay. bother pressing right. because you might stretch your fabric. Okay. Um, just a nice little finger press is, is all you need, like so. Nice Already beautiful oh, hexagons. Very effective. Now, you would instantly think to yourself, oh, this is the one I'm going to do next. Mm, yeah. No, it's oh. not. Don't do it. Okay. Go to the left. Always to the left. To the left, to the left. Yeah. Always make sure as well you've got the instructions. And this is why it's important, yes. because the picture would show you instantly, wouldn't it? Exactly. You haven't even got to read the words. You can look and you think, all oh, right, okay, to that side. And it's another one where if you keep doing it wrong, you can just write on the other page. Yes, yeah. To the left. To the that's left. it. <laughs> um, so or maybe get a little highlighter or something Yeah, exactly. Like that. So that's, that's really handy. Mm. So taking my next fabric, again, going to that point and taking that fabric right across here. And I'm going okay. to stitch all of that again. So pinning that. If you just remember every time to the left, okay, you'll be fine. You might, you could write it on your hand. You could put a big star on yeah. my hand. To this so one. I'll just stitch this one. And again, you're just using those off cuts. Might be that you've had another project. Maybe you've gone for those um, pinwheels, the strip pinwheels earlier on. You've got those little bits that are left over. Don't ever throw those away because as long as they are uniform width, then you can be creating with these because you'll see that the first few pieces are exactly the same length, but they're what you technically would call scraps of fabric. Um, and of course, you can make them up your scraps into usable pieces and make your own strips as time goes on if you want to as well. So, again, trim it. If you've got one, a lovely machine that cuts the thread for you there that's ideal but mine doesn't do that so so now you'll see on the reverse oh yes how those lines meet yeah now that i wouldn't have been able to do that if i wasn't following the line of the fabric yes, yeah so it's perfection absolutely spot it's on. spot on so now we turn it over okay. always put it back so your first one is at the top because then you're always remembering to go round good point so opening that one up and finger pressing already you can see it looks beautiful i love those colors now you don't have to trim off this bit that's underneath no oh, okay. well, i mean you can you totally can me, right? but what's the point because yeah. you're not actually going to go over that again with anything else okay there's not not there's only that bit yeah you know two extra two layers um it really is absolutely fine if you're doing um like a crazy, oh, effect, the crazy patch, yeah. trim off 
okay. because you're going to end up with bulk. Yes. Uh, but with this, it's absolutely fine. You can see it's lovely flat, and especially if you use a pressing mat afterwards and press this, you've got no bother at all. Now, from what you said, I know that I'm going to the left. Yes. So this is the next piece. That's it's going to go it. in the face. And it's always to the corner. Okay. I love it. This is one of those so ones. Easy, isn't it? Satisfying. A friend of mine was referring to something a little while ago. She said it's mindful sewing. I said, well, what do you mean mindful sewing? It's something that you don't really have to think about. Yes. A breakaway project. You might have another project that you're having to concentrate on. Maybe it's a cross-stitch pattern or maybe it's a larger cut. You're really having to think and concentrate. But you want something that you just want to relax and just kind Enjoy. of... Enjoy. Yeah. Enjoy mindful the stitching, stitching again. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Because with this, you're not really cutting. You're... You're just using your two and a half inch strips yeah. so you and you've repaired them you've cut them already and then it's just a case of laying them out or oh, just put that around the right way and yeah. um, we're busy again now for that bumper bundle so if you're wanting to go for the complete collection you've got 11 patterns in there all those individuals that we spoke of in that bumper book look at that all jam full of the fabulous it's patterns. jam full it is jam full and you've got everything in there so you've got the patterns you've got the templates all the photographs there's nothing extra in here um, you're not lost anything for it all going together and of course you've got the fabulous templates to help you on your way as well um, it is proving to be popular again during this out 75 pounds saving because each one of these if you are looking um, at a pattern being um, well around a tenner you're looking at 30 pounds worth of patterns in one of those so you're looking at 110 worth pounds worth of patterns in there but that's not what you're paying you are paying 44 pounds and 88 pence to get them all in one go Two flexi buys. One thing I will say to you is, with flexi buy, if you are thinking about getting the um, a couple of those patterns at eleven ninety nine, bear in mind that flexi buy there is twenty two forty four. So if you're going to go for two sets, maybe you're going to go for um, the placemat that we're working on at the moment. Maybe you fancy having a little go at the bargello. Maybe those are the two that you're thinking of. Well, that's going to cost you. Well, you're looking at what twenty six pounds more or less, aren't you, with regard yeah. to that? Yeah. But. It's going to be less than that with your flexi buy. Your flexi buy is just twenty two forty four, and you will get all of them. So you're actually paying out less than you're anticipating today, but you are getting all eleven of those patterns. That's yeah. worth it. Yeah, and that's a, that's a project a month up till the new year now, exactly, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah. So is you've got something. You've got yeah. something to do every month with all your bits and pieces. You're going to find. You're going to see fabrics throughout the year, and you're going to go all for that. I've that. got that. Put it in your planner. Put it in your planner. Mm -hmm. Oh, amazing. But look at the back of this again. So we've now we've stitched this line. You can see how lovely, lovely that's come, come together. together. Really Pinwheels nice. would be good for this as well, wouldn't they? Completely. Because the fabric is so yeah, pretty. Completely. Yeah. Um, and then you just go carry on again to the left. Okay. You can move it round. <laughs> I'm not going to watch Once you. Once you get into the swing of it, you, you get to know. As soon as you put a few of those in place. Um, Abby, I've had a fabulous hour. Me too, Amy. Always love working with you. So inspirational, especially with your fabulous patterns. And everything Thank you, you very much. Well. So yeah, I do when enjoy When are we expecting patterns. you back again? Do we know? Have we got a date yet? First of February. Oh, I say. I've got something special. <gasps> She's got a gleam in her eye. Something special. I'm putting a ring around my cat. I'm going to put mm -hmm. it in my planner. My planner oh, yeah. that's down there mm -hmm. on the counter. Yeah. That's what you need that for. Abby, thank you so much. Thanks, Looking forward to 1st of February. Put a big ring around there. You need to be here watching our lovely Abby because uh, when she brings something good, she brings something good. Now, if you've got anything in your basket, now is the time to check out your baskets. We've got another fabulous show coming up straight after the break, so do make sure you stay tuned. But before that, we have got a little bit of information. We've got our fabulous Alex and Paul coming up in a few minutes. But first... But first, I have to tell you what's coming up. So I've got Matthew Palmer coming up at four o'clock, followed by final call with Paul and myself. And then, of course, we've got Love Lunch with a brand new launch. What are you up to, you two? Hello, Paul. Hello, Alex. Hello. Right, so it's been nearly a year, hasn't it, it it's since... the very first craft along launch yeah, last year. Which was Barbara, and so it's like a year's celebration. Barbara's yep. going to do the next Come one. Come back again. So we've got a beautiful collection here. Um, so for the craft along, Barbara's going to be using our beautiful um, fresh cut aperture dye. Okay. Um, then together, we've got the beautiful two-way overlay stamp and they work independently or together. Mm -hmm. And then finally, you've got the seven by seven stencil as well. Wonderful, and it's going to be um, on the 16th of February. Two from till four. Two till four, yeah. lovely. Now, can I ask our Meg just to remind me, what's the last day for guaranteed delivery? 
uh, really 13th of February that's the last day for gu uh, guaranteed delivery and you'll also be able to as long as you order before then use your five pound pound voucher in mm. the crafting shop yeah and when you receive this at home what you're also going to receive is an ingredients list right and it may look as if oh my goodness I need loads and loads of stuff but you don't because a lot of the stuff will be duplicated throughout the project wonderful So this will come in the kit with you and it will say for this particular project, that's what you're going to need. We've got the product codes on there. Oh, brilliant. So if you haven't already got it, you can have a look in oh, the brand shop. Oh, that's good. Um, or you can just supplement it for something else that you Absolutely. think will be suitable. Lovely. Thank you, Paul. Well, the details are on screen. It's 2497 082739. But make sure you join us for the Craft Along. Thank you. Hi, I'm Lou from Studio Light. Studio Light has been around for about 40 years now. They're based in the Netherlands. It's a family-run business with a great heritage. The products that Studio Light bring us are very diverse, fantastic dyes, great papers, but all round on trend. Over the 40 years Studio Light have evolved, they listen to me, the demonstrator, and you, the customers, and really take our ideas on board. On the Echander Shows, we'll share with you the diverse techniques and products will inspire you to produce your own individual pieces of artwork. So make sure you don't miss the Studio Light Shows on Echanda. Good afternoon, and I'm joined by Matthew. Hello, Matthew. Hello. Happy New Year. Happy. Oh no, yes, still. it's been uh, still. We're still <laughs> going to be saying this, aren't we? Now, Matthew, you have brought for us today some fantastic books um, from from Search Press. What yes. do you like about these? Yeah, so it's the first time we've seen these on TV, so we can treat this as a bit of a TV launch. Really excited about this because this is called the uh, Paint Pad Artist, and we brought you three of these. Uh, which you can buy individually or you can buy them as a set of three. Now mm. these are a wonderful thing because it takes the fear right. away from watercolour painting because we've given you a wonderful hardback book mm -hmm. with these wonderful elastic sort of bands like you get on a um, sketchbook that you yeah, buy from an art shop. Absolutely. So we base this on a sketchbook that you get from an art shop because we've given you the instructions to do six watercolours and at the back of the book we're giving you six pre-sketched, pre-sketched uh, sheets of watercolour paper, thick premium watercolour paper, ready to paint straight on. Brand new product here on TV. See, there you go. Yeah, TV launch we were it saying. Is, yeah, we? It is, yeah, it is, it yeah, is. Um, so is. this is your watercolour landscape. So as you can see, take that it's nice... It's a gorgeous, uh, nice thick cover. It really is. It's well protected, this. Absolutely. Su super quality. So it's going to be quite nice. Now, look, we've got your six projects in here. So this one is the first one. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. Is it easy to achieve, Matthew? It is, and this is the landscape one so probably the most classic of all subjects out there for painting yeah uh, but it's produced in the search press style which is every brushstroke is photographed every detail is 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 in descriptive form as well so you've got the entire mm. tuition for these six paintings oh that's great and then here's our second painting look at that I love the light and the shade They're it's great. lovely yeah, casting across the land yeah that's beautiful and then we move on to our next one okay I'm gonna have to turn it this way there you got go a landscape orientation there that nice kind of mm. stream and bridge there absolutely beautiful and then I may have to turn it back Yes, this way. Um, so you've got the the lovely sort of little waterfall there. Yeah, and the gorgeous flowers, and of course the pine trees in the mountain as well. Yeah. So, the author of this book has given you a variation on, on landscape. This is one of my favourites from the book. I love those nice kind of mm. yellow daffodils in the foreground of the gorgeous house at the back as well. Absolutely. And then of course the classic snow scene. Uh, nice. Everyone likes a good snow scene. Um, and then you said in the back, so where am I looking? Ah, oh, these pages so, here. So, yeah, so right at the back we've got the six pictures ready sketched oh. on watercolour paper. This is the big thing about this. Now, it's, it's a wonderful uh, spiral bound pad as well. So we've also, we've also um, given you the chance to use this and paint straight in the book. Right. So you don't have to take it out of the book, okay. you can paint it in the book. You know, uh, and it works really well. And yeah. of course, it's it's a full watercolour course on landscapes. Mm, now that's your first option. I would say though, um, please go for the bundle because there'll be an extra additional saving. Um, so then we've got our coastal landscapes. 
Yeah, again, another classic, you know, and just as popular as landscapes. Um, so we've given you six projects again, all based around the sea, which okay. is beautiful. Um, nice quality paper that you can wipe off. If you're splashing with paint, you can wipe it. It's a glossy paper as well. Right. We've tried to think about everything on this show. Um, so it's all there for you. Mm. Beautiful paintings, all detailed, every single brush stroke. Look at that. I love that one. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love these sort of the uh, colours in that one. And then your wintery scene. Got to have a wintery scene. Um, and then we've got, there's a no lovely yacht there. Yeah, it's like a, that reminds me of um, Robin Hood's Bay, that one in Yorkshire. Oh, really? With the red roofs looking over towards Whitby. I think it is. Oh. I think that's Yorkshire, I okay. would say. Yeah, I reckon yeah. the red roofs. Good stuff. So that's our second one. And again, each project is not only giving you the finished picture it's giving you the sketch on the paper it's also giving you the uh, photographed tuition and I've got to say mm. it's a cracking saving if you buy all three absolutely you, you're saving three pound if you buy them individually but it's it's a greatest saving if you buy all three together that's right and of course it's one of the flowers as well oh look at that isn't that stunning look at the colors again would you say this is easy to achieve matthew it is and, and flowers come across with a bit of fear surrounding them yeah but with these beautiful steps that you can see here with the finished picture with the ready sketched piece of watercolor paper remember you can paint straight onto this you don't have to sketch this thing in so it's ready to go okay and that takes a lot of the fear out Absolutely. of watercolor painting it really does so what we've done is we've taken three pounds off each of the individual items so that's three three and three so they should be 15.99 each but you're paying 12.99 um, but if you do want all three, there's a further, yeah, keep those savings, there's a further six pounds off. So that's where it really comes into great value. Uh, that's what most of you are already going for. £32.97. 468481 is your item number for all three of these. Um, so, you know, if you've always wanted to get into... Um, watercolours. As we said, Matthew is going to help you take the fear out of it, but so are these books when you get them home because you've got step by step by step instructions. You've got 18 different projects in total if you go for all three of them. Once more, it's £32.97, 468481. Do give us a call 01733602000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. There we go. If you've got any questions, or of course, if you want to show any of your watercolours that you've been doing, of course, send them into studio at tachanda.com or via Facebook. All right, which one are we doing? Right, so it's been a hard decision to choose a picture to paint with you, but what I've done is I'm, I want to paint a picture from the uh, watercolour landscape book here, which for me is a staple mm. for watercolour artists. Landscapes is what it's all about. And this book is a complete watercolour course in landscapes and the first couple of pages we can see this all all six pictures here yeah so that's a great way of showing us the individual images and we can choose which one we're going to go for so i kind of like this one really i want to okay. go for the one with a little cottage on there nice. i want to paint it in a few steps for you now it's important to say that this particular artist paints in this style every person paints differently you know it's like having a signature i guess mm. you could say really um so I want to paint this in my way, because okay. that's what I'd like to do, you know? And if we sort of flick across, we can see, as we go through, we can see we've got the um, steps mm -hmm. for the projects. And that's what makes these books interesting, is that we give you every little bit of detail throughout. Yeah. And of course, at the back, you've got the actual sketch as well, which I've took out, actually, and I've stuck to this old batty piece of cardboard that, that, that looks like it's it's warped in the winter yeah, yeah. but it does its job yeah. and it's a way of keeping the paper tight you don't have to you can paint straight in the book if you want to okay now as far as colors and brushes are concerned let's keep this thing nice and simple there's three colors that you need mm -hmm. and you can mix any color from these three i've even got a plastic plate i think this will lying around at the back of the studio somewhere so, so this is a bright yellow this is a blue and this is a a a red mm -hmm. now in your paint box you've probably got some colors that you've probably even bought from me before or from a chanda before yeah so any kind of red yellow and blue it could be cadmium yellow it could be natural red or something like that that is all you need just three colors mm -hmm. and you've cracked it i've gone for three brushes and pretty standard brushes i've gone for a size 10 brush i've gone for a size 6 brush and i've gone for a rigger brush which is a long pointy one those three brushes with the book three colors plastic plate 
bit of water. That's all you need. Bit of tissue, yeah, because it's emotional painting, you know. Yeah. And you're ready to go. That's all you okay. need. Now, as far as easels are concerned, we don't need easels mm -hmm. because that's just so you can see on the camera. You know, it's not about that. Um, so. It's so nice not having to sketch. I'm so used to sketching at this point, but it's ready to go. And people that come to my workshop days know that the sketching is the fear. That's the scary bit. We've done that for you. That's been taken away. So I want to wet the entire sheet of paper. Now it's a premium paper, and it's got a gorgeous texture which we can utilise a little bit later on. Now as I wet this, I'm being a bit careful not to go over the building. Okay. So we'll work around the edge of this. And we can put the water on here. Mm -hmm. And it's good quality watercolour card you get in these books, isn't it? It is. It's £140 or 300 gram, which is a really yeah. thick. It's a standard um, watercolour paper, if you like, as far as weight's concerned. Mm -hmm. But quality, it's premium. And of course, Search Press produce some of the best art mm. and craft books in the world. I think. They are the longest running publisher of art books, I are believe. They? Yes. So they have been running for quite a long time and they produce hundreds of books every year on mm -hmm. art and um, craft. Okay. And I've been lucky enough to do a lot of books with Search Press over the years. And they've asked me to come and show these to you guys yeah. at home as well. So let's start off with some yellow. Now we'll take the yellow. I'm going to mix them in here at the back. So this is this is natural yellow I'm using here, but mm -hmm. equally it could be cadmium yellow or it could be something like um, aurelian. Yeah. But a nice bright yellow, and we'll work this in it. And you'll see where we're going to go with this. We're going okay. for a spring, something nice. to brighten up the winter. Oh yes, please. Nice bit of beautiful. It's cold out there. Yeah, it is, and foggy yeah. and misty yeah. and everything. Yeah. So a nice bit of a springtime, nice and strong around these daffodils here. You can see I'm just popping it on. And of course, because it is a watercolour paper that I'm using, the paint is flowing in a beautiful way. And we'll put that pretty much all the way down. Mm -hmm. Looking good. Around it's a nice the trees. colour, that. It is, it's lovely. It's natural yellow light, this one. And then we'll take some blue and we'll put blue in. And obviously blue will mix with yellow on the paper. That's a right. nice way of working. Not so something people think to do, but mixing on the paper is just as good as mixing on the palette sometimes. So that's how you get your green? Absolutely. So right. it's the yellow and the blue Lovely. doing its job. Obviously we can mix the yellow and the blue in the palette as well, so we can pop in some colour around here. Mm -hmm. Nice and springy. Yep. Springy. Springy. <laughs> Uh, don't forget, do keep any pictures coming in to studio at tachanda.com or on Facebook because we like to, you know, sharing is caring. It is. It's nice to see what people do. Yeah. And it's great how people get in touch after the shows as mm. well. So keep in touch, folks, and keep an eye on Facebook, which, as always, is Matthew Palmer, yeah. artist. Now, I'm taking some blue and I'm, I'm going to paint in a bit of a sky as well. So I'm just going to pop in some blue across the top of the paper here. Now, if I want to leave clouds in, can you see this sort of texture that's appearing as I stroke the brush over the paper? Mm -hmm. That's because it's it's a textured surface paper, which has given me a chance to do to do that. Now I'm just going to change brushes and go for the smaller one. Mm -hmm. I want to mix the yellow and the blue together. Yeah. So we get a slightly darker green. So this one is natural blue. This one is natural yellow light. Right. But you could use any blue, any yellow. Okay. It's fine. The book goes through every colour mix that you need. Okay? Wonderful. Yeah, that's good. Now, I'm just going to go in and I want to spend a few moments just while that's starting to, before it starts to dry, I want to paint around the building here. Okay. Because I want the building to stand forward against the background. I oh, see, so you've made a really nice rich green there. Yeah, so mm. we can make it look as though we've got a bit of depth going off here. Mm. So I'm using a number six brush here. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to turn that on the side just for a second. So what I want to do here is I want to almost paint it in as though it's some sort of conifer or poplar tree. Mm. That looks, oh, that's so effective. But it, you make it look so easy. Well, it's not a challenging thing. And I think that most people, most people have the white paper fear. Yeah, yeah. And the thing is about this, you know, if you've got, if you're going for the bundle, which a lot of you are, mm. that's a great way of investing into watercolour painting because it's giving you six projects in each book. Mm. Now, bear in mind that you could trace the sketch and put it onto your own watercolour paper, so you don't have to stick to using this one. You could save this one for best, yes, you know, I you know could sketch you your own, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. And it's a nice way that's of achieving idea. that. 
that kind of nice effect. Now look at this. It's, oh, your, your painting is just coming to life so quickly. It's amazing. Once you start to pull some dark colours yeah. around, now things start to snap together. Mm -hmm. um, now, if you go for the bundle, per project it works out at £1.83. You know, for all the tuition and you get the sketch, uh, uh, the, yeah, the sketch on the watercolour card, so it's very good. Ah, oh, yeah, Meg's saying we could frame this. Absolutely, you could frame this. Yeah. Well, there's nothing finer than painting an original painting, and watercolour's got that charm about it, that mm. softness, you know, and that's what people love about watercolour painting. It's got yeah. a nice, a nice sort of pleasant feel about it. Now, I'm just going to finish off this little section here. Okay. I'm just painting in a little bit of distance here on this side, so I'm just going to pop in some sort of random bits of green over here mm -hmm. at the back of the tree. And then what we'll do is we'll give this a few minutes to dry off and then we'll come yep. back and we'll, we will crack on with the picture. But I'm just going to, before I do that, I'm just going to pop in a few extra little bits and bobs here. Bit of water, we've got the mm -hmm. tissue there just to sort of glaze over the top of the colours. Yep. It just helps them sort of tone, tone in a touch. And I want to take a very thick blob from the splodge <laughs> and put blob some and nice, <laughs> nice kind of thick yellow around where these daffodils are going to be and we'll pop in mm -hmm. and of course if you remember last year we did some uh, wonderful daffodils for Marie Curie. Remember the, oh, the uh, yes. charity day which was oh, a wonderful yeah. thing to be involved in. So I'm spotting. That's almost a year ago now. Is it? Yeah. It'll soon be Christmas. I oh, know. Don't. The, do you find <sighs> that the older you get the quicker the years seem to go by? Yeah. What is that about? <laughs> well now I've got to 19 it's starting to go quick. <laughs> <laughs> So I've just popped in some nice thick splodges of yellow, and mm -hmm. look how that's giving the flowers, you know, pretty much yeah. instantly. And then briefly, a tiny bit of red, just mixed with the yellow, of course that's going to give us an orange. And I'm going to pop some little dots inside, because what we have here, mm -hmm. of course, in the centre of daffodils, is a little bit of a darker colour. Yeah. Great time to let that dry. Okay, All right. lovely stuff. Uh, so if you do want them individually, we have got them. Uh, they are twelve ninety nine each. Now your options are uh, coastal landscape. Then you've got the watercolor flowers, and you've got six projects in each. And then you've also got the watercolor landscapes. Now each one has um, a three pound saving on it. Uh, has three pounds saving on it at uh, twelve ninety nine to nine five one six one. But what most of you are going for is the big bundle because you keep those three pounds savings. They carry over, and then you've got a further six pounds off the collection. And that's what we're going to look at right now. So here they are. Here are the wonderful books. But what we've done is we've put some little stickers so that we can show you the. Um, what I might do is flick through just one section with your step by step projects and then uh, we can show you the full projects as well so as you can see you've got the introduction there about uh, the uh, artist and then little, some top tips about setting up your board etc where to get started just in case you're a brand new beginner and if I flick that round general technique so you know it's gonna they're gonna hold your hand through this okay and then there's color relationships and then if I carry on we're gonna find that first project here we go, so the projects and then if I flick over with the tulips you can see step by step and it tells you what you are going to need brilliantly. So obviously you've got such good step by step instructions in terms of they're literally showing you absolutely everything. So without further ado let's show you the first project which are our tulips, that's there. Next project we have got there we go, oh, beautiful flowers, I love the colours, I love the pinks. Uh, look at those, they're fiery aren't they, absolutely stunning. Here's your fifth project and then we have got, I love that as well, beautiful vase. So that's your first set of six projects in the flowers book. Then the next one we go to are the coastal landscapes. Don't forget as well, it does have the little binder if you will and then in the back of each one you will have the sketches the actual sketches it's still a little bit hard to see but you've got the sketches of all six projects uh, on your watercolor paper so if I twist this around 
There we go. It's nice as well that it's on your spine. It's got that sort of ring binder spine, so you can bend that back, work more easily. And then our uh, fifth project. Look at those. Aren't they stunning? Those colours are wonderful. Oh, a nice little wintry scene on that one. And then we've got the lovely yacht in the background. Fabulous. And then the last one is the watercolour. So again, I'll have a little, the watercolour landscapes. I think they're all this way, actually. So, no, they're not. Ha, ha, ha. Right. So you've got there with the gate and the stone. And I love that one because you're really looking into, you've really got depth and perspective, haven't you? And we've got that wonderful bridge there. Isn't that awesome? This one, you've got your, uh, what do you call it, little waterfall there. So if you've always wanted to start, this is the time to do it. Look at that. And then our wintry scene. £32.97. So remember, if you buy them individually, you've got a £3 saving on each one. But then that carries over and you get a further £6 saving on uh, the bundle. And what, how much has gone, Meg? A third of the stock has gone. It's £32.97. 468481 is your item number. Now, you're only paying £1.83 per project if you go for the bundle. For, and that's all the tuition that you're getting in there as well. Um, and the sketches, so that works out really, really well. Once more, £32.97, 468481 is your item number. Now, we've got another set of books. Um, these are all individual items under the same item number. So here you can see, now these are the ready to paint and this one starts with the uh, landscape. It says in 30 minutes, Matthew. Yes, yeah. that's right. So what you've got in these books is you've got each painting is designed uh, for it to complete in 30 minutes. Um, and each book contains over 30 projects. The landscapes has 33 projects in, for example, um, as well as giving you the step-by-step -step tuition for the 33 projects in 30 minutes. Right. We're also giving you um, 33 tracings. In fact, while we're looking at this, we can actually see, if I open this yeah. up, you can see that you get, and it's actual classic tracing paper, thick tracing paper, so you can trace these size for size on your watercolour paper. Mm -hmm. And of course, if you've, if you've purchased anything from me before here on Achanda, then you've probably got the paints and paper to go. So... These are wonderful, and each each one is is kind of a six in size, right? Postcard size, oh, okay. yeah. Okay. So, thirty three projects in the landscapes, and then of course, if we go down the line, we've got ready to paint thirty minute flowers, That's which is a beautiful one. one. Um, that one's uh, got thirty five. That one beats the landscapes. Beats that the one. Landscapes. So, there you go. Thirty five flowers to paint again, all with the tracings ready to use. So it's on the same paper. premise each one. It is yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Absolutely. And then moving on to the next one, we've got the uh, boats. Here we are. And again, first time we've seen these on, oh, yes. on TV. And this one particularly, the Boats and Harbour one, is a brand new book as well. Right. Um, again, 33 projects mm -hmm. in that one, each one lasting 30 minutes. Right. <laughs> can't go wrong, can you? You can't go wrong. And then, street scenes. Oh, that looks really interesting. Look it at is, that. yeah. I love painting the busy, the busy scenes. Yeah, yeah, you know, that gives you a chance to work loose and free again with the sketches for you. Mm -hmm. And that one, how many's that one got? 32, that one. And then I think this one's the last one. Trees this is a new woodland. one as well. Is this it? one has just been released recently. And again, okay. this one is is um, 30, 30 projects bang on for 30 <laughs> minutes, all based on trees and woodlands by a wonderful artist and a good friend of mine called Jeff Curzon. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, so interesting. Uh, so it's just nine ninety nine, and each one... Uh, has a three pound saving if you're going for it. Zero uh, five four six zero three is your item number. So you can see everything on the website. Let's have a little look. Uh, you can also become a Freedom member. Triple eight triple eight is the item number that you'll need to quote. And for six pound ninety seven per month. <laughs> I keep forgetting to bring that, sorry Matthew. £6.97 per month, you've got uh, unlimited standard delivery. If you've got any questions for Matthew or you want to show your watercolour artwork, send your pictures to studio at tachanda.com or via Facebook. Right, how's it going? Just going to give it a quick dry. I've got a, a heat gun here, so I'm just going to give it a quick, a quick blast. It's of not, the quite, not quite dry. It takes a, a lot of water, these. It does. I mean, that's a sign of good quality paper, right. the fact that it's still a bit damp at this point. And we can press it flat as we dry it if we need to as well. 
dries fairly quickly, to be honest. Mm -hmm. But we can uh, speed the process up. Or if you're working at home, go for a coffee. Okay, that's true. And a cake. So when you paint, you always do it in sort of layers. Is that the, the, the yeah, key? Yeah, you sort of start at the back, work forward normally. Right. Um, which is what we did here. But also on this one, it's nice to get... With a landscape, it's nice to get a big block of colour in, you know? Mm. And it gives you this kind of misty overall feeling to the picture. Yeah. And we're going to start to pull in some detail at this point. And I'm actually going to use um, a scrap little piece of paper here. I've, it's a bit of a an old leaflet or something okay. here. Just with a straight edge, any kind of straight edge here. Yeah. There's a dodgy picture of me there. We can, uh. we can paint on this. And I'll pop this on here. Okay. In fact, I'll mix the colour first. So I'm actually going to take some blue, some yellow, and a tiny bit of red, so it goes a little bit darker with the green. We can see that slight darkness coming through there. Mm. And we're going to give it a stipple. This is a size 10 brush. Right. And using this straight edge here, we're going to lightly tap and spot and stipple around these edges. And that'll give me some kind of mm. bushes and shrubs in the foreground. And I'm just sort of dotting in. We can see that straight edge it's oh, giving me. Oh, that looks really good. Now I'm working quite rich with mm. the colour here. Now remember, I'm only using three colours for this, which is perfectly fine to do. The book will show you how to mix the colours, all the books do. Mm -hmm. And... Um, yeah, it's such a unique product, this paint pad artist, mm -hmm. it really is. It's a great way of of achieving effective watercolours with expert tuition from artists that are, you know, super well established, you yeah. know, in the world of teaching mm. um, and have been around and teaching. And you know some of them, don't you? Yeah. I know exactly. Yeah. In fact, most of the artists that the books feature I actually work with, I'm fortunate to, to work with them. Mm -hmm. um, have you got any workshops coming up soon? Yes. Um, so, yes. Um, check out the website Watercolor <laughs> TV. Quick Ooh. crafty link. Uh, we have workshops. Thank you. Uh, we have workshops next on the first of February. Oh well, I've got dates here. <laughs> which is which is in uh, which is in Guildford, and right. that's a, a painting of a red squirrel in the snow. Ah. So that's on the first of Feb. Nice. And on the eighth of Feb uh, in Guildford, mm -hmm. and then throughout the year in Nottinghamshire, Exeter, um, and. Uh, Guildford, mm -hmm. where else? Manchester. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, a pretty, Busy. pretty spread out painting yeah. holidays. Look at that! That looks so good. So I'm just popping it? little bits of dark in, and in the foreground, mm -hmm. I want to pop in some little, little. So you're doing that with actually quite a larger brush. Yeah, this one's a size six brush, and this, and this brush for me is actually fine enough to work with. You can see how how pointy that brush is there, can't mm -hmm. you? This has got a super fine tip on yeah. that brush. Yeah. So I don't need a huge amount of, of, of um, you know, brushes for mm. this. I mean, I'm just using three here. Now, what's interesting is people ask me this question all the time about pencil. They say, how do you take the pencil out? Well, you don't. Look at these flowers. That pencil is part of it. I see. That gives it the crispness, don't it? The sharpness. Yeah, yeah. Does that make sense? It does, yeah. And that's quite an important thing to have in a in a picture. So so don't take away pencil. Mm -hmm. Leave the pencil out. It's all part of oh, what we do, okay. okay? Yeah. Just let it do its thing. Now, a few little, a few little, little flicks. Mm -hmm. um, that always sounds like a girl band to me. Little flicks. <laughs> little flicks <laughs> would be a good one. There we go. It's the uh, budget version of Little Mix, maybe. <laughs> um, so. Do you have a little look at the the actual one in the book? Because you're popping your a little bit of your spin on it as exactly, well. Exactly, yeah. yeah. This is the Matthew Palmer version. Yeah. So if you do get the books, you get the bundle, you can do this version yeah. or that version because you can watch this on catch up. Absolutely. Rewind. Even. Rewind, yeah. There you go. That's that version. Perfect. Okay, lovely. So I've popped in some nice foreground, which makes a difference. Yeah. And then we're gonna have a look at painting some trees and of course the building. So Let's um, take a look at the green that we've got. If you pop red with green, it's going to start to go towards a browny colour. Mm -hmm. You can see that, which is nice for trees, of course. Ah, absolutely. Um, so, again, I'm using three colours, but of course, if you've got more colours, you've got browns and greens in your palette, you could use those as well. Yeah. I'm using this just to show you that you don't need a lot of colours. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I want to paint in the dark side of the tree, because all trees mm -hmm. have a dark side, I'm sure they do. Especially this one, anyway. So I'm going to put the dark side of the tree in there. Okay. It's lovely paper to work on. It's got a gorgeous texture. Mm, and you can if we, see it. 
if we glide up the paper, can we see that texture? Mm. Can we see that? Yeah, you can really see that. Isn't that clever? So you can use the texture to your advantage. That's what it's there for. Yeah, it's called is dry it? brush. Yeah, absolutely. Ah. It's designed for that reason, you know? So if you imagine a silver birch tree or something like this. Mm -hmm. Look at that. So again, we're bringing in some nice... Some nice branches that here. That looks so realistic. It's, it's awesome. quite effective, isn't it? You know, yeah. that, that beautiful texture. Yeah. And I'm painting this quickly because um, it's a live TV show and mm. obviously we've got, you know, we've got things to do and, to uh, do. <laughs> you know, bills to pay, etc. <laughs> so we're doing this in a relatively quick manner, but there's no need for you to rush no. at home, you know, you take your time with this and just enjoy the process. Look how quick that tree went in. I know. And I've got the confidence that I've got a sketch ready mm -hmm. for me to work on. Because it's in the book. Exactly, I've not got to worry about it. I popped... Mm -hmm. I popped a little bit of blue in the colour. Oh, what, what does that do? So it goes like a shadow grey. Oh, nice. Can you see the gorgeous grey? Yeah. Uh, and we're starting to see, aren't we, how we can, how we can build this thing up. In fact, we can put some... We can put some shadows coming through the trees. Mm -hmm. See that gorgeous shadow coming through there? Mm. Makes a difference, don't it? Every little helps. Yeah, so effective. Look how the light's coming in. Absolutely. Look at that. Brilliant. Now, I'm just going to paint the other tree. So I'm going to mix the blue, yellow and red. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So we've got brown again. Yep. And then we'll do this tree. So fascinating This one's watch. a beech tree. Yeah. Because also, when you get these books home, you can, like you said, you can watch Matthew on uh, Rewind and you can literally paint along. And obviously you can pause and stop and start when you need to. That's the beauty of it as well. It is, of course it is, yeah. yeah. Of course it is. And that's all part of the fun of this, you know. Mm. You've got this book as a beautiful template, which allows you to work at your leisure. Or maybe you know somebody that wants to start painting. Yeah and there's no finer time, you know, in the new year. Mm. I always find that my workshops are busier in the new year. It's got kind the of new hobby, yeah. Exactly, new mm. hobby for the new year. I did a painting workshop on Saturday in Nottinghamshire, yeah. and there was 65 people all painted a stag. Mm. In fact, it's, it's just at the back of you there, Alex, the picture. And oh. it was a wonderful, it was a gorgeous atmosphere, it really yeah. was. Yeah. And everybody produced a beautiful picture, mm -hmm. and everybody totally zoned into that art world. Does you it know. get quiet? Does it do does everybody like it does it's on particular bits like trees for example when there's a little bit of fine branches to paint and it goes quiet and mm -hmm. you can just you're waiting for that. Yeah yeah. You know that quiet time. Oh I think we're we getting a little shot of it. Oh okay we're just just framing up just to show you the stag. I'm just gonna pop a little shadow there. Okay. Under that building. And then I'm just going to pop a little bit of darkness down the side of this mm -hmm. cottage here. And literally, I'm leaving this to dry for, okay. for a minute. We'll come back to it and finish this picture off then. Marvellous. Now, because you've chatted about the stag, I think it's well worth showing it. Oh, how gorgeous is that? Look at all the, again, the light and shade, the reflections that are going on. Absolutely beautiful. Thank Ooh, you. Thank you, Matthew. Uh, right, well, as we, as Matthew's just said, we're just going to take a little bit of, of a break, a little bit of a drying time. So here is Janice to tell you more about freedom. Hello everyone, I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Hochanda Freedom. Did you know that with Hochanda Freedom you could be saving on your deliveries every single month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee, you'll benefit from unlimited standard delivery, which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And do you know the best bit? You can cancel at any time. Becoming a member of Hochanda Freedom, you'll also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom Members discounts, where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hochanda price. Freedom members will also receive our exclusive members badge and Freedom newsletter, which will keep you updated with all the goings on behind the scenes. Look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month. Over 12,000 of you are already members, and we thank you so much for being part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hochanda Freedom. I'm a Freedom member, which means I can shop a lot. It's the discounts and all the special offers you get. I get special offers, I get special discounts. 
they tell me when everything's happening. So if there's a special show I want to watch, then it's there. I'm able to just shop when I'd like. It's just good to have. But yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. <laughs> you see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website, quote the item number 888888. So, don't forget you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, members badge, and members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hochanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hochanda family. Right then, so we're going to have another quick look at these fantastic books. We are really busy for them. Now, lots of you are going for the bundle because it, uh, and half the stock has gone. If you were to buy these individually, they've all got a, a £3 saving on them. They should be £15.99, but they're £12.99. When you go for the bundle, that £3, that £3 and that £3 saving carries over and then there's a further £6 off. Um, that's, I mean, that's why it's such a good deal. Now, um, you've got six beautiful projects in each of these, and also in the back, you, I mean, you've got full tutorial, which is great, and also in the back, you've actually got the sketches on the watercolour card for you to then go straight in. And I think what's nice is, people, like we were saying with Matthew, people want to start a new hobby. Maybe you've always wanted to do watercolour. This is your step-by-step, hold-your-hand set of instructions, so you can see in this one we've got our um, like this, this is just one of the projects because you've got those lovely um, waterfalls in there and then you've also got the flowers which have some fantastically vibrant colors in them as well and there you can see that's just one of the projects I can have a little flick through so uh, we'll look at now what we've done is we've popped the uh, we've popped some little notes post-it notes just so make it easier for me to flick through so this is just one project. There you go. Look at all those colours. Look at the light and shade. And if I move on, you've got your... Look, there's a lovely lighthouse in the background. But they're all lovely and achievable because you've got those step-by-step -step instructions. We've even seen... I mean, Matthew's only using three colours. So even with just three colours, a couple of um, watercolour brushes, and obviously you've already got your sketches in the back, which I can show you. There you go. You can see... Just tilt that forward. There's one of them. Hey, I'm gone. That's it. You can just about see that sketches. That sketch on there. Fabulous. That's just one book out of the three. Then the next one we've got are the watercolour landscapes. And I'll open this up. And here we go. So you've got the one with the stone. And then uh, th this is one of my favourites, I think, because you're really looking into that distance. I just love how that path has been drawn. And if I turn it this way, this room, I mean, this we've all seen places like this. It transports you, doesn't it? And then this is the one that's on the front cover with the uh, little waterfall. Hang on, a couple more. Have I done this right? One second, there it is. Now, this is the one that Matthew's working on. There we go. And then, last but not least, we've got a nice little wintry scene. There we go. Don't forget, it does have the little, you know, elastic that pops around it. And then the last one that we've got, we have the watercolour flowers. I, I adore the colours that have been used in this one. Isn't that stunning? Look at that. Again, look at the light and shade. They're beautiful. You can see all those step-by-step -step instructions there. These are absolutely fiery, aren't they? And then you've got those lovely lilac tones. That one might be my favourite. It's the colours are beautiful. Um, and you'll learn techniques then that you can follow through and use on, you know, other paintings. Right then, so this is £32.97. Half the stock has gone. 468481 is your item number. Now, we've also got the ready to paint in 30 minutes. Isn't that nice? So if you haven't got too long um, uh, time then to paint, then this is a really nice set of projects. OK, so these are going to be postcard size. Uh, now, so you've got your landscapes. You've got 33 projects here. You can see you've even got the tracings there as well. So you've got your landscapes. Then the next one that we have got are the flowers. 35 different projects in here and each project like we said about 30 minutes then moving on you could choose the boats and the harbors 
this has 33 color, uh, colors, um, projects. And then next up, we've got the street scenes. That's quite interesting. I think I might, uh, if I were to go for one, I'd go for that one, actually. Um, Project-wise, this has got 32 in. And last but not least, we have got the trees. Uh, trees in the woodland, you've got 30 projects in this one. Each option is just 9 99 Item number is 054603. Let's have a look right now. This one, the landscapes, is the most popular. That's what Matthew predicted, actually. So as you see, there's a little bit about the uh, artist. And then here are all the wonderful tracings, like so. But then let's actually go to them let's have a little flick through some of them all oh, right great this tells you about sort of basic equipment that you'll need but then here we go coloring grays it's great so lots of techniques that you'll be able to do mixing your greens uh, trees and flowers there we are uh, wildflower patch so loads of techniques in there but this one currently is the most popular I mean just wow look at that Wonderful. So that is nine ninety nine for each option. They're all under the same item number zero five four six zero three. Ah, the deal of the day. Let's take a little look. This is the parchment uh, from Groovy. It's your two tone parchment. Now it's not just this colour. You've got a range of colours to choose from. Um, so it is fifteen ninety nine, ten pound saving, but only up until uh, tomorrow morning when. Of course, the deal of the day price goes up. Uh, 706302 is your item number. Normally, this is a pound a sheet. Uh, this price is 62 pence per sheet. Very good deal indeed. Lots of different colours to choose from. OK. Are you all right? I'm all set, mate. Yeah. All set. All set. <laughs> Sorry. Ready for action. Uh, <laughs> Ready right. for action. So, um, yeah, this is looking nice as it stands, you know? Mm -hmm. And it's nice to put your own stamp on these pictures, like I say. But again, what really puts that bit of spit and polish on this is the fact that you've got this ready sketch. So, I know that it's the white paper that gives the biggest fear yeah. how to do the sketch. People that come on the painting hall, they say to me all the time, I can't draw. Well, this is done for you. It's ready to go. I'm going to paint in the building okay. now. And what I'm going to do here, I'm going to mix together some yellow and some red, which will give us a bit of a f sort of terracotta mm. kind of colour, which is lovely on the roofs of these things. Yeah. And if you pop some red in, for like a nice kind of terracotta roof here, there's like a double roof coming in mm. here. Where do you reckon we are? Do you think we're in England here? Um, what do you think? I don't know. Maybe. You're possibly yeah. America with a red roof, possibly, oh, maybe. Okay. Okay. Or uh, I think we'll keep a white. A nice white building, but we'll have some red chimney pots maybe as well. You can use your imagination as, as yeah. to where we are. Let's pop in some little red bits underneath the windows. Okay, like the nice ledges. Yeah. And the lintels and sills, as it were. Oh, is that what they're called? Well, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Sounds good. There you go. Mm. And then a nice strong colour, which of course is the blue. All three colours together, so I've got the blue with yellow and a bit of red it gives you this gorgeous black mm. or gray color now if anyone's bought any colors in the past from me you've probably got some natural gray well that's kind of what I'm using here so I'm painting little upside down L shapes oh. that's easy enough and um, one here as well and one just at the side is that the shadow it is I'm gonna pop one just there as well and then we can see the, the building but we'll clean the brush okay we we'll give it a couple of taps on the tissue and I'm just using a damp brush just to lightly skim over yeah. and soften. When you soften this in, again, a good sign of a nice paper for the watercolour paper here because it's allowing the paint to, mm. to stay where you put it, but then blend it if you need to. That's a great thing. Yeah. Let's pop a shadow on the side of the chimney as well. And also just a few little bits of detail, so maybe like an old rustic little sort of gate post or something mm. that a bit of an old four bar gate with five bars that kind yeah. of thing look at that it looks so real amazing gives it character yeah, doesn't it, it does. you know and i'm just working blind on this but of course you can follow the book as much as you want to mm -hmm. so that's just using two brushes yeah this is what we call the rigger brush which is a long pointy one and if we take some of this color what does rigger mean Do you know? it's 
Yeah, it's a Victorian brush that was designed for painting rigging on boats. Oh, so that's, I that's like the where, history. Yeah, that's where it comes from. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of stuck. So I'm just going to paint in some very strong final branches. With it being a springtime mm -hmm. painting, of course, the branches are quite bare, aren't they? Yeah. When the daffodils appear, there's very little leaf on the trees, if any, mm. as we know, because it's, is it March time we get daffodils normally? Oh, uh, yeah, I think so. Early March time, yeah. I think yeah. so, yeah. So a few little branches just on there is a nice way of finishing off. I popped a little bird on there, can you see? <laughs> a little bearded chuff, <laughs> just there. He's, he's, he's coming in. Right there, there it is. That's a little <laughs> chuff. That's cute. So for those people that know about chuffs, yeah. you'll know exactly what part of the world it is. I don't, I don't know about chuffs. Well, neither do I, but I'm sure, somebody, <laughs> I'm sure that somebody out there does, <laughs> especially a bearded chuff. Is there such a thing as a bearded chuff? Uh, yeah, there's one there. Okay, right. So, <laughs> obviously, <laughs> not, maybe, mm -hmm. who knows? I'm sure somebody will tell us. Yeah. Well, I think after popping a few little spots in mm -hmm. and around here, yeah. we have a finished watercolour painting from the paint pad uh, artist yeah. uh, landscape book which is a beautiful book folks look how effective that is I know. and look how this pops this white building pops it's fantastic I enjoyed that. That, was, that was a good one oh, good paint bless you um do you need a moment then oh yes just I a, mean, okay need a moment i'm okay now yeah i'm fine <laughs> i'm all right um here's the website just so you can take a look at all of the products that we've got on the show um so we've got our lovely uh different types of watercolor books lots there for you uh, do check out on the website. Again, there's an opportunity to become a Freedom member if you're not yet a member. Um, now, I'm being told that the bundle, the actual bundle that we're going to look at in a minute, is really, really busy. So make sure you're checking out your baskets. And I'm just going to grab the book off, Matthew. Thank you very much. Right. Here we go. So um, if you go for these individually, you will get a three pound saving. That then carries over. So three pounds, three pounds, three pounds, and then a further six pounds off if you're going for the set of three. Lovely, I'll have one more flick through then for you to peruse the projects. Here we go. So this one is your coastal landscapes. So you've got full instructions and you have got the sketches in the back. And there we go just wanted to have a really quick flick through just in case you sat on the fence there we go that's your first option but obviously if you're going for the bundle then you're not going to have to choose and then the next one here we go are the flowers and look at those colors absolutely stunning there we go and then have we got one more? I don't think. Oh, we do, we do. There's one more there. Now, while you're looking at these projects, if you go for the bundle, then it works out that each project is £1.83 pence per, per piece of artwork, you see. Um, and then you can frame it. I would totally be framing my artwork if I were doing these. But don't forget, you have got the sketches on brilliant watercolour card. There you go. You can just about see those sketches there. Uh, how much has gone, please? Two thirds of the stock has gone on your collection. Thirty-two pounds and ninety-seven pence. Four six eight four eight one is your item number. Uh, then we've got uh, these fabulous books that we've got for you, where you can complete these in each project in around about 30 minutes. I mean, I wouldn't go literally set in a timer and then like, <laughs> you know what I mean, but around about 30 minutes. So they're the smaller projects, about A6 size. You've got your tracing papers in there as well. Uh, and so first off, you've got your landscapes. Then next up, you've got your flowers. It's just coming across, there you go. Each option is just 9.99, which is fantastic. Uh, then the next one are the boats, boats and the harbours. Then you've got your street scenes, nice and busy these. And then the last one that you've got here uh, are the trees and the woodlands. I believe the landscapes are still in the lead. Each option, 9.99, 054603. Also, boats and harbours are very popular as well. 
do give us a call 01733602000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. Still got a little bit of time to send in uh, your pictures if you want to of any of your watercolour cards. Are you right to do a little something? Yeah, how much time have I got? Um, ten, ten, ten minutes. Yeah. So let's go from ready to paint in 30 minutes to ready to paint in 10 minutes. Okay. So Sorry, Matthew. The, uh, it's fine, <laughs> we can do this. So this is the picture that we did from the landscape mm -hmm. uh, paint pad artist book. I just love the fact that you don't have to worry about mm. the sketching and we're giving you premium paper. Beautiful. Yeah. But if we take a look at the landscape one here, what I want to do this time, I want to have a look at the pictures the six pictures that we get yeah and I want to choose one of the pictures to do if we can get the page yeah. so here um, it's a gradual progression I think as Isn't well it? yeah I think if we go with something like this we could do this in 10 minutes or a quick version okay of. that sounds um, wonderful so and I think we'll leave it in the book one. as well sure I think that'd be a nice right thing to do that. so we'll pop it here like this and we can paint there okay because it shows that it's a sketch pad and of course you can fold these back yeah not ideally on an easel though to be okay, honest okay fine um, so I want to use the same water same colors etc yeah and we'll wet the paper again just as before and we'll pop in the sky so if we take some uh, blue mm. this one being natural blue beautiful paper look how it just goes in and look, it's gorgeous look stuff. at that how it's, it's lovely, going it? yeah. down the page as well Sage Press have really produced a quality product mm. here they really have folks mm. and people are going for this which is great it's a wonderful thing for anybody that's painting look how that moves there's lovely it looks it? like clouds actually it's gorgeous yeah it? yeah and then we'll put some water in, so mm -hmm. some horizontal streaks for water. Yeah. There's the sea creeping in. Horizontal brush strokes always make water look mm. like water. Mm. And I'm sure you can see that just by popping the lines in. Oh yeah, look at that. It's nice and like simple, that. yeah. Nice. This see, is what's what I call lovely, speed painting. Yeah, this. no, what's lovely, Matthew, is you give everybody confidence, you know, that you, you also take the fear out of it as well as the look. Yeah, well, I, I've spent my life doing that, I think, yeah. uh, my working life anyway, you know, when I started painting in watercolours many years ago, mm. um, I was a child at the time, and there was nothing like this, nowhere, no. you know, there was no, all the art books were like baffling me with science, <laughs> you know, and Search Press have spent the past, I don't know, 20, 30, 40 years mm. giving people simple projects but effective at the end, but simple techniques in yeah. the books. And that's what Search Press do. And in 2013, I got asked to write my first book for Search Press. Mm -hmm. And that was the most important thing for me, was to give people effective pictures, but at the end of it, have results that just work and, and look really nice at the end. So that was a case of mixing on the paper there. Right. That was a mix of the three colours. Yep. So that's the blue, red, yellow. That's the yellow going straight in, but mm. mixing on the paper. Lovely. And of course, we can pop little horizontals in as well, so it's reflecting. Like, yeah, yeah, absolutely. In the foreground, let's take some yellow and some red. So we've got okay. a bit of a brownie colour. Okay. And we're popping a bit of a beach or a bit of a uh, yeah. shoreline, let's say. So a little horizontal flicks. If we do this, yeah, splay the hairs. Okay. We can make use of that beautiful texture. Can we see ah, it? Ah, yes. So I'm painting straight in a book. I mean, that sounds weird. No, it's all but good. But that's exactly what we're doing, and it's a wonderful... Oh, I love it. Cool. And, of course, you've got the tuition to go again and yeah. again if you want to. Now, just so you know, we do have cues on the phone line, so your fastest way to order is online at hachanda.com if you can. Now, I'm just going to mix up some more green, yellow mm -hmm. and blue. Yep. I, I know we're working a little bit against the clock here, so we'll no, get some bushes wonderful. in. Get some little bushes in here. But I, I, in fact, I love how quickly you can see this scene coming together. Again, I feel like I'm transported there. So I make it nice and dark in the corner. Mm. Just imagine these are bushes and shrubs, you know. I'm just sort of yeah. twirling the brush. Yep, yeah, twirling. I bet you when people go on their, on your workshops, at the end of it, they can't believe what they've produced. Yeah. And it's the been end. On, hasn't she? she has a couple yeah. of times, yeah, yeah, exactly. And it's a wonderful thing to watch people do this because yeah. people create pictures, mm. they really do. And again, one final plug people should check out watercolour.tv where all my courses all over the yeah, country. That's what I'm doing it for. <laughs> Good on you. <laughs> Proud of you. Thank now you. I'm just going <laughs> to pop in a bit of darkness around here. Look at that. It's certainly gone quick this hour, that's for sure. It has, it's flown. And of course, the time's yeah. nearly beat We've got a few minutes. Just no, we're make all sure good. It's, make sure it's yeah. nice and dark in the corner. Mm -hmm. Splodging. Yeah. And 
we should probably paint in some trees. So this just goes to show that you don't need to worry about mm -hmm. having to stick it to a board no. because I'm painting straight in the book, which is why we put the elastic on, which is why it looks like a sketch pad. Mm -hmm. And of course, you can paint on the back of mm -hmm. this. It won't go through to the other side. Could you paint on your lap or is that too uncomfortable? Uh, where was comfortable. I was just wondering. Most people tend to paint on like the knee or something. Yeah, well, that's, I was just thinking. That's pretty normal. Yeah. I was just thinking, like on a summer's day, you could take these books out. You don't need much, do you? Great, love it. Yeah, yeah brilliant. Yeah. It'd be lovely. It's a plastic card here. Right. I'm, I'm scraping some little rocks in. Look at that. And then a few branches. Um, seventy percent of the big bundle. Well, the three, the three book bundle has gone. Now, if you look at that, can you see how that's giving us trees? Yeah, look at that. And rocks just in the foreground. And I think that's probably the quickest seascape <laughs> stroke landscape I've ever painted. But again, that is all part yeah. of this beautiful landscape book uh, on watercolours. Yeah. Beautiful thing, folks. Get the bundle. You're getting, what is it, £1.83? Pound £1.83 pound per picture. Yeah. Beautiful. Gorgeous. So good. Uh, right then, so um, you can buy them individually, as we said. I don't, I don't know whether I should take this because it's going to smudge on the back, so I'll leave that particular okay. one because we've, we've, we've flipped through the books quite a few times now. Um, so, uh, twelve ninety nine for each one and you get a £3 saving on each one, but if you go for the bundle, then you get a further £6, which most of you are doing. That was brilliant. Thank you, Matthew. Enjoyed that. That was super quick. A it was amazing. It was, wasn't it? Lovely stuff. So basically, these are going to hold your hand, aren't they? And they're they kits in themselves, you know. They are, yeah. And each one is a complete course in the subject. So uh, landscapes, uh, seascapes, and flowers, of course. Mm -hmm. So six pictures, all broken down in detail in the search press style. Every brush stroke yeah. is detailed for you. So it mm. really does hold your hand. Gorgeous covers, hardback. What was that? That's a random picture. Oh, that frightened me. It's, it is a poltergeist. No, don't say that. <laughs> Um, and of course it's got the elastic as well, but the fact that they've thought about this and they've put in mm. the ready drawn on the watercolour paper is just super. Love uh, that. Isn't it lovely? So as I said, it's £32.97. and pence. You've got that further £6 saving. I would go for it. Um, maybe I'll just have a quick look at um, just like how they do a step, the step by step. Yeah, it's nice to see the stages on the book exactly, yeah. Okay, so let's flick through. So, the first few pages in the book will show you the paintings, but it also will give you a few little bits of extra advice. Things like what colours, what equipment would you use for this, yeah. how to do colour mixing, really those essential little things. It's like having a watercolour companion by your side. Well, that's it a really good way is. to describe it, um, isn't it? This is talking about how how to mix colour, general techniques for doing petals, mm -hmm. of course this being the flower book. Oh, colours? Colour wheel, yeah. essential, you know. Taking three colours, like we've done today, and mixing them in. Mm, lovely. And then if I flick over, those are, that's your useful mixes. Oh, how to frame up if you want to. There you go. Um, and then we go to the projects, but we'll just flick through. So those step by step. So thank you, Matthew. <laughs> if I can, oh, st sticking together. There you go. Uh, I've probably missed a page, but it's. I mean, you've got a lot of steps here, haven't taking you? Taking you through it um, and. Mm. The search press are the specialists at producing detailed mm. books in plain English as well, you know, so everything's yeah. there for you. No science. I've I've done several books with search press and I'm working on several more. Yeah. And the way they produce them is just of a super high quality. Mm. Yeah. Gorgeous glossy paper, wiped clean as well. Lovely. Thank you very much, Matthew. Here's the bundle, thirty-two pounds and ninety-seven pence, uh, four six eight four eight one. Are we seeing you a little later? Yes, eight o'clock for some more painting. Please join Matthew then. More coming up after this. And coming up next, it's time for our final call of the groovy one day special. And then we've got a double launch with our lovely Le Blanche. Hello, I'm Hayley, and you might have seen me presenting here at Hachanda. Well, I've always been an avid crafter behind the scenes and have been given the opportunity to share some of my favourite products with you in a monthly show called Handmade by Hayley. 
So I hope you'll join me, let me inspire you, and maybe you will discover a new craft in the process. Hi everyone, I'm Phil Martin. I've been paper crafting for over 20 years now. You could say it's a passion of mine. Uh, Sentimentally Yours is my award-winning brand of craft products. I design stamps, paper pads, uh, tools, embellishments, all the things that we need to help us enjoy our crafting. My aim with Sentimentally Yours is to bring unique, top quality, innovative designs for every level of crafter. So whether you are a beginner or whether you are more experienced, there will be something for you. On my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda, I will be doing my best to teach and educate you on how to get the most from the product, but always with a laugh and a giggle. Make sure you join me and tune in for my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda. I'm Ali Reeve, I'm from the company Stamps Away. Stamps Away is a family run company with my husband and I. We create all things crafty, especially with a passion for mixed media. At Stamps Away we create a lot of MDF products because we have laser cutters and router cutters. We also create our own stencils and masks. We try and make everything we can in-house so that you've got all the materials you need to create your projects. If you're watching a show with me on Hochanda, you'll expect to see lots of different techniques, lots of ways of using the products that we produce, and it's all very much mixed media, so pretty much anything goes. So I hope you won't miss the shows on Hochanda with Stamps Away. Hello there and welcome back. Well, this is it. This is your last opportunity for you to get hold of your current one day special. It's a groovy one day special and it's been a very popular one because 70% of the stock has gone. Um, Paul, you've had a busy 24 it hours. Has, yeah, from launch last night all the way through the evening and today, yeah, it's been a fantastic mm -hmm. day. And it's it not really just been has. busy for the one day special because you had another no. bundle that sold yeah, we've out. we had some bundles on that um, we hadn't had on for a while. They sold out. Um, we've also got a fantastic deal of the day as well, yes, which runs out at 7 o'clock right, yes, tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, there's loads of little different special offers and it's been really, really busy. So thank you everyone at home that made a purchase. That's it. Now if you were watching at 1 o'clock, you'll know that Paul didn't quite get his Pico cutting finished. No, I didn't. So we're <laughs> going to kick things off with that with our demonstration. But before we do that, let's tell you about the one day special, because you might not have seen it yet. Paul, talk us through what okay, we've got. Okay, so this is Lucy's folk art um, collection. And Lucy is one of our in-house designers back at mm -hmm. Clarity Tower. Um, so she does sort of a lot of the conversion of the artwork that oh, people okay. like that Mel sends yes. in or Leone and yeah. Barbara um, and so she came up with these beautiful um, designs and I said oh, well these would be fantastic as groovy so what you're getting you're getting four A5 square plates okay um, so when we go from left to right we're having a look at these two here. So this pair is available as a pair in, on the website. Okay. Um, so this is the Folk Art Flowers and the Folk Art Heart. <laughs> <laughs> That's easy for you to say. Yeah, I think so, yeah. <laughs> Um, so again, so you've got so you can buy that, but obviously the best value is in the one day special. Well, this is it because with the one day special, you are getting the saving that you'd normally get with that, but you're getting additional ten pounds and you're getting your parchments. Aren't That's you, right. In that bundle so as well. then, if we move along to the next collection, so this is the folk art octagon, together with the folk art garlands. Um, so again, when you look at them, one of the great things I love <laughs> about the groovy system is all the different elements on yes. there. So where you've got those garlands there, you can use them to infill your frames, nice. you can infill your backgrounds, and you pick and choose the different areas. And because it's so easy to use the groovy system, you become more confident 
and therefore you want to play an experiment. Well, is that the hexagon? You've got nested hexagons in there yep. as well. Octagon. Octagon. Oct One, two, three. I was trying to count the stars. <laughs> There's I a sign there, Hayley. It's an octagon. <laughs> That's how I can remember them. I got to <laughs> apologise. The but then it's what you do with them, isn't it? Because like yeah. you said, there's so many elements in there. You pick out little bits. It's like having a selection box of elements there that you can play around That's with. That's right. So this one here, uh, Maria did this for me, and I demoed this one in the nine o'clock show last Pretty. night. Um, so really, really beautiful. Coloured in with the beautiful pergola liner pencils, and just adding that little bit of black just yes. gives it that set of dimension. Yeah. But then total contrast, no colour at all in this no. one, other than the parchment behind it. That's right. Now this has been done by Francis. Okay, so if you hold that one there, yes. because Francis oh, has also done going. this one as well, and we've shown it in every hour. Wow. It's exactly the same layout. But the one that I'm holding, which is one with the colour, has been done in more traditional methods. So what Frances has done, she's traced it out with an ink rather than the tool. Beautiful. And done beautiful. It looks like that brocade and tapestry, it does. doesn't it? Now, if you hold that one there for a few yeah. moments, I've got another one here, which is showing that top segment has been used, but it's kind of been extended to make more of a feature of yeah. it. Yeah, and so I think Lin yep, Linda Page has done that, and she's used one of the garlands to create like a landscape Isn't that as well. Absolutely gorgeous. So many different ways you can be able to work with these. I mean, have a look at this. This could be so an this envelope. Is by, yeah, by Karen Jackson. So she's just taken. Rather than use it as a square, she's created sort of like a triangle as like a wrap over. Beautiful. But if you are in for a little bit of a romance, then this have a gorgeous. look at that. Because of course you've got the gorgeous heart in yeah, that. Yeah, so this one's done by the lovely Maria. Beautiful. Um, so Maria's at home recovering after an operation because oh. Maria would normally be in. She emailed well, I did in. Wonder. Oh. She emailed in the what during the one o'clock show. So it's oh, nice to know that she's at home okay, watching. Maria. So, love one by Karen Jackson, Gorgeous. and I think I did that one in the six o'clock launch, I think. Perfect. I now, it's always good to go back and watch those shows, because as you heard from Paul, such a lot goes on during the shows. Lots of hints, lots of tips, and of course, we will continue that through at this hour. But keep your eye on that clock. You can see 55 minutes. That's all that you've got left to take advantage of that £10 saving. And of course, the bundle does include your fabulous purple parchment. That's now, right. this is gorgeous, because the parchment itself is quite a key feature. That's right. So, it's that's worth £10. So, basically, Beautiful. you're getting that for free. Yeah. And you're going to get 10 sheets of the dark purple okay. and 10 sheets of the light purple. Um, so nice. it's A5 um, and it just works fantastic. It's I thought it was off. a beautiful colour palette mm, to work with nice. these designs. Um, getting busier and busier, realising that now is the opportunity for you to get hold of this before it goes. Don't forget, uh, nearly 70% of the stock has gone of this one, so 519-852. Um, but more importantly, if you want to get at the one day special price, you are up against that clock. It's one of those shows, is it going to be the stock or is it going to be the yeah. clock that goes first? It's <laughs> difficult to tell. But at the moment we're okay, but do make sure you get yours in your basket nice and early to guarantee that you are getting hold of yours. Now, we mentioned sellouts earlier on during the day, um, and sadly, it was a bundle that we had to say goodbye to, but good news is we've got the individual pairings available. Kicking things off with these. Now, these kind of make your eyes go a bit googly, That's don't right. they? That's <laughs> right. So, this, these are great. These are um, Linda's nested doily frames. Um, so, you've got the large and the small, because when we're working with parchment, we want to have an area to work within. Mm -hmm. um, so, the frames are fantastic for doing this, and it gives that effect of sort of like the matting and layering. Um, and the one that I did last night, because Lucy did this particular design here, but nice. I used that play to create the additional border around it. So that's with the one day special. So that's using oh, the middle nice. bit. Of, if I just grab, where's it gone? There it is. If we look at this one here, okay, let me hold so that the for middle you. part oh, yes, that we're looking kind at of here motif, yeah. is done there. But the way in which Lucy designed it, she designed it to work perfectly Clever. with the large doily. So you can add that extra sort of matting and layering effect to Extends it. Extends that usability, doesn't yeah. it? But again, I mean, using it in its own right as well. Look at these. These are beautiful. Again, that purple Gorgeous. parchment making an appearance. Yeah, in fact, and that actual purple there, yeah, that's the same purple um, that we've also beautiful. got available in another collection on the ah, show as well. Okay. Very pretty, but then that's a large card, but if you want to do smaller cards, you can do those as well. Yeah, and I did this when we launched them, so this is very simple, Beautiful. and I've just infilled it with um, the perforating grids by embossing nice. the dots. 
so you can get a completely different very finish. effective just at 15 pounds and 98 pence these are what i call your bread and butter ones they are because yeah, you're using essentials they're there on your countertop you're using them over and over again they yeah. never get put away really no. do they 737 um, 850 now 15 pounds and 98 pence incredibly affordable as are the next bundle now i kind of like these these have got these a bit of a contemporary really funky, twist that's right so this is the tangled kaleidoscope and the tangled twists okay and what i love about this is there's quite a lot of open areas mm. so you can either decide to put extra design elements within them you can pico cut within them um you could just sort of um do whatever, really. Do whatever, yeah. <laughs> I was lost white work. It's mesmerised them. Work, that's what I was transfixed into. <laughs> so you can do sort of white work within them as well. So you can see here, this one's been done by Jane Telford. So she's put different design elements within those areas. And I like this because it's kind of funkying up yeah. parchment, isn't it? Obviously, you have got kind of your, your whimsical nature with these plates, which lend themselves really well to that framework. That's right. But think about the plates that you've already got in your stash at home, in your collection. Some of those kind of floral and kind yep. of pretty frames well, might the flame, not necessarily the, work. The, the frames are quite generic so yes. whatever you put them with they're going to work well. So this one has been used as like a picture frame. Like that. So we've just pico cut around those areas there and here we've got Barbara and Dave and Mark and Grace in California. That's nice. Look at that. What a fabulous way of displaying a photograph. This is nice because you've almost got that twisted ribbon look. That's right. So with this one what Jane's done is she's overlaid the different things to create different panels. I love this and just very quickly another couple to show you. Stripping out that colour you can get a fabulous effect with that monochromatic. Uh, I passed it on to you. You have, 25. yes, I've inherited it. This wow, look at this. This one beautiful. is by Ronk. Um, and what Ronk is like, <gasps> it gives the effect for me that the outer part gives the effect of sort of like additional butterflies. Yes. But it also, the way in which Ronk has done the, the white work, it looks as if they're beautiful Gorgeous. white ribbons. Absolutely Isn't that gorgeous? beautiful. My goodness, that looks amazing, Ronk. Gorgeous, as are all the finished samples, yeah. to be fair. £15.98, again, a very useful set. You're getting two of those in there, um, and uh, definitely worth adding those in. 067329. Wizzing those details away as we bring in the last pair for you. And again, you can get hold of these alongside the others if you're wanting to. And this time, you've got your tucked corners, and you've got your peaked corners with these as That's well. That's right. Again, these have got a bit of a woo yep, look about them. Yeah, they have as well. <laughs> you're sort of drawn into the in middle of them, aren't they? Yes. But again, great design. And this one here, done by Karen. So rather than have it when we're looking at it, if I bring the plate into play, so it's been designed oh, to work that way. Access, so yeah. it looks that way, but when you turn it, it looks completely wow, different, doesn't yes. it? And you wouldn't think just by turning something, it's you such would get a, a completely change. different look. Always making my eyes go googly <laughs> when you're doing that. Now I've got to bring this next one in because this is kind of like an overlay where one frame has been sat on top of another. That That's is right. So this effect. one again from Linda Page. Look at so that. The, the panels on the front has been done on white parchment, and then the panel around the back has been done on one of the coloured parchments from the deal of the day. That is lovely. It's got quite a masculine strength to that yes, one, hasn't the it? Colourways. It always reminds me of like a compass or something like yeah. that, that kind of look yeah. about it. Um, that's a nice one as well, using your Gorgeous, pretty papers. And on there. It's actually using Indian summer designer Gorgeous, parchment. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of perga glitter on there to add a little Very bit of pretty. sparkle. Nice, like the shape of that one as well. So there you go, they can be as simple or as complicated as you want them to be. Just take one outline, take several, overlay them. You are the artist. You can be able to create some amazing results with those. Now, 103142, just £15.98. pence. wise investment of anybody's money. I think we can all agree on that one. So if you fancy adding those into your basket, please do. But don't forget about your parchment. And this is key. Seeing the results that you get from using coloured parchment. Yeah. I mean, people regularly start off with the, the plain with white. With the clear parchment, yeah. In the start, uh, get, you get the beautiful. clear parchment. Um, and then as you progress, you want to sort of add a little bit more to it. Mm. But if you're not so good at your colouring in, then this collection is really it's good. Gorgeous. So Look you're going to get colours. 20 sheets of A4 par par oh, A4 parchment. <laughs> and when we look at the colours, if we go from sort of like from left to right, so we've got the beautiful light blue, you've got the dark blue, then you've got that light purple and dark purple, which is in the one day special. Nice, but these are larger pieces. This is A4, okay. yeah. 
then you've got your light green and your dark green. Nice. You've got your light pink and your dark pink, and then you've got your light teal and your dark teal. Gorgeous. And you're going to get two sheets of each of those. Also, good selection yep. there. A real nice selection. Like there. that. And again, very affordable. Nineteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. Um, at four five eight zero nine seven. But of course, there is always the opportunity to get started. And I know some people do get involved by perhaps just getting one or two plates yep. and don't necessarily start with the starter kit. But it's a very useful tool to have. It is. And when we're um, the starter kit was put together it was so that when you get it home you can actually start playing so mm. you don't get it home and then think all oh, right now I need this and now yes, I need that yeah. the only thing you need to add to it if you want to is coloring pencils oh, okay that's it which or, many of us so, have got anyway yeah. yeah um so this is the revamped um version of the starter kit okay so we've got the plate mate here which we'll be using and this is sort of key to the plates that we've got on the show so the one day it, special plates will, will sit fit in there, inside oh, there fabulous. Perfectly. Um, you can see you've got the uppercase and the lowercase alphabet. Um, you've got the letter boxes on the other side over here. Lovely. So it's great for tiles. putting your, your words in for personalisation. Um, behind that, we've got the black mat, which is hard on one side and soft on the other. Okay. And we'll explain about that in the demo. Um, you get a project sheet that gives you two projects by Tina Cox. Fabulous. Okay, step by step, guys. 20 sheets of your A5 parchment. Then underneath that, we've then got the tools that you need to get going. Now, these are important. They are. So these have been designed to specifically work within the grooves on the groovy plates. Okay. And what we've done is we've actually now numbered them. Because when we're talking, we often say, like, number one, number yes, two, number yeah. three, number four. So the number one and the number two will work within the grooves to trace out. Okay. Okay. And then the number three and the number four are a good starting point for doing the white work. Okay. As you get more confident. Everything's covered. We also give you the tumble dry sheet as well. Okay. And the reason you need that is to wipe the parchment mm -hmm. so that the tool glides more easily. Lovely. And then coming down to the bottom, this is the recent addition to the starter kit. This is the okay. groovy inset. Right. And as you'll see, it's now got numbers on it. Okay. Um, and you've got like your second, your third, your fourth and stuff like that. Yeah. But then you've got these little tags that all those letters will fit into. Nice. But the plate in the middle is an A6 square baby. Oh, of course, So it means yes. that when we bring you our A6 square plates, then if you've got the starter, you've if the new starter kit, it houses it. So it's like an adapter plate. Like that. Um, then you've got the lovely nested squares in there. Again, really key for when you're first starting out. Um, we've got the beautiful trees, and when you look at these, you can use these in so many ways. They can be little bushes, depends on how you do with them. Then you've got the hills and the mountain, which is obviously a Barbara yes. from sort of stamping <coughs> oh and a gosh, torn yeah. bit of paper. So it's fantastic to put that in the starter kit. Now, each one of those square plates we're looking at, how much would you normally be paying they for one are of those? They are 7.99 each. So, so you're that's getting eight, six, and that's 32 pounds for that. For the plates themselves, just for the and four then plates. you're getting the frame, and, and you're getting you get, the tools yep. as well, and all that tuition. Two flexi blinds there are 27 pounds and 50 pence. Makes it a very affordable way for you to get involved, and everything that you need is within that bundle. No many of you will be tempted with the other elements, which of course you can add those mm. in, and you can spread the cost of those over two payments as well. Makes it really affordable. Um, and something else you can do is obviously you can craft along with us here now. This bundle that we've got on your screen here is for a craft along. <coughs> Stamping stencils and dies, as you can see, but there are versions of these on the groovy plates. So if you did want to do your version at home using the groovy plates, that you can do. But here you can see in February we've got a fabulous Forget Me Not collection. Paul, this looks beautiful. It is. So Barbara launched the very first um, craft along on her channel last February. Um, so it's sort of like the, the one year anniversary. And what you've got in here is you've got the set of beautiful two way overlay stamps that work independently, but then also have been designed to work together. Got you, and yes. Barbara will explain exactly how they work. In addition to that, you've then got the beautiful fresh cut aperture die. And then underneath that, you've then got the beautiful 7x7 stencil. Lovely. So when you get this, you'll also get a list of ingredients. Okay. So that when you get it home, you can go through it, tick off what you've got, and have it all ready for the various mm -hmm. different projects. So that come 16th of February, 2 till 4, you can have it all laid out in front of you, and you're it's good to fabulous go. fabulous way of spending a couple of hours. It's on a Sunday afternoon as well, so yep. nice and easy. And also, if you order nice and early, obviously your kit will be arriving well in advance of the craft along. And you'll have a £5 credit you can use in the craft along store maybe for some of those bits that you don't yep, have that you're missing yeah. yeah there you go if you fancy getting hold of yours zero eight two seven three nine 
three quarters of the stock of our one day special has gone don't forget mm. if you're wanting your craft along and you're wanting your one day special and you want to add it in with a, your flexi yeah. order you can spread the cost of everything as well including that's the craft really along, good so yeah. yeah okay so what we're okay, up to so oh, this was, yes. that was it wasn't okay. it so basically this was the card we was working towards um that's during the one o'clock show so karen did this one for me and you can see we've got the outer edges so this is using the um the deal of the day parchment. Oh, so okay. what is the deal of the day? Ah, so the deal of the day. Should we have a quick flick? Oh, is that what we've got here? Okay. Oh, yes. okay. So 26 sheets of A4 parchment. Right. 26 colours. Wow. So it's like a sampler pack. So you really. get one of each of those. One of each colour. Okay. So you've got colours like primrose yellow, you've got willow Gorgeous. green, you've got pine needles. Um, and you've got a fantastic £10 saving on this. Gorgeous. Oh, and you've got your two, two different sides, so you've got yep. your muted tones and your That's bright right. tones, yeah. Um, and then when you think, right, you get it home and you have plenty of and you want to replace the individual colours, then on the Ho Chanza website, you've then you got go those, to those packs, packs to top them up. Like that, just £15.99. £10 saving on that, so yeah, definitely worth going for. Okay, okay. okay. So this was using the Cranberry Crush, and this is all separate layers. Um, so that you can see you've got a little That's bit of nice. movement if you want to. So what I did was I did the um, outer panel on a piece of clear parchment mm -hmm. and all I did was took, if, we, if I bring the plate into play beside it, you'll see the bottom is just this area here. Okay, yes, okay, yeah. Here. And then I've taken this area here to put the outer That's panel nice, set. Yeah. A little bit of pico cutting and it allows the colour to okay. come through. Then on the cranberry crush, we did the outer frame lovely and then pico cut that and then on the clear parchment we did, then did the inner panel mm -hmm. and this is where we it sort of it came to a stop because i did some perforating and then sort of we ran out of time and so often is the case so you can see here and what i did i used the sentiments we also had on the show that oh, sold okay. out um to add a little extra element to Let's it see. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring in the super foam and the pico foam. And incidentally, if you want to see how to get to this point, one o'clock, that's the show that you need to watch yep. for that. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to work so my hand's more comfortable, and we're going to perforate round the outside. Okay. Now, what I love about this particular shape is that if you don't want to pico cut, it's quite easy to cut with a normal pair of scissors. Right. Okay. So if you're going to do that, what I would suggest is trace out the heart mm -hmm. and then cut it out of a pair of scissors first okay. before you put your design in and do all your colouring and your white work because if you slip with the scissors you've then got to go back and start again Good point. so and then all you would have wasted was the traced out heart yes. okay so what we're going to do it's now like this that are useful <laughs> um, i'm going to take um, my two needle bowl tool which we've got on the show and I'm going to put my glasses on for this as well. Lovely. Tired eyes now. Oh, bless you. So, and then I'm going to grab my groovy guard. Mm -hmm. And the groovy guard is going to sort of just allow me to hold that in position. And this is a really clever idea because when you pull the, the needles out, it naturally draws the parchment. It does, yeah. But the groovy guard stops it moving. That's right. So what I could do, I could be a little bit more specific and use one of the apertures just to go in and it just holds it in place. And you can see it's just kind of lifting, but obviously the resistance yeah. there because but the aperture. if that wasn't there, if I was to do this, it would jump, see, look, oh, it pulls yes. up even more. Yeah. Okay, so the groovy guard really does make a difference. Okay. So with the two needle bowl tool, what I'm doing is I'm going back into the hole, because you're only um, going one hole at a time, really. Okay. Because you need to get that perfect pitch behind between each of the holes and that's making the spacing balanced yeah, around that's right so on the 6th of february we restart the pergamano shows oh okay right um, so on the first oh, so they thursday regular yep, ones yes the first of thursday of every month and um, so barbara and i will be here in the studio mm -hmm. and we're going to be looking at basic grids oh okay, okay because we do bold grids and we do fine grids right. and we're going to show the benefits and the different ways of using them um, and the different effects that you can get from them. This is the thing that I love. I mean, here at Chandra, it's all about education and that's where obviously um, Barbara and Paul and the whole team get involved because you don't just invest in these things and they, they leave you to it. They will be here on a regular basis, uh, not just obviously with um, the parchment, which is every Thursday, the first, the first Thursday, Thursday of every month, from the 6th yeah. of February, but also regular stamping shows, stencil shows, mixed media, there's all sorts of yeah, things going on there. A week tomorrow, 31st mm -hmm. of January, Sam Crow makes her debut on oh, TV. Oh, fabulous. 
Yes. Um, gr fantastic mixed media artist. Yes. Um, and then on the Sunday, the first Sunday of the month is always a two to four of show. Of course, yes. And then we have a one day special on the same evening. Lovely. So, it's all going on. Okay, so what I've done now is I've gone round and I've perforated all the way round. Okay. And then I, my tool of choice are the ring lock scissors. Mm -hmm. So we've got the ring lock, um, which have a larger aperture um, for my big fingers. Okay. Um, we've got the exclusive scissors and then we do the perga cutters as well, okay. which are like a tweezer type yes. scissors. And for me, this took me about six months to learn. Okay. Um, and all you're going to do, my hand is sort of comfortable, so get your hand comfortable. And I'm just going to pop the tip of whoops, tip of the scissors into the two holes, right. and then I just tilt towards me and I snip. Okay. And which mat have you got underneath? So I've got the pico foam underneath. Okay. Some people prefer to do the pico. When I learned, I held it in my hand. Yes. Because that gave me a gauge on how far the tips of the scissors go in. Oh yes, you could feel them. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I mean, luckily enough, I didn't turn the parchment red. <laughs> yes, you don't want um, really piercing your But it is there a real sort of good guide on how to sort of just learn how far to go in okay. because if you go in too far um, what can happen is that the blades on the scissors um, can actually cut the holes right and the idea is that you want to get a really nice sort of pinched point hence it being called the pico it's quite methodical and it's kind of mindful when you're doing it this. It is. Once you get into it, it is. And you'll notice that I'm actually turning my work yes. as opposed to my hand because my hand is comfortable. And it is, you get into sort of like, a, I mean, it's not a race. I mean, you go at oh, whatever no. speed you want yes. to. Um, and that's half the fun of it, isn't it? And as you say, I mean, it, you're saving time because obviously the, the tool that you used to create the, the, the holes in the first place, that was done in the blink of an eye when you yeah, were showing us that. That's Very right, speedy. because you've got the two needle bold, it gives you that bigger hole. So if you're learning, it's a great way. So obviously the bigger the hole, the, the easier it is for you to see when you put the tops of the scissors in. Yeah, now, of course, the plate that we were, have been working with um, is part of your one-day special. Um, the details of which are at the bottom of your screen. And, of course, you are going to be getting um, all four of those fabulous plates, including the gorgeous heart that we're looking at. But um, well over three-quarters of the stock has gone. You've got a £10 saving, which equates to the parchment that you're getting included. And of course, those two fabulous shades of purple, absolutely gorgeous. You're getting your four plates, um, which I'll show you again in a few moments. Um, but if you are wanting yours, I would advise you to pop it in to your basket and check your basket out we've got a little over halfway through the hour uh, sorry approaching halfway through the hour should i say so you've got a little over half an hour to take advantage but of course if the stock goes then sadly that's it we have to say goodbye so to there it. we go so if i hold that up we can see now i've got my beautiful yeah. pico cut heart beautiful okay and then just to finish it off all i've done is you take a piece of the beautiful cranberry crush lovely and that then was from the deal of that's the day that's from the deal of the day then i've got the clear panel that i created earlier which could have been from your starter from kit from your starter kit then i've taken another piece of the same parchment because i got it all out of the same a4 sheet nice then that lays onto there isn't that beautiful and, that, and you can personalize it absolutely gorgeous Valentine's is just around oh, the corner oh isn't it just yeah that's yep. good beautiful anybody would be thrilled to bits to receive that Gorgeous. There we go. Thank nice you, and easy. It is. Now, don't forget, we've seen the Pico cutting at that stage and obviously the, the piercing. If you want to see how Paul got to that, then one o'clock is the hour for you to watch. But don't just leave it at one o'clock. Go back and watch nine o'clock and the launch shows last yeah. night because there's been a lot going on over the last 24 hours. So the details are on your screen for your one day special. We're going to give you a little bit of a recap. But if you want a little bit of perhaps gentle persuasion as to what you can do with your one day special, check these out. <laughs>
next card is the one that we're going to see Paul demonstrating in the next demo. But before we get to that, I do need to tell you about your one day special. It has been flying out. Again, this hour has been a busy hour. Quite often we find Final Call is busy because lots of you might need to have a look at those shows. I know that we've got lots of new parches involved because we've had lots of people ordering the starter kit. So perhaps this is the hour that you've thought, do you know what, 2020, I'm going to try a brand new craft. Might be that you were involved with parchment in the traditional sense, but for whatever reason you've uh, perhaps fallen out of love of tracing and doing all that work, the groovy plates will reignite that passion and give you the ability to create those fabulous designs that you may well have been used to. Now, you've got your fabulous four plates, but you've also got your parchment as well. Two different tones of purple, as you can see there, and that um, would normally equate to £10, so you're going to get 10 sheets of those, um, 10 sheets of each, in fact, but then it's what you create. Now, obviously, here you can see the heart that we saw a few moments ago. Totally different style to how Paul was working with, but equally it's beautiful. And it's gorgeous because you've got the traditional white parchment or your clear parchment there, but then, of course, the colour's been added with your pens. Might be that you've already got some of that gorgeous parchment that we see, where you've got all the colour flooded through, as you can see here. I love these. We saw this one, actually, in that um, little video that we saw a few moments ago. Or maybe you've gone for the deal of the day, featuring some of that coloured parchment giving you the ability to create something quite dramatic just as you can see here there really are some amazing finished samples the design team you never let us down you always make our job so easy because creating with these fabulous plates you have given us the inspiration and the ideas of how we can work with and these gorgeous little flowers that you can see here we're going to see those in action in a slightly different way in that first demo so if you're wanting your one day special well you can see you've got a little over half an hour to get hold of these five one nine eight five two if you wanting to get hold of them 31 pounds and 96 pence is the price busy for that starter kit but we're also busy for that deal of the day as well lots of you taking advantage of the deal of the day because you are getting all those different colors of parchment featuring in here gives you the opportunity for you to try these now you've got 26 sheets one in each of the 26 colors that are available for just 15 pounds and 99 pence that is brilliant value for money usually works out as a pound a sheet which you can see there 25.99 might as well call it 26 pounds that's what you'd normally be paying but at the moment you have got that fabulous price there of 15.99 giving you the ability to try out those colors then when you find one maybe it's that cranberry maybe that's the one that you're going to be using and you're thinking to yourself right i need more of that you can jump onto our website and invest more in those particular colors really lovely set to go for um six uh, seven zero six three zero two key thing with that is the deal of the day so it's on the website but what you have to do is place your order before seven o'clock tomorrow morning morning that way you can take advantage of that saving because at seven o'clock we will have a brand new deal of the day which will be launched during good morning kachanda and of course there you go you can see a groovy starter kit there i know some of you've been placing your orders um if you have can i can i ask you email in let us know yeah. is this the first time that you've ever had a go at groovy or perhaps you invested in some of those smaller plates and this is the hour that you've decided to go for all the additional bits and pieces you're not going to be disappointed i mean look at these five star reviews for so many different products that we see from the groovy system and obviously the clarity team so i know it's a wise investment of anybody's money so if you have taken the leap that leap of faith which isn't so much a leap because you're going <laughs> to love it then do get in touch let me know studio at chanda.com because we both said um when we heard we were busy for the starter kit we love it when we've got new people it is, it's involved. nice to think that somebody else is going to give it a go yeah um and become addicted to it because oh, you really really well it's calm for me it's calming um it's clean there's no mess you can pick it up and put it down. Yeah, this it, is the key yeah. thing. And the thing that I love about it is so often we see different demonstrations and I'm thinking to myself, that reminds me of when I'm stamping, how I'm building up the design yeah, with the stamp. It's very right. similar. So and if you think about it, Clarity as a company, that's the, the background yes, of it. So yeah. when we're working with parchment, it's in a way it's a lot easier because yeah. you haven't got to cut out masks or you Good haven't point. got to use yes, masks to, yeah. to put stuff in the back and bring stuff mm -hmm. to the forward. You can create beautiful layers with it as well. And Barbara always describes it, I say this all the time, she describes it as being on like a bus or a train journey. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so you can get the starter kit, you can trace it out, and you can get off the bus at that point. That's it, yeah. Because it's, it's, it's nice. It's got everything you need, Put it on yeah. a background paper mm -hmm. or make your own background paper and put it on. If you want to carry on that journey, then you maybe want to learn how to do the white work. Yes, yeah. So you've got the black mat in the starter kit, so mm -hmm. that's how you learn to do that carry on the bus yeah. and then maybe you want to do a bit of colour. Yeah. 
So you might on. already have pens already yeah. in your stash, yeah. No, I carry on a bit further. And because the groovy system gives you that confidence, it makes you want to carry on. Yeah. Um, so then you can learn how to do the pico cutting. Mm -hmm. um, and then you, you get more confident and you, as you look at the plates and you know how easy it is to use, mm. it's like anything. If you were to stamp out something um, and you get it wrong, it sort of puts you off, doesn't yes, it? Yeah. Have I got the right amount of ink on? Have I put the right yeah. amount of pressure on? But with the groovy system, you're always consistently going to get that same yeah. beautiful line art every single time. And the thing is, with those plates, whenever you look at any of those plates, they are crammed full of ele yeah. elements. Elements you might take just one or two of them just to go in a corner, or maybe build up a, a whole wreath of little yeah, flowers with exactly. those. Or use it in its entirety. And it's nice Brilliant. and easy to do. Mm. So this is the card we're going for. So Karen um, did this one for me. This is and this is just using two flowers out of all the four plates really that's it my Just goodness two flowers um, and oh, what we've done here is we've used look. the pico rectangles to give us our frame okay okay so where do we start so we're going to use the um parchment that comes in with the one day special and uh, notice you've got your plate mate here as well yep, so from the, the start ready. just to let you know 80 percent of the one day special has Ooh. gone now so yeah about halfway through the hour so okay so what i'm going to do first i'm going to put my frame in okay okay so we've got the pico rectangles on the show we've also got those in squares circles and ovals yeah useful okay. tool to have so it, it's great because it gives you this beautiful edge around the outside for me, that probably take about 45 minutes to do that. So whereas you were doing it by hand on by the hand heart, with the, yeah, with this the is done, so done. it gives you more time for you to... You exactly, right. to concentrate. Makes sense. So what we're going to do, I've got the parchment here, and I'm just going to wipe it. So with the coloured parchment, you've got two sides to it. You've okay. got a shiny side, which is where the colour's been applied, and then you've got a, a more t muted side. So if I just sort of flick that over, oh, you yes, can just you sort see of see. Yes. So if I want a white line, mm -hmm. then I have the shiny side facing me. Okay. Okay. And the plate comes with the dies because what it does, it gives you that guide to line your parchment up mm -hmm. so you get those crisp lines mm -hmm. um, in the right place. That's spot on for lining it, it is. up, isn't it? Perfect. Because what happens is if you're doing pico cutting traditionally, you saw that I was going against the rigid line, mm. which was the outline of the heart as a guide so therefore to give it that same look you've got the plate to put those in place okay okay so I've got my um, groovy plate and I'm just gonna pop that down the outside okay. so we're gonna do a double line mm -hmm. all the way around okay and we're gonna spin that around because I like to bring the work to me rather than sort of get my hands all uncomfortable. Lovely, and just very, very quickly, if you, you don't mind me mentioning, we've yep. had an email in from Robert. Is it Robert Rolf? Ros, Ros. I do, I'm changing your name three times, Ros, there. I do <laughs> apologise. Um, she's asking about the previous card and asking how you put it together. So I've pulled, bought the card in. Yeah. Um, it actually used the, the Pico squares cutting this one as well. Yeah, so, so it would be the Pergamano Brad. So oh, we've got those I see. on the show. So I think it's a set of 280 Brads. Oh, they'll keep you going um, for a while, won't and they? And it's a really good price on those. You've got gold, silver, antique silver, pewter, black, white, and pastel. And use four of those in each of the corners there. Um, and in the centre, they've got kind of like a, a little pearl um, touch. Yep. Now, that's, I'm presuming it's been stuck on rather than it actually being a brad. Yeah, so you could use that as a brad as you well. Could, because yeah. it's, and it's a really nice sort of finishing touch. They're just, just the to right size as well, because I've got some brads at home, but they'd be too chunky for, the, yeah. for that. We had the, the brads um, specifically manufactured oh, so okay. that it didn't take away from the design element. Well, this is it. You don't want kind of big chunky corners detracting from the no, artwork. No, that's right. So. Um, and there wasn't anything out there on the market for that size. Um, so, yeah, so they're really good and you'll find that you're, it's a really quick and easy way of attaching your parchment. So, good question, Ross. Thank you for your email. I do apologise for changing so, your name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so all we're going to do now is put that extra frame on the inside. So again, these are great as standalone plates yeah. just to do the different layers on. See, so when oh, we turn that look over, at that. Look how crisp you've got that a really is. nice crisp. And that's what I love about the system, is it, it, it is crisp yes. every single yeah. time. And straight, because I wouldn't get it straight. Yes, no, no. And tra <laughs> so traditionally, you would have had to use a white pen, yeah. and then you'd have to learn that pressure to get it equal. Okay. Okay. So now the plate mate comes into play. Lovely. And we're going to take the this one here, which is 
Lucy's folk art flowers. There's but you haven't got to worry flowers. about that because you're going to get all of them in there. Okay. Okay. And then all we're going to do, we're just going to take those flowers nice. and we're just going to infill the different areas. Oh, I see. Okay. okay. So I just pop that into place. Take my tumble dry shape. What I'm going to do, I'm going to turn it because if I work at the top, mm -hmm. it gives me more room to lean on. No, that's rather fine. than sort that's of hang tip. over the, the edge of the table. That's a good tip as well. Okay, so you can just take your design. I should have gone a little bit wider on the border. So what I'm going to do is just stay within that frame. Okay. Okay. And no. then. Which is so important. Just uh, letting you guys know, you can see at the bottom of the screen, we're getting busier and busier. Getting busy for the starter kit as well. It's really good Excellent. to have you um, on board, getting involved. Um, obviously, we're busy for the one-day special. We've got um, a little less than 23 minutes to take advantage of the one-day special. We've only got 20 minutes within the hour because we have our three-minute break. But, yeah, to, do get hold of your one-day special sooner rather than later because at the moment, it's a fine guide as to whether you'll get it because of the time or whether you'll get it because of the stock. So, yeah, just keep checking those baskets. Okay, so you've got options. This is where we're talking about the masking area. So you can overlap the previous one you've done, but then oh, what I you do that. is you just don't go into that line. Oh, okay. I see, right. So okay. you just go around and then you stop where the other ones are. Yes. Okay, so you create that effect of, of the stamping. Yes, it's okay. like, uh, like you say, the masking, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So you, you've got those flowers there, but what Karen's actually done, because I've just realised what she's done, it's all about the fact. If I take that little flower there, mm. okay, you've got oh, that. Oh, the little diddy one. Yep, so you've got the little flower there. Yeah. So what Karen's done is she's taken that one first. Yeah. She's probably shouting at the TV shouting at me, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't read read her instructions. You see, and then I could put that one oh, in right. there. Okay, so you put that in the middle. And you can line up the centre with the line circle. Line up the centre, and then you go round the outside, and it creates That's clever. a bigger flower. So if this was a stamp, you would have had to have stamped out that middle one first, yes. masked it off, yes. tiny little mask, and then gone over the outside. It's kind of quicker than stamping in some respects, though, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. See, so we can see now how it sort of starts to That's build up. Nice. So what we're going to do now is jump to one that's already been done. <laughs> Very proud moment. We've got Carol. <laughs> Carol is emailed in. Hiya, Hi, Carol. Carol. Do you know what? Carol has gone for the one day special and the starter kit. She's wanted to get involved wow. for a while, and this is the hour that she's decided to take the Brilliant. plunge. Carol, Fantastic. you are going to love it. Can you keep us involved with your journey? Because yeah. you are brand new to this system. So when Paul's back, of course, the 6th of, um, 6th February, of February as well, yeah. make sure you get involved with that hour as well. And let us be a part of your journey. That's right. I'd, I'd love also, that. on social media, we've got um, Groovy point, Worldwide. Yes, yeah. On yeah. Facebook, we've got two groups. We've got Groovy Worldwide and we've got Clarity Worldwide. Um, and Groovy are both uh, fantastic mm. communities. Mm. Um, and, um, and people share what they've made. They ask questions. The design team are on Always. there. There's somebody there and it's to just help full you out. Of, full mm. of inspiration. It and really, everybody really is. got started where you got started. Yeah. Taking the plunge, going for that first kit, maybe those first plates, but then you'll probably find yourself actually giving advice to other yeah. people. Several months down the line, you've walked that walk, so you'll be able to help them and on it, their first stages. That's as well. right, and it's great because what happens is because you're new and so you, no question is ever a silly no, question. If no. you don't know the answer, it's not a silly question. So never be afraid to ask if you're not sure. They're a lovely bunch. Um, because it may be obvious to some people, but not mm. to everybody. That's true. Okay. Welcome, so what we've done here, we've gone through and we've created a sort of a beautiful floral frame, really. Okay. But what um, Karen also did was she actually pico oh, cut one look. as well. So this would be great that you could actually put a picture behind it as well. That's so you nice. can use that. So that, again, that's where the pico frames really come into play. And it saves so much time, doesn't it, by actually cutting that out? I mean, yeah. pico cutting is very, very nice to do, but yep. maybe the prettier pico cutting yeah. more. You want to concentrate more, more on the individual exactly. design yes, yeah. rather than boring sort of on the outside. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
So what we're going to do now, we'll do a little bit of white work. Oh, OK. OK. So for, for Carol, who's just yeah, bought so the starter kit. Yeah, so you're watching, Carol. Have you hit record? Because okay. you're learning loads in this so hour. So in the starter kit, we've got the black mat. OK. OK. And it's hard on one side, which we've been working on. So it's great for your tracing out and colouring in, because you don't want to give any give in the parchment. Because I remember it being said before that the, the parchment doesn't know if you're using a pencil or using a tool. No, So that's, that's where right. the mat comes in, the, the mat hard comes and in the soft. Okay. Yeah. So if I try and do white work on a solid thing, nothing's going to happen. Okay. Because there's nowhere for that parchment to stretch. It needs to stretch into the mat. Yes. Yeah. So therefore, what we've got on the soft side, of, on the reverse of that, we've got a soft side. Okay. So in the starter kit, you've got the tool that then now says the number three okay. and the number four. So I'm going to start off with the number four ball tool. And all I'm going to do is, again, this is, I hope you got the groovy guards as well, it's Carol. It's a good point, Because yes, it's a yeah. real good, uh, mm. in the accessories kit, it gives you your um, extra parchment and also That's a good your point, groovy actually, tabs you're getting as well. 20 sheets of the parchment in there, which, of course, with your, your starter kit, you'll have some parchment in there, but you'll be doing loads of projects in no time at all. And do you always start off with the number four ball tool you and work your way down? You start off with the biggest ball tool that will go into the area. Okay. So for those that have just gone for the start, Carol that's just gone for the start kit, then this will be the thing. And as you get more confident, you get more into it, then you go for the Pergamano ball tools, okay. which we've got on the show. Um, and the biggest ball tool on that is a six mil. Okay. okay. And how does that fare with this one? Is that bigger so than the one go. that you've got here? Let's have a look. I've got okay. my six I'm mil. I'm learning with you, Carol, on this one. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So, yeah, so there's a big difference in yes, the size. Yeah. So, um, so there's the, the six mil there in okay. the Pergamano tool. And then this is what we call the number four tool. So would that be if you were working on maybe a larger flower? Yeah, I mean, you would, this would work perfectly on the one we're working on here. Oh, I see, right, because, okay. Because all it is, it's just the base of the ball mm -hmm. that is actually going into that well, area. Well, yeah, I suppose it's only making the same amount of contact, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, and you, the bigger the ball tool, mm -hmm. you'll see that I'm getting a smoother finish. If I now go to the number four tool on here, and I'm doing the same pressure. So with the smaller one, this is pu purely selfish question, are you, are you at risk of having little lines with your white work when you're using the you smaller tool, which do, is why yeah. you might go onto a larger one That's as time right. goes on? Yeah. So, okay. and, the, and the idea is to just gently stroke the parchment, so you okay. just go on very, very lightly. You're putting sort of what they call grey work, you're just putting a base coat down. Right. See, really, I'm, I've gone on heavy for TV purposes yes. over here, so you can see it. But if I go on here, it's really, really light. Almost tickling, yeah. Yeah. Um, and I, I'm conscious also that I'm on a soft mat as well. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to go on too heavy because if I go on too, this is where the safety net of the okay. groove plate has gone. Um, and I can go through the parchment. And I know you always talk about letting the parchment rest so you yes. don't overwork it. So if you were working on this at home, yeah. by the time you'd worked your way right the way round, would you be ready to rework the yeah, area I mean, that if it you're took, on? I did even want to leave it for about half an hour. Okay. So what I tend to do is I'll put a little sticky note where I've started, Okay. go all the way round so I know where to yeah. start, which is fine on the first one because you'll see the obvious difference. Yes. But then when you come to pick it up to put the next layer yes. on, it it's can be a little bit difficult. difficult to mm. see where you've started good tip. so if you just have a little sticky note then you know where to stop otherwise you'll go over the same and you're thinking this is taking forever <laughs> because you're <laughs> just, just going, going round and round and round <laughs> okay so then once you've done that then you would move down to the next size ball okay. tool so this is the number three let's just pop the groovy guard on there Busy again for that starter kit. I think you've influenced a lot of people, Carol, out there. They're taking Excellent. the plunge as well. Yeah, and then all I'm doing, I'm just gently just stroking the parchment. And if you go on too heavy and too fast, there's two things that can happen. One, you can go through the parchment. Mm -hmm. And two, it can end up looking like cotton wool. Okay, So you right. don't get that sort of smooth finish. So now when we turn this over, <gasps> you'll see wow. how it's starting to, to come to life. Oh, isn't that lovely? Okay. And it's amazing, even though we're using coloured parchment, you still get that beautiful white work as well. And that's a really good point because it is quite, I mean, you've got a lot of colour on there, but yeah. it still makes it go white. But you've got other areas that are darker. That's right. So on here, what I've done to add a little bit of colour is I've taken, let's turn the mat over so we're on a hard surface now. Okay. And what I've done, I've taken the Perga colour pens. Right. So the Perga colour pens, you get um, 
um, 30 in a set. Right. They're water-based um, pens, and you get two different nibs. So you get a thicker nib on one end mm -hmm. for the bigger areas, okay? And then if you want to go into the finer areas, you've got a, a finer tip as well. Okay. Now, if I was pacing myself, say yeah. I was a bit like Carol, and I've gone from one day special, and I've gone from my budget with the yeah. starter kit, and I haven't got the, um, can't stretch to the pens at the moment, yeah. what else could I use? If you've got, you, you want sort of like a water-based pen. Okay. Um, so you've got like distress markers, okay. stuff like yeah. that. Alcohol pen's not so good on parchment. Right. It would be fine in these small areas, because mm -hmm. with alcohol pens, the alcohol needs to absorb Right. on cards so you okay. don't get the streaking. Yes. So potentially what can happen is that if you're doing larger areas, parchment isn't absorbent, right. so you'll so get, get the streaking. Like a, right, okay. Um, so water-based pens are the better option, or pencils. Okay. 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 Now one of the great things about the coloured parchment is being able to take the colour out. See, this is really clever. Okay. So, when we're working on it, we're working on the back. Now, to put this colour on, I don't need to take anything out. Okay. So I can just go, let's have a look, I can just go straight on the back. I'm not worried about where I've done the, the white work. Okay. Okay. And then we'll just go through and finish this particular flower here. Okay, so that when we turn it over, you can see now, let's bring that Call into me watching it. So you can see. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, how it started yes, to, to put the colour in. Nice. Okay. And that looks, if you don't mind me saying, that looks a lot neater on that side than on the it other does, side. It does, yeah. <laughs> so you really haven't got to worry about the back because the back all gets hidden. Okay. Okay. So on the flowers that I traced out earlier, let me show you something here. Mm -hmm. So if I was to take a yellow pencil, okay. if I wanted these, so if I've got the Perga liner pencils mm -hmm. and I want these flowers to be yellow, right. if I colour in on the back, okay, yeah. like we've just done with the pens, Right. Okay, and we're going to put that colour on there. Now, I'm not going to do the colouring properly, but it's just for to show you yes. the difference. Okay, so if I turn that over, you've got a bit of a yellow, but it's mm. sort of like a dirty yellow. It's a I mustard. I didn't like to say that, no. but yes. Okay, so then what we're going to do is we're going to take an eraser pencil. Okay. And what you do is you rub out the colour. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, right. So, again, this is another way of giving the effect of white work. On now, is this on both parchment. sides you can do this? You can only do it on the shiny side. Okay. Okay, because that's where the colour has been applied in the manufacturing process. Right. Okay, so now I can take... It's almost made it look like the clear parchment. Yeah, because oh. it starts off its life as a clear oh, piece I of see. parchment. So now when we turn that over, oh, yes. so you could use that like to give the effect of white work if you wanted to, yes. if, you, if you're not at that stage. But now, if I take the yellow pencil, and we'll put some colour on that. I mean, instantly it's you can see... Straight away you can see that it's different. The, the difference, yeah. because it's not fighting against the coloured parchment. So you can do this if you've gone for the um, deal of the day, if you've got any of our yeah. um, designer parchment, it's going to do exactly the same. Beautiful. So now when we turn this over, oh, you that's can better, really see, isn't it? Yes. There go, if I hold that, there we go, you can really see oh, that's way better. the difference. Yeah. But Beautiful. to finish it off, to make it stand out even more, you take the dorso oil okay. onto a spot on sponge, and dorso oil comes with the crayons. Okay. Okay. And then for me, this was a real game changer, the blending pen with the these nibs. These are brilliant. So um, we've got these on the, the show. Okay. And you get 23 nibs okay. with the pen. Um, and then all you're going to do, let me grab another piece of parchment. People must get fed up of me doing this. But, Not at but all. But if Carol's only watching for the first time. Well, this is it. We're getting new viewers so, all the time. Okay. So I've put, I put way too much oil on the sponge. Okay. Okay. Now, because of the quality of the nibs, if I was to put that straight into that oil, it will just suck it up. Okay. Okay. And by sucking it up, if I then go on to the colour, mm -hmm. it's going to take all that colour off again. Right. So it acts as an eraser. Okay. Now, it would do it with the pencils, but it won't do it on the parchment. Okay. Okay. So if I put that on there, it won't take the colour off the parchment. Right. It will just do the pencil. Okay. So all I'm going to do, okay, is that. My goodness. Okay. <laughs> and there's way too much on there. Look how much oh, wow, look at that. is on there. Okay. So even then, and you'll get to, to work out, I always have a scrap piece of parchment next mm -hmm. to me, when to stop taking it off. Yes. 
and then all I'm going to do is now go in a circular motion and if I do just two of these petals and we'll turn it over just you'll that see around. and yes. what it does it sort of it turns the pigment in the pencil um, into more like a paint yes. so it gives a smoother finish so now when we turn this over you'll see oh, no. they're the two that I've sort of actually blended yes. and then these two I haven't that is fabulous okay. thank you Paul. and what I can do is I can add a little bit I can add another color in okay because it's dry straight away just put a little bit of red mm. haven't loaded up and you so can it's the see same dorsal that was on there dorsal. to start with. Yeah, so I can sort of change the colour again. And it, it sort of it's dry and I can just go in and keep building up oh, okay. those yeah. colours. See until you, you get a really sort of nice. And it's good to know that you're getting so many of those tips in there as well, because yeah. I'm guessing it's best to keep a tip for a particular colour group. For a group. particular colour, yeah. So what I tend to do is I'll do all my tracing out, I do all my scribbling with the pencils, mm -hmm. and then I'll go and do my blending. So if I've got yellow here and I've used yellow over here on a different design, I'll do all my yellow first. Right, well, makes sense. And then it, it's possible if I've, where I've done that, the red, turning it into orange, then I'll stick with the yellow one and do that as well. Lovely, there you go, um, as easy as that. Now, if you're wanting your um, blending pen kit, details are on your screen there. Such a lot um, that so you can experience with, um, obviously, the groovy system. Don't forget, Paul gave us a, a little mention there with regards to the deal of the day. Um, we are rapidly coming to the end of the hour. We've only got about five minutes left, so it'll be the last opportunity, probably, for me to show you this. And this price, I mean, usually it's a pound a sheet. It is, so it's normally, that should be 25 99 so you've got a fantastic £10 saving on that as well. Um, and you've got all 26 colours there, so it's a perfect opportunity for you to try those out alongside your one day special. So there you go, you can see you've got your A4 sheets there, deal of the day, 706302. But of course, within your one day special, you are getting some parchment, the gorgeous purple. Um, and of course, you've got your two tones of purple featuring there, which is a perfect base for you to get started with your one day special. You've got lots of floral content, as you saw with the plate yep. that you are just speaking of, but lots of content, full stop. There's yep. loads within there these is, plates. There is, there really is. And when you look at the garlands as well that you're going to get in the collection there's so many different elements on those as well that you can use for infill yes, um, and you can just pick up all the different elements from it see the, the card that we've got at the top here just above yep. the garland plate I mean yep. that the whole frame has been done the frame, that. I didn't that's, right. so that's using the lovely Jane Nestorenko frame to create out the out create the outline like the mitered edge, and then it's yeah. just infilled with that one design that is so pretty that was from Josie that was gorgeous that little beautiful gorgeous, grid work yeah. in the corners and I love the, the leaves because we saw with the leaves of the stalk it can be as tall as you want yep. it to be or as short yeah, as you want one, it to be as well there's really a, a couple of different occasions I mean the finished samples are, are tremendous can I just show you these as well okay. I mean have a look at this the gorgeous um, little flowers that Paul was working with yeah. a few moments ago again this is where you've got that cut work that you're teaching That's right, us the Pico um, cutting in there as well. Uh, I mean, the design team, as usual, a big thank you to them um, and to Karen and Maria for prepping the, the demos for me. And that's exactly what Teamwork. I was talking about. Look how tall that flower is on yeah. that particular example there. And again, that plate that we were talking about a few moments ago where you've got the pairings of the plates. Don't forget those deals that we've got for the other plates that are available. That's nice Yeah, well. this one, Karen sent me a picture and she said, is this one okay for you to demo on TV? <gasps> oh my and goodness. The bit in the middle is, Karen, but... There's a lot of work there. there's a there. lot of it. I, that I said, is beautiful. I, I'd only probably do a little bit of the Pico cutting. That's it. So. Time is ticking away. As you can see, they're a little over five minutes. Shortly, we'll be saying goodbye to that clock. You can still continue to place your orders, though, just to let you know. But, of course, you have to take advantage before six o'clock when we launch a brand new um, one-day special. I mean, it's lovely to, to see so much you can do. Through yeah. all the demonstration, go back and watch. And don't forget, Carol, I know you've invested in your one-day special and the starter kit. Yeah, well Everybody's done. going to learn so much, aren't they, from Absolutely, you? yeah. And it is, it's all about just taking your time enjoy it there's no rush if you're new to it then sometimes it's easier to trace out with the number two tool mm -hmm. first to get a more softer line to gently break the parchment and then go back over with the number one to give you a more crisp outline That's it. and don't forget check out social media get involved yeah. with groovy worldwide there's a whole team of people um, there um, Paul's there Barbara the whole team the designers lovely Josie um, is involved Linda's there as well yeah, and many of the names you will have heard from us Ronk and all the, the different yeah, team absolutely. members they will be all 
people there supporting you and helping because at some point everybody got started everybody yeah. had a go even those well, when we partial. started the mm -hmm. groovy sister we yeah. didn't know what to do yeah. we was on the internet looking at videos and stuff like that and then linda came aboard and tina came yes, aboard so yeah. when you've got experts like that that's who we go to. That's it. And don't forget, put a little ring around that turn calendar. The 6th of February will be the first Thursday of every month. That's kind of where we all meet up. Grab yourself a cuppa, yep. settle down and check out our schedule. Because there's usually three shows. Two the, shows. Two I shows. think it's 12 o'clock and 3 o'clock, I think. Okay. But just look nearer the time. Or go on to the Clarity website and we've got a, a calendar on there and you'll Perfect. be able to see... Um, exactly. And yeah, and the, the guys will update you as well, so do make sure that you check out that as well. Talking of checking out, make sure you check out your baskets as well. You've nearly only got three minutes now to take advantage of this. You've got your £10 saving, you're equating to your fabulous parchment. Don't forget, it's not just those four plates you are getting within your one-day special. You're getting the parchment as well. Gives you the ability to create fabulous cards as we've seen our Paul doing. Paul, thank you once again. Thank you, thank you, thank you everyone at yes. home. And welcome on board, Carol, and fellow newbies, because I know there's yeah. more than Carol out there who've invested in that starter kit. Can't wait to see how you get on, how that journey starts. Thank you, Paul. Thank you very much. See you again soon. So yes, as we say goodbye to our one day special, we've got a double launch of La Blanche with the next hour. It looks amazing. Then I'm back with the fabulous Matthew Palmer at 8 o'clock. I hope you can join us. Hi, I'm Barbara Gray from Clarity Stamp here in the UK. Teamwork makes the dream work and at Clarity we are designers and manufacturers of, dare I say, beautiful, top quality and award-winning craft products. We are home to the very first, the original transparent art stamp. We hand make them here in Kent and our talented illustrators are always coming up with new original concepts and wonderful artwork. In addition, we design and manufacture top quality stencils and masks. In fact, we also make precision cut reusable masks for our stamps. Since January 2017, we are also the new owners of Pergamano International, bringing together a wonderful blend of old and new parchment art. We are so fortunate to be able to showcase our newest and best products here on Hochanda and to be able to demonstrate our art ideas to you, our Hochanda friends. So if you would like to learn more about clarity stamping, stencil work, parchment art, both groovy and traditional, please join us, myself and the Clarity team, here on Hochanda for ideas and inspiration. Hi, I'm Katrina from Rowan Dean. We're a small family business that design embroidery kits. Embroidery has always been my passion and I'd love to show you how to do some of the stitches and some of the kits. We're based in Derbyshire and I'm really inspired by the landscape and flora of Derbyshire and I think other people will be too. Our kits are really easy and I hope they inspire you to have a go at stitching. Since we've been on Hachanda, we've had a great time. Everybody's been really friendly and really good. We've met loads of people all around the country who watch Hachanda and find it really inspiring. Don't forget to join me on my own Dean shows on Hachanda. And good evening, in fact, and Blanche is back for another yeah. one yeah. day special. <laughs> we make the most of Blanche when she's over here. Um, so, Blanche, we're now leaping into spring, yes, aren't we? Yes, spring and Easter. Yeah, <laughs> Wonderful products, mm -hmm. uh, classical products, and some 
really cute product. Absolutely. <laughs> You're going to really like what we've got on this show. So um, we'll look at loads of samples in a minute, but this is the one-day special. Yes. So they're iron-ons, aren't iron -ons, they? Iron-ons, yes. yes. Uh, 25 different designs of wonderful iron-ons, uh, spring with the, with the birds and flowers, mm -hmm. and for Easter with the rabbits here. Uh, really classical and we have combination with these yellow flowers and a combination mm. with uh, red or uh, rose flowers like on, on your board you yep. see this and we have a lot of different designs we have larger designs for table decorations mm. if you like and we have the smaller designs for a small bag yeah. or for, for something really small or mm -hmm. you can combine this if you like that is beautiful isn't it I mean just look at the detail to these wonderful little bunnies they're yes. so cute, aren't they? So ironing on to bags, to all sorts of things. Oh, that's nice. Yes, yes. I, I have to show it yes. directly should we, should we first. Show? Because yeah. this is a very, very good quality. I mm -hmm. hope you you know this. Look this. You can wash it. It's, it's oh, clear. good. But good. look, look how wonderful this quality is. You can stretch these. Wow, and you're no, really pulling yes, it. Yes, no problem. You, you have to look on these small writings here on this side. Okay. Look here. You see... It's, it looks so perfect, like, like a print. Yeah. Not an iron. And, and, and look here. Look. I can stretch these and everything is go to the back, to yeah. the original. Not harming it's, it at yeah, all. Yes. It's mm. perfect. Isn't and it's it? not like plastic. You can see it's, it's really, you can do it like this. It's not like plastic. Mm -hmm. It's every time it's perfect. It's, it's wonderful to wear these. Yeah. And it's our, our quality. You can wash it till 30 degrees. Oh, good. And you can, Iron it on every material you like, right? And you see, it's a perfect quality, and not the designs are so wonderful with this uh, intricate uh, writings, mm. and you smaller designs, larger designs for everything you like. Absolutely. So we can see. So it's not just on fabric because we've got loads of finished samples in here. Yes. Yeah. Here I, um, it's a combination of our decoupage papers yep. and of the iron on, yep, on one day special. And I would like to give you an inspiration what you can do at home with our products. Yeah, it's a what, what you can decorate at home absolutely. for spring, for Easter. And look, here it's a, it's a different cloth. Mm -hmm. This is a very um, large structure. Yeah. But it's not, it, it doesn't depend which cloth you have. Right. Every time it's like a print, like a professional print, mm -hmm. it's perfect. It is absolutely perfect. Look at these. I always love your, all of your samples, Blanche. <laughs> They're gorgeous. Oh, hang on. I'm, I hope that doesn't fall down now. That would be just typical. There we go. Let's get another one here. <laughs> Let's have a look at this. So the smaller yes, yes, little designs. Yes, we have smaller designs. You can combine the designs if you like. Mm -hmm. And we have a sample here in front. I, I, go here if you see where you can decorate oh, okay. your table your plate okay. uh, for your knife and your fork you can make some bag like this and put a, little, a, a small bag with some eggs mm -hmm. in uh, chocolate eggs Ooh. like a present and you can do a wonderful decoration at home you, this is li like a table runner mm -hmm. in front uh, you to one, only one of the design on your table runner yep. and decorate perfectly in, in combination with the decoupage. That is amazing, isn't it? Um, so it's seventeen pounds and ninety nine pence. You've got a big uh, ten pound saving on this for your springtime iron on kit. Uh, so you're getting uh, four. Uh, to, well, the four 12 by 12 sheets, and you've got 25 designs on there. Uh, 012473 is your item number. 